love Jewelry Maker but don't have an account, you can now purchase items on the Jewelry Maker website through our guest checkout. To do so, select the products you wish to purchase and head over to the shopping basket. Simply enter your email address and select continue as guest below. After this, the checkout process is simple. Select your quantity and delivery option and then check out securely. Enter your billing details in either a credit card or PayPal account and proceed to payment. From here, you still have the option to create an account if you wish, making shopping online easier for you. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. Are you new to Jewelry Maker? Shop with us for the first time and you'll receive a free gift. The free gift includes two beautiful gemstone strands in an organza bag, plus a DVD ideal for jewellery making newbies, featuring tutorials essential for getting started and so much more. As long as you qualify as a new customer and haven't shopped with us before, then your free gift will automatically be added to your order when you make your first purchase with us. It's really that simple. Gemstone strands are selected at random, so gemstone size, shape and colour will vary for each new customer. Why stop there? Once you receive your new free gift, we'd love to see what you create. Share your designs with us via our Facebook page and join our creative community of jewellery makers. Start your jewellery making journey with us today. Create. Wear. Share. At Jewelry Maker, we are always looking at ways to provide you with a fantastic shopping experience. With this in mind, we'd like to welcome you to our new pre-order option. Selected items throughout the day will be put on display and made available for pre-order. When the presenter informs you that the pre-order service is available on an item, this is your chance to pop it into your online basket or speak to one of our brilliant call centre team members and be one of the first to secure your purchase. Is it quite so far away? Is it close if you want? Is that too close? Or? That's a little bit close, yeah. There's <laughs> a great board. Oh, thank you. Um, hello, everybody. What day is it? Thursday. Thursday. Happy Thursday. We're doing Thursday treats. Now then, for those of you that do not that know who this very important man is, we actually normally insist that we salute. No. He does. We have already saluted. Curtsy, bowed, everybody. Um, just to, just to say, who the real bosses are, I'm being, they're being slave drivers. I, was, I wanted to go home. <laughs> yeah, oh yeah. Um, now then, can you just explain to everybody, because yep. I was about to put on my Facebook page, we have our merchandising manager, and I thought, yep. there's got to be an awful lot of people out there that do not have any understanding or comprehension of what a merchandising manager is. So I didn't put that, I just said you was the manager. So, yeah, so, one off, yes. yeah, but what, what is it that you, that you do, and why is it that when we have you on, you can do something a little bit naughtier than we can? Can we just explain um, that so that everybody understands? Yeah, of course, yes. I mean, in terms of what I do, it's with us being quite a small business in the context of you know, somewhere like um, a, a huge retailer, yeah. um, a lot of us do a lot more than what we may do in other businesses. Yeah. Uh, so you I'll definitely do. Yeah, so I, <laughs> So I look after the planning uh, in, in terms of what we'd look at of our plan for the whole year. For products, you said. For me. products okay. and shows, um, and, I, and that isn't all me, but I help okay. manage that so people can yeah, yeah. deliver that. And then we look at what our product proposition is then to deliver into the business uh, okay. and to bring new product to the shows. I then have to make sure that what we buy is the right amount, which as a merchandise you never get right. Honestly, uh, the hassle we give them. It's, it's, it's all, yeah, I'm, I'm of the sympathy here. Um, it's either too much or not enough, and it's never it's never right. right. Um, he can never please us. So then, and then how I, if it doesn't go well, how we manage that back out. Um, and then ultimately, I, I'm a bit... Do you mean occasionally things don't go well? How very dare you? Very rarely. But very rarely. Um, and then obviously that I have accountability for what we, we sat on in the vault. Yep. So there is an opportunity and um, the reason I did this, as I explained earlier, was in January I thought, you know, everybody likes um, you know, sales always start in January because it's yeah. that time of year. Everybody's yeah. been paid 
six yep. weeks earlier on the phone. Yep. With me. So I thought, let's do some treats. And Andrew signed it off. And Andrew's the managing to, director. Yep. So he, um, he agreed to the one. Um, and then it allowed me to take some pricing off where I could lose money effectively mm. without um, losing too much. So you'll notice some of the pricing is Sometimes if it's here and it's sat here, it's got to go, yeah. it's got it's taken up yeah. space. It's just semantics yeah. really, isn't but it? We, we also have a clearance day as well, so what I didn't want to do was just give you the same clearance products or stuff that we wanted to get rid of. This was an opportunity to bring things that... A legitimate maybe, yeah, price Maybe saving. more accessible, maybe things you don't normally see in clearance. Yellow sapphire, it's more, yeah. brand new Chrysocola. Yeah. Brand new shell pearl, two strands for less than I'm just I'm just saying. So there are some brand new brand new aquamarine, brand new turquoise at yeah. eight o'clock. I mean there are some yeah. stuff. The Chrysler can I just say just quickly while you're explaining, I'm so sorry. The this quality of Chrysler Cola off the scale and price point wise, when I came in today, and obviously we knew we got yeah. you and everything and we were all excited, and I saw it was a, a brand new strand, and my producer said to me, right then, it's Simon's picks. I said, is that included? She went, yeah. I said, why? It's brand new. She said, don't know. Chrysler Cola coming up as a star buy for you, presenter's pick, showstopper. As far as I'm concerned, that is a steal of the day. Yep. The price point that Simon is allowing us to take this to, it's a brand new strand and it's not, with me, to be honest, it's not the, it's not the money on that one. It's the colour. Yep. That to me is all about the colour of the Chrysler Cola. That mm. is superb. I mean, talk about on point and the price point. I got asked how much I thought that would be and I said 49.95. I said 49.95. Can I tell you, at 7.30 today, I don't care where you are or what you're doing, I don't care if you're having your tea, if you're putting the kit, uh, whatever you're doing, do me a favour, set your alarm, get that timer on your phone, set your alarm for half seven, you are not going to want to miss that, is a steal of the day. Sorry, you were carrying, I'm so sorry, I had to just do no, it no, with and, that. And, so. but, but, to, but to your point, so nothing's safe. So nothing's I safe. I want to make things We're accessible. We're not safe. With the, the things I bring to air, I try and bring things that have got a high volume so we can make them more accessible for people. So I said earlier, you know, a lot of our, our products can be quite a considered purchase. Yeah, so we if have I got can, some up, yeah. If I can take that off and give people an opportunity to buy, the one thing it is not to do is not to devalue anything. No, so these prices that's not about go back. That today, is it? This is one day, one yep, day only. One off chance. Month, that's it. And the thing is, we have got some high end salon sapphire, we have got yellow sapphire, we have got some extraordinary ruby and kyanite. So I think Simon's right there. The way I look at it is, I could get a clear quartz, yeah, great. Brilliant, fantastic. And I get all my little mm -hmm. stash and my shell pearls and all those kind of things. But if I've got a dream strand that I've been coveting for a while that I've always thought, if only, if only that could be mine, this could be your day today. And I genuinely mean that hand on heart. So it is an, a, 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 it's extra special treats that only this yeah. man can give you access to. And, it, and it's, for me, it's never, I'm, I'm not a salesperson, so it, it's not a pressure tactic. It's just that I, I'm very clear that I can only, they only allow me to do it one day. Yeah. So if cost it's too much money. today, it will go cost back up. Cost us too much because, money. Yeah, yeah. The cost. So it's a case of, case of, if you want it today, fantastic. Make the most of it. If you don't, you're prerogative, but yep. yeah. Okay. So, should we start with how we mean to go on? Absolutely. By the way, as well, um, don't panic, but I couldn't find a photograph of you, so I took one off your Facebook page. Which all the ladies what, are liking. Why and what for? <laughs> to promote you on the show this evening. Did you? <laughs> yes, I did. Well, I've not seen it. Oh, this, yeah, don't panic. I took one off your Facebook page. I kept it. Don't worry, it's fine. You're dressed. L last time that happened, my birthday card <laughs> had photos from a very long time ago, <laughs> which uh, are quite embarrassing. <laughs> No, I chose the nicest one I could find. Okay. Don't worry. Thank it's you. fine. You're dressed. I Nine it. carats of cotton sides. <laughs> yeah. We did one of these last time, a different we did. size capsule, and it's yep. sold out. Oh, yeah. The thing is, I know we all know this by now, but those of us that don't know gemstones, the bigger the carrot in a single stone, normally the higher the value, the higher the price. And it's Kunzai, it's one of the rarest gemstones on the planet. And it's completely natural. And it's a, te a nine carat stone. That to me is a pendant or a full fabulous. No, I'm sure you all know. 14.95 is exceptional. And you're probably all sitting there now, checking out as you are going, that is, the best price we've seen and oh my goodness me I love that thank you very much Simon what an amazing price point mm -hmm. that's not your price point Simon no, it's no. Like, no. Well, I might as well have gone home if that was my price point well um, we didn't like to so say I'm going to take this under 10 under um, 10 under 10 you do so, realize that's a third off well it's actually more than that because I'm actually going to take it to seven pounds <gasps> which is our lowest ever price on this we do you know what we call that on the late show are you aware what this is on the late show that you've just done <laughs> 
I remember this one last time, yes. What is it? I, I, I forget the... L-E-P. As soon as we hear that L-E-P, we know we're doing something. Now that yeah. isn't just the lowest ever price on this. That's the lowest ever price Kunzai cabochon I've ever seen. Probably, yeah. Probably, what do you mean, probably? Well, I don't know if it's... I'm telling you. I'm just saying... <laughs> Honestly, you know. Are you going to be my David Williams to my Simon Cowell this evening or vice versa? What are they on together? Do you not watch Britain's Got Talent? No. This is Jewelry Maker's Got Talent. Yeah, Nobody's exactly. watching Britain's Got Talent. They're watching Jewelry Maker's Got Talent. Jewelry Maker's Got Talent. Luckily, nobody's got a buzzer. <laughs> <laughs> they might have the app. Oh, yeah, should we have one of that? That'd be good, wouldn't it? What? We have an app. You know, like an app that does the buzzer. Should we add the buzzer to our app? That'd be great, wouldn't it? LEP. <laughs> Yeah, seven ninety five. Now then, the thing is as well. Here's a question yes. that I get asked all the time: When we do these special one-offs, yep. does it mean that because they're so good, we limit them and restrict them per customer, i.e., maximum of one or two each? No, no. I mean, it's, it's first come, first served. If you want to buy all twenty-four that we have of this limited yep. availability, then you you buy all of them if you want. And that's I think the one thing I see with this sorry regularly is the multi buyers. Oh because yeah. They see the commercial opportunity that if you're making that saving because we're not devaluing it, mm -hmm. you can still sell it to what you were originally. And this and is the thing. That, and, and this is the thing we say margins. all the time. So. It is so hard with the prices that we yeah. go to at Jewelry Maker that we get so used to the prices thinking that they're normal and they're not. They're abnormal. Yep. They're anything but normal. Yep. So today. As, as Simon's just said, if Jackie and Suzanne don't check out, Jones had two, Christine's had two, so that took us to 20 straight away. We only started with 24. Then there's Debbie, there's Glenda, there's, there's another Debbie, there's Annie, there's Wendy, there's Collectors, there's Frankie, there's Linda, there's Jackie, Suzanne. You can hear we're over-allocated already. Mm -hmm. So what I would say is, double the speed of your checkout. So if you think you're quick anyway, see if you can beat your usual checkout time because otherwise somebody else will take it this evening. So Frankie Lynn, Karen, Jackie, Susanna, I don't have that many left, so I do wish you good luck. I'm that just going to pay the one post back in, so... Well, by now, most people have paid their post and package. They're done yeah, for the exactly. day. They don't care by that point because mm. most of us from 8 o'clock this morning have already paid our post and package, haven't we? Yeah. We're done. But it's a fair point. Mm. That's my job. <laughs> <laughs> we'll swap. <laughs> You can go to some work <laughs> Oh, you've been working out? Occasionally. Oh, one. And did you say 19? Good, thank you. These are nice. I've worked out today with my personal trainer. I don't I feel my, my legs are mine. Is that why we're sitting? Yes. Yeah. My legs oh, are so not it wasn't mine. For my benefit, no, it's not for yours. your benefit, no. even though you make me look very small. Mm -hmm. No, my legs actually are not capable of supporting me for a few hours this evening. <laughs> don't say it. It's not age. Orange banded agates. Oh, do you know that they're one of the most fascinating gemstones yeah. on the planet, aren't they? Yeah. Agates. It's just, I mean, I mean, obviously they are very vast in terms of how much, but the variety of them. Oh yeah. It's just incredible. I only think there's even ones with like gastropods on them. Mm. Turritella agate with like a snail mm. in them. We had one just this. Oh, I love them. They're amazing. Yeah. But they, well, I thought they'd, 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 you could have only had a couple because they would pretty yeah, much sell out. Yeah, it was stock. You, you put Turritella agate in your... Yes. You are a bad boy. Let's not say it out loud. You're a bad boy. You're a bad boy. And this is... Br this, well, we say orange, but it's actually like an orangey pink, isn't it? Mm. I would put orange and pink on that. Yeah. Together. Are you good with colours? Well, I know what colours are. I don't, what <laughs> don't wear much colour, you, do you? Um, no, I mean, I've got a couple of pink tops. Have you? Yeah. Mm. Mm. We're going to educate you in colour. We're going to get, we're going to get Hannah Osborne to educate you in colour. Now then, N -M so how is this going to work tonight with prices? So, if, if you, right, you say what? Should we should be? be, yeah. And then I'll just take So you're going to take the glory, aren't there. you, on every single one? That's good what, for you. That's what I'm here today. That's, that's good. Yeah. Oh, see, but if you don't like him already, by the time the next few hours, you're going to love him. You're going to absolutely love him, because he's going to look after you this evening, aren't you? Yep, absolutely. You like Father Christmas this evening, aren't you? I got compared to Father Christmas earlier. Did you? Yeah. Oh, what did they say? A cuter version. A cute. But I said you can't tell with the beard, can you? Well, exactly. So, yeah. If we saw you with the beard. Mm. Yeah. He's been growing that for five years. Mm. Could take a walk, couldn't he? Get the cat to look at it. Right. Fifteen ninety-five is now. This one is going to really impress you. Okay. Simon. Yes. Dear. Yes. How naughty can we be? Because cabochons are extremely popular, and I've never—I tell you now—I've never mm. seen those before with the orange and the pink mixed in. They're fab. They're dyed, obviously. Yeah. Oh yeah. But an agate takes a dye really. Do you know what yeah. happened in the 19th century? I found this out the other day. No. 
the South Americans used to fly their grey agate, or not fly, sorry, 19th century, there wasn't a plane. They used to send their grey agates back mm. to Edar Oberstein to get them to dye their agate, because mm. you know how good Edar Oberstein are, then ship it all the way back to South America. Can you imagine the cost involved? Yeah. Because they dyed them so well. And because once it's, it's a very stable process, once it's locked in, once the dye is in, it's locked in because it's a porous gemstone, it's brilliant. So I do think that actually with agate, the dye, take, it takes some, and that polish, mm. oh, they're just glorious. So having said all that. Yes. And even, even in today's modern age where, yes, we can fly, the cost of getting this product well, we here, don't fly our things in, do we? Uh, we can do at times. It costs too much money, surely. It doesn't help. Is that when you, you and Marie bring a carrier bag back full? Yeah, pack my suitcase. Um, but so, what can but, you bear, do? but bearing that in mind, I'm going to take a little bit off. Uh, when I say a little, I'm going to take it lot? down to eight pounds and thirty-two pence. Right. You know, you've just basically said, "I, I, I, I say you buy two capuchons, you get two <laughs> free." Yes. Yes. You've just halved the price. You're better than. Have you? Or just nearly, nearly half the price? Almost. I couldn't. Almost quite. half the price. Almost it's as far as I can go. I mean, that's why, with, like I said, the random numbers you get in versus oh, the very standard. Do you know what, though? Have. That is extraordinary. That, and the fact that you've eaten, what I love about tonight is you haven't just gone for the stock. Look, let's be honest, it's sat on our shelves mm. and, we, uh, and, and, and it hasn't gone. That's what clearance days are for. That's think. what clearance so, days are for. It's still a massive opportunity because the pricing's amazing. Yeah. But this is... But tonight for me, it's the new aquamarine strand. It's mm -hmm. the shell pearls we've got coming up. The yep. popcorn slider bracelet, which should be seventeen ninety five. The price you're taking it to is exceptional. Yep. And we've got the amazing Chrysocola and the turquoise. And you've even put in, I can't believe it, the, the faceted beryl. The faceted beryl is in here. Oh, it's just berserk. Absolutely berserk. It's berserk. Right. It's brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. So, uh, yeah, fantastic deals. But as Simon says, sorry, as Simon says, this is a one-off today. So you've got to grab these either before the stock runs out or before 8 o'clock in the morning. Is that right? That's so as the show, they've got the, sh yeah, the show reruns overnight. The price would go, but also I, I effectively lock them away for a period. He does. So we, what he I does. do is risk uh, that happening again. So. He does. Um, I'll tell you what we'll do then. Um, now, we all know, don't we, how popular, if you're a regular jewellery maker, um, we, we all know how popular the slider bracelet uh, is. We'll show you in a moment. But I think when I launched them um, a, a while ago now, the first launch ever, we did, I'll never forget it, 592 in about 90 seconds. Yep. It was the most successful ever yeah. auction. Oh, absolutely. And it was voted your product of the yeah. year. So, 17.95 is where we should have been. And we've seen them on the high street for 50, 60 pounds. Okay, so what I would just say is, to now I will mention there are 60 and they're going to go like that. So, this first come, first serve, it's a Simon Picks special. Start by. <laughs> You know, I've got to be honest, I don't understand this. Okay. I don't understand. Right. And I think you're going to struggle to explain this. Mm -hmm. um, best selling product. Yep. Favourite product. Yep. As voted for by customers. Yep. We don't need to do this. No. You don't need to do this. I, I said do that, you? I said, uh, <laughs> I said earlier there's no other business I could walk into. <laughs> And justify to any of my. Uh, I don't think you can justify can I, to us today. Can I do this? And they'd go, Absolutely not. Why would you want to do that? <laughs> Why would you um, want to do that? So yeah, I mean, like I said, but our, our customer base is so low. It's not like yeah, normal amazing. retail. So we, it's a treat for you guys. This one though, I am going to say I think I was duped. You so were duped. I, I on, the, on a break earlier, I walked past Becky's desk and she said, "Can I have this?" And I didn't really click Aww. what she was asking for. Because there's what it is—the longer 24 centimetre mm -hmm. length one as well, not the 18. So yep. it's got more silver. It's three yeah, grams yeah. of silver. It's one of our best-selling items yep. on Jewelry Maker in nine years of history, and I do mm -hmm. I do not say that lightly. Simon has got the facts and yep. figures to back that up. And it is one of the easiest. If you are a brand new jewellery maker watching this evening, half the stock's allocated already. If you're brand new to making jewellery this evening, you can make the most beautiful, beautiful bracelet because the loop's so easy. All you're going to be able to do is learn either how to open and close a jump ring or do a wrap loop. 
There's only this is a, yeah. There's only about 20, 30 available. Um, you just need to be able to do a wrap loop or a double wrap loop. I would suggest, or open and close a jump ring, and you can add in there. Now, bear in mind this evening we have got red spinel, rare, faceted beryl. I mean, the kind of things that can come in. Uh, you can pop, be popping in here today. This incredible US of A turquoise, which we are making as our Today's want to must have rather, and again, we would normally expect US of A turquoise to be about 79, 89, 95. <laughs> We're nowhere near that. I mean, frighteningly nowhere near that. Okay, I am so over allocated. I started with 60, I've got over 50 of them with it in baskets. I think okay. everybody's waiting to see what you're going to do, mister. Should we go straight to it? I better not disappoint them. You surely do not want to disappoint. Yeah, a ten pound note. A ten pound note, you can turn that into a necklace just as easy, you know. Do you, do you know that you can turn that into a ne necklace? Mm hmm. And all that sexy, sexy dangle goes on the back of the neck and lovely open back dress. I'm, I'm going to get shot about this one. No, you won't. Let's not <laughs> talk about that. No, 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 you won't. <clears throat> You're the manager. They've mm. sold out. Sold out. I'm not surprised. Oh, yeah. Cal Supreme. Yeah. <laughs> These are the. Can I just say that? Thank you. No, no. Because my it, pleasure. I mean, it's, it's it nice is a treat for us to be able to do this as well. well it's the customer as well. It's just mm. great. I mean, when you hear the messages and see the multiple buyers, it's it's great to see. So. Yeah. Um, this one we've um, yeah um, just just um, um, these were yeah. Um, I don't, yeah, Sam doesn't know about these. But you don't to know a lot about it. Yeah, lot well, you know, <laughs> you don't want to know everything. Simon, that would be no, boring. Doesn't, I don't uh, know, it doesn't hurt me. Exactly, need to know. And you didn't need to know, we found. These are brand new. Good. Brand Good. new. Which means I'm going to have to take the price lower and something new for no reason. Yeah, and two Shell Pearl. Before, two days before the birthday. Yeah, 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 basically. Yeah, four mil, six <coughs> mil. Um, brand new, amazing. Is it, am I right in thinking they're textured? Ah, texture as well. <laughs> so what we'll do those, we'll do those for you in 10 minutes. You better start thinking about what price you can get. Oh, now this is awkward. Have you two chatted? No, not about oh, this Oh, well, stuff. it's your own fault. If you don't, if you fail to prepare. Now I know why you wanted me to stay on. We want you to stay on because we love you. Mm-hmm. No other reason. Yeah, awkward, slightly awkward. Baltic cognac amber, and that is going to make the most beautiful. Look at the size of the amber in there. <gasps> Whoa, and the amount of silver we're not even going to draw your attention to. Now, Simon, as a manager, can I suggest you don't glare at the producer through the gallery glass? That's it, better. Come on, face to front. So I'm, hearing, I'm hearing the what it should be, and then yeah. I'm going to work out. So it should be fourteen ninety five. I'd like to just point out, um, Simon, that quite frankly, when you've got a Baltic amber, that sort of size, that sort of quality, because it's yep. the best in the world and that beautifully set, I believe we only made... I'm just, yeah, it's a limited edition, as we always do, from yep. Mariush. So it's always a limited edition piece. Um, We've set our stall out this evening, so I don't feel that we can retract anything now. So I think we just carry on. So if I take it to that price, is it the lowest ever price? It's a, you can shorten it by LEP. We all know on the late show what an LEP is. So this is actually going to be £8.50. Oh! Which is the lowest ever price. Oh! How many in stock? Very limited. 40! Do you know at this price you could even make earrings? Let me show you what a Baltic amber earring is going to look like. with the, And don't forget as well, because it's a resin, doesn't it weigh very much? So you could, okay. oh my, what, have you yeah. ever yeah. seen anybody with dare to wear Baltic amber earrings of that size? And you could do that for less than 20 pounds. Now if that went to 16, 17, if you think about it, we've done sterling silver shepherd hooks and a head, you could make those for 20 pounds here on Jewelry Maker. You could make them for 20 pounds. And honestly, Baltic amber earrings of that size, I think you'd be talking three figures to resell. Yeah. I really do. That is unbelievable. There are people buying twos and threes, Simon. I'm not surprised. Who made you that lovely bracelet? <laughs> this was made by um, Joe and what the bracelet? So Joe, who's uh, one of the new people with me, one of our new merchandisers, and Caroline, one of our new uh, buying managers, 
They went on the introduction to jewellery making yesterday. And they're making and you jewellery. They made me a suite of jewellery. Did they? Uh, and this one. They're not trying to buy your affection, are they? No. And it says the alpaca. Oh, uh, yeah, because we all. Now, why, do, why, is, why have they said the alpaca? Why is that, Simon? Yeah, yeah, because we think he looks like an alpaca. Well, no, one of the customers texted him. <laughs> Somebody decided to play it live on air, and then it's stuck. It does and now stuck, I'm alpaca, it? Which is great. Or llama, whichever one you prefer. No, no, it's definitely alpaca. Why don't well, you like the llama? Llama's the ones that sort of spit and stuff and mm -hmm. a bit nasty. Listen, have you seen yourself at the Christmas party? <laughs> That's some of my best behaviour. For once. Uh, you know, he's very well behaved. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm sad to admit. Nice Baltic time. cognac amber, sterling silver. Which, and this is what I said to Marish. I can't believe that we don't mm -hmm. even... He doesn't even mention the sterling silver in his pieces. No. And I asked him why. Do you know what he said? Because it's all about the amber. Mm -hmm. Everything's about the amber. But the good thing with this, I mean, the amber itself, but then when we add sensor, which is such a proper category for us, yeah. I mean, it yeah. just creates fantastic pieces. Oh, well, the thing is as well, it's like amethyst, people know, but people know mm. amber. Yeah. And I always say, I have to say arguably, because there is an all, always two sides to a story, but I don't believe it can be argued. Baltic amber is the best on the planet and it's no longer being made. It's gone. So once it's finished, and do you know he said they can go out for something like 150 times and still not come back with any amber? Wow. 150 times. Can you imagine that? Yeah. And you still can not see find why anything. It's so valuable, oh my goodness me, yeah. Hmm. Now just quickly, have they gone? Right, now hang on, there cannot be many left. Nine. Now I'm over allocated though, so oh no, hang on, Florence I've got seven. Florence has just had two. Pa oh, hang on, pa Pamela's just said, oh, hang on, I've got three people just coming on the phone, and between them, they've had six. So, can I just say to the collector in North Yorkshire, in Essex, Pauline, Carol and Lynette, my lovelies, if you do not check out now, I can guarantee you that will sell out in about five, six seconds. Sorry, collector in Essex has just had two. And do you know what? If you would like to message in and thank this man, because this is, honestly, he's putting his neck on the line this evening. 60777 is your text number. Slightly text with JM Studio. And if you would like to thank this man, or make a joke about an alpaca, anything you fancy. Um, or anything you like to say next time as well. There's a good thing, yeah. For next month. Yeah. yeah. So I'll see what I can do. What do you mean, though? Anything you'd like to say? What are we talking gemstones? Uh, well, anything, really. Anything gemstone, or anything we basically sell that you would like. Or that we don't uh, sell. Or... That'd be for a different show, but yes. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Uh -huh. All right, then. Having a good time? I was just putting on Do you like coming on air? I do. I love coming on air, you Zena. <laughs> no, I didn't say with me. I just said in general coming on air. It, the first few times were petrifying, but now... I'm... You're used to it oh, now. Yeah. You don't get nervous at all now, do you? No, not really. No, he's a big, brave boy. He can cope with us. Well, I don't know what Michael's laughing at in the background there. Anyway, beautiful. <laughs> Beautiful blue opal. Now that, again, the polish that we can get on these opals is mm. extraordinary. It's beautiful. I also think it looks like a, a shiny wet soap that glistens. Yeah. You, you know soap. Uh, yes. Yeah, I'm just checking. Yes. I don't know how to do with these boys. <laughs> do they still do bars of soap? They do bars of soap, yeah. yeah. My nan used to have the pear's soap. Well, it was imperial right. leather, wasn't it? I remember my nan having it. Yeah, All right, thank you, Simon. Yeah, thank you, Simon. <laughs> Remember your nan. It's that kind of show, is it? XBGK53. Again, each time I'll give you the um, what we should be asking you to part with. And normally, if you paid 17 dollars And bear in mind, can I just say there are 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16 on there. So they're just over a pound each. Now, I went and bought some chocolates. Mm -hmm. I grant you from a handmade chocolate shop yep. in Knoll, posh, the other day for my stepdad. Right. 24 chocolates. Twenty-four pounds. They were a pound. Eight. Well, I didn't realise. He said, "You want eight, sixteen, or twenty-four chocolates?" And I thought, "Well, I'll go twenty-four." And then he hit me with a bill of twenty-four pounds, and I nearly fell over. A pound each. We're paying you guys too much. Becky's buying ten pound popcorn. You're buying. I know. I know. Pound pop chocolate. I know. I didn't realise, but it was for a chocolate. I couldn't then say, no, you're all right, though. I'd unselected the chocolates bar then, Simon. So now it's going to look even better, so I'm going to take £10 off this. Oh! And £7.95. So you know, so oh, it's just over a pound each. Oh, my word. That is extraordinary. I wish the man had said that to me in the chocolate shop. Do you want £10 off? I'd have gone, yes, please. Right. 
Can we just divide that by 16? I want to know what price that is each. That's less than 50p for, a, for, a, for an opal. For an opal. And do you know what? This is the day, isn't it? If you've seen something that you've always fancied or something that you have in your stash that you ran out of or something that you would love to get in your stash, there are so many reasons to treat yourself today. Now, Kat's just said, thank you, Simon, with an exclamation mark. I, oh, I wonder what she's going to say then. I love your deals. What are we going to say then, Kat? Um, Zuron tools. Oh, now you're asking. Double flush cutters mainly would be amazing, please. Double but, flush cutters. Becky, would you make a note of these as they... Go I tell you what, there. they would be popular. I agree with you, Kat. Yeah, double flush cutters, Zuron. Um, yeah. Sorry, I was being distracted by... <laughs> they're, um, they're Becky, up in there. Becky, do it. Do no, it. Go on, Becky. No, 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 no. Yeah, but we might be able to give you an option and you might be able to say the man from Jewelry Maker, he say yes. What's next? <laughs> Thanks, Kat. Oh, I'll tell you what. Should we give you something brand new? Yeah, let's do it. Because everything so far yep. has been existing stock. Yep. How about we do what he can do, coupled with a fantastic star buy that is brand new to Jewelry Maker that was bought for the birthday week, but... Um, just saying, stop by. Did you know that the textured shell pearls have taken everybody by storm? Have they? Oh, yeah. I mean, they're very popular. I know from a sales point of view. Well, do you know why? What? When you speak to guest designers and, they say, and, we say to, and we say, what is it you want from jewellery? They say, what, what's the best thing to have? Movement, popcorn bracelet, because yeah. you've got the movement underneath. Yeah. Texture. Yeah. So anytime time you can add texture, especially through the winter months, texture in jewellery. Right. Okay. Mm, so you're learning things tonight, Simon. I've learned stuff all day. Do you know what? I bet this is nice for you to actually come and see the product, because you buy so many things and then... Obviously, I suppose to actually physically see them here in the studio is a bit of a treat for you. It does, it flows through. It's quite funny because like, um, Marie will obviously receive them in and do a final quality check. Yeah. So we had some amazing, well, what we'd selected was amazing products and then she had to cancel most of it. Cause, Why? Well, it wasn't up to the standard that she oh, brought she would just, She's quite uh, a stickler, isn't she? Yeah, absolutely, because we want to make sure that what we, what we ask for is what the customer receives. Oh, what you paid for. Exactly, yeah. Yeah. Um, but yeah, I don't, I, don't, I don't then see much of it when it obviously what the TV's on all day, but... Mm. You know, sort of handle it and get to yeah. look at it in this detail. I know, it's nice, isn't it? Yeah. It's nice I mean, for you. Marie always worries me when something turns up. She goes, I don't remember buying this. <laughs> <laughs> and then we do buy a lot, so yeah, it's you successful. Yeah, you do. You can't do. Yeah. But, well, I was just talking about chocolates, wasn't I? How phenomenal to get these absolute, and I think those are an all year round, but particularly through the summer. And again, if you want to, inc again, for, for gents jewellery as well, totally unisex those. They are superb. Um, we're talking brand new, fabulous. I think that's a lovely milk chocolate tone, isn't it? Mm, yeah. Like a milk chocolate. Yeah. And four mil and six mil. So two of the most popular sizes that we know, don't we? Four, six and eight mil, super popular, super, super usable, terribly versatile. You can channel set. Think of all the designs that Mark Smith has used on. I know he's on the morning show today, launching the new Preziosa. Um, and... Um, we oh remind me to talk to you about Preziosa. Okay. Just a little, just a little chat. Um, but yeah, so in a lot of Mark Swarovski and seed bead designs, he finishes the ends of the jewelry with a shell pearl. So these are superb, absolutely superb. You get that texture as well. Now then, this is what's amazing. That, okay, there are only ninety nine. This poor man, even though this is his show and his idea and his prices, we've slipped the odd thing past it. At the moment, it feels like more than I've actually selected, but there we go. <laughs> oh, it is. <laughs> yeah. But you've got to do the pricing, sir, mm -hmm. haven't you? You actually forced me into it, now. Yep. We forced your hand. Now then. Now, at the moment, it is brilliant, Simon, because it's a fiver each. Yes. Well, 4 98 and 4 97 if yep. we're going to split hairs over it. Mm -hmm. I'll pack a hairs. And, uh, and I'd imagine this to... And I, think out of their price. I think most people will be happy with that. To yep. be fair, I think we're in agreement, aren't we? Yep. Four pound ninety-eight, four pound ninety-seven. I kind of think we're happy. Apparently, I'm hearing no through the camera. 
I'm going to take this down to... Can you take a pound off first round? Yeah, that's better than what I was going to do. Oh, can you... Oh, no, 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 no. Do you want to keep going? No, 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 higher? keep going then. Sure? Yeah. Okay, so I'm going to take this to 5 95 For both? For both. See, that has just taken it down to £2.97 and £2.98. I have my windows clean today. Do you know how much it cost me to have my windows clean? It was there 10 that. minutes. £16. £16 to have my windows cleaned. Does he, does he also sell chocolate as well? No! <laughs> they, can, they can see you lot coming. <laughs> £16. Yeah, I'll come no, in and do it for that's, a tenner. that's what it is in where I live. I haven't got that many windows. I haven't even got a conservatory. It probably is because we're a bit. I don't know what it is. But uh, I'll tell you what. I'll tell you what. How about. Do you think with some sapphire? Yeah, that's the fact. Yeah. Compliments to the robot. Doesn't it just? That looks. I tell you what would look nice with that. Yeah. Mm. He was staying at the New Hall Hotel next to me. I'd like to just point out, all the all the stars come and stay in the hotel where I live. Yeah. Mhm. Mm yeah. It's a very yeah. posh hotel, but it's very discreet. Nobody knows it's there. Are you paying for their windows as well? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, then five ninety-five. <coughs> now we start to be ninety-nine. Yep. And um, Sally's got two. Oh gosh, Pamela's got two. Mary's got two. Collector's got three. Janet's got two. Pamela's got two. Big long. Li We've got questions about what? The window cleaner. Yep. Oh, they've got questions for me on the window cleaner. They want. They want to report him to Rogue Traders. <laughs> He's ever so nice. I bet he is. That's He's about say sixteen pounds. He's ever so nice. That's every six weeks, though. It should make you a cup of tea. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> Dee's just said in Hampshire, thank you from Spain for the blue opal bargain, Simon. You're very welcome. Imagine how nice they're going to look. Pleasure, Dee. Can you, say, can you do any Spanish? No. No. <laughs> I had I'm Spanish fl tapas last night. I'm fluent in Brummy, but that's about it. Brummy, yes, mm. you are, aren't you? I had Spanish tapas for dinner yesterday. It's a Spanish tapas for yeah. Very nice. It's nice. Very nice. Probably stick a garlic still. Wow, fantastic prices, Simon. We love you. Lynn loves you, she says. Good. Do you feel in the love? I do, I always want yeah. to come on. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. So, how long have you been here for at this business, Simon? Uh, so, I started on Jan 3rd last year. So. Do you like it? I love you. Of course, don't go mad, will no, you? I you love it. Together. No, of course I do. It's, it's, um, it's a fascinating place to work. Um, it's the, unlike anything I've ever done before. I was going to say, it's quite no, a challenge, isn't it? Challenge in a good way. Yeah, in a good way, yeah. In a good and, way. Um, Opened your yeah. eyes, didn't it? Just a bit. <laughs> He's still in shock, our Simon. I mean, somebody turned around to me um, 18 months ago and said, where, where do you think you're going to be in 18 months? Yeah. Not travelling to India to buy yeah. gemstones yeah. and then being on TV On the telly? People. So, yeah, this is being a, on telly. a huge change to what I used to do. It is, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Mm. Now, oh, I lovely Liz. Now, Liz is one of our fabulous regular shows. Can I? Bring my windows up to you to be cleaned in, and that's much less than I pay. And these deals are Simon Tastic. How much does this pay? Liz, how much do you pay? Well, she's in Kent, though. Even so? Mm. I'm in the wrong business. I'll tell you. Janet said, Ooh. oh, hang on. Oh, Simon. Should we see what she says next? I think that was O. No, it's an O. That's oh. not an O. An O is O H. Oh, that's an O. There is. I can't get away with it. We like you and your deals more, please. No, Janet likes you. I'm only allowed on once a month. Yeah. That's the rule. Yeah. Yeah, he's only allowed on. We've all tried to get him to be a presenter, having none of it. Too busy. No. Too busy. And we'd upset Michael. Honestly, if you beat Michael to being a male, the first male presenter, as in like... No, I oh, can't do what Michael does. I, I, can't, I, I can't talk. Mm. Mm. I can't talk by myself, so if I was sitting by myself right now, this would not be entertaining. Come and say hello. Come on. He's ever so jealous about Simon this evening. Very jealous. We've got a bit of a got a bit of a problem this evening. We have. There's no problem. Take the price, are we, mate? <laughs> <laughs> you don't think there's a problem? There really is. Um, anyway, how do you have, darling? Better. Right. We have less than ten available out of nine ninety nine. Ninety nine. Ninety nine. It's not the best number for a brummy, is it? Or a black country. Ninety nine. I heard that's why we did ninety five. It is. That's that's exactly why Stephen it did that. So ninety five is better for a brummy than ninety nine. Ah, <laughs> uh, again. Now Labradorite. Again. Customer's favourite. Ev yeah, every year yep. bar one. I heard one in one in six, wasn't it? Yeah. So and what? And then it was Tanzanite. Yeah. 
So, oh. understandable. Oh, man, look at those blue. Oh, did you see those purples then? <gasps> oh, and it's a really good strand as well. That's got to be Madagascar. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to hazard a guess that that's going to be from Madagascar. The colours we get from, Mad from Madagascar are... I mean, and everybody goes on about the original source, uh, Canadian. It's much lighter backdrop and all that kind of thing. But I just think the colours that boom out of a Madagascar mm. Labrador are incredible. It's like you can't turn it down. Look at that. Every single one. I'm not even, I'm not even carrying on through the rest of the strands. I just want to carry it just... But it's almost like Labradorite, mm -hmm. Opal, I fell in love. And that's their, like, that's their wedding. Right there. <laughs> They've joined forces. <laughs> Do you not see that? Uh, uh, yes. You need to come it's into a, my world, Tyler. It's an amazing analogy. It is, though. It is. He's fallen in love with an opal, and that's their wedding day, right there. And that's their babies. Yeah. Yeah. They've been, they were quick, obviously. But yeah, Labradorite. Now, do you, do you wear much jewellery? I don't, to be honest. No, not at all. Tell you what, though, we get told a lot that when. Gents are making jewellery with Labradorite, they prefer the non faceted I can imagine so, in terms yeah. of the way it will catch the light and yeah. make basically sparkle. I mean, yeah. the one thing I would have about these, I mean, I would, well, whilst I wouldn't wear jewellry, I'd still buy this stuff to collect. So yeah, that, exactly. when I see the rough form of the things, Oh, you collect I stuff, do you? Well, I collect some of the roughs. Oh, um, okay. So, yeah. I mean, that, this as well, it's rough form is amazing when you yeah, get it the, is. Yeah. the Labradorite and shine on yeah. so. Yeah, it is. Yeah. They're fascinating. So what can you do on this one then, lovely? So I'm going to take this right down straight away, £5.65. How much? £5.65. Do not do so that with I, that your was, knuckles. That was a... Oh, honestly. Oh, my word. Again, I'm not being rude. We don't need to do this. Yeah. It's Labradorite. It sells every time. Mm -hmm. I, I don't mean that rudely, but it does. Yeah. It's my bank of products. I yeah. know it's always going to be it's, there. It's our staple. You know, this it's like your milk product. in the fridge and your toilet roll in the bathroom. You know, it's things that you just, we don't need to take down. But you are so fantastic to us. You are so loyal. You are so supportive. The messages that you send in, the gifts that you send in, everything about you is phenomenal. And it is such a nice treat to be able to have him in and actually giving you the chance to do something exceptional and give you chances to either stock up your stash, make a stash, add to your stash, or, in my opinion, the best thing to do as well, get the beautiful gemstone strands that are a little bit more high-end that you wouldn't normally be able to justify to yourself. And if you're a new customer, the well, prices you see today add to further strands on, which I guarantee are above a certain price, it's because I picked them myself, and a DVD to get started. Are we allowed to say what that is? Yeah, so I, so I always pick, um, it's a random selection, but I pick everything between sort of £5 retail to £20 retail. Okay. So when they pick it out, you know, to try and make sure that you get about a £20 value in total okay. of gemstones. So they get sent of, two genuine gemstone strands yeah. for free. People were texting brand me last new time order. they were getting ambers, they were getting pearls. Pearls. Um, so there's, you know, I don't exclude anything from that pot. It's not me going, the stuff we don't mm. want. It's, it's, mm. yeah. it's guaranteed between that value. And, and they get a DVD now as well. Get a DVD as well. Get started. Yep. Brilliant. That's really great. Good. That is great. Mm. Thank you, lovely. Oh man, now this is what we're talking about. This is what we're talking about. Now for me, can I, oh no, see I don't know any of these prices today. I'm as in the dark as you are. Okay, now what I will say is I have been told that we only have the last 16, that's one six available. Oh my goodness me, they're good. That is pretty much what I would describe as the pigeon blood red, isn't it? Best of it. I mean one of those, just one in a pendant. With a briolette wrap, that would that would be all you'd need. It's six, oh my goodness me. So we're talking Madagascan again. I tell you what, we all desperately want to go to Madagascar, Simon. We, well, we all do. Oh, I tell you what, it's just it's just the best place for gemstones, isn't it? But you have got here, look, one, two, three, four, five, six, am I counting two, four, six, eight there? Eight pendants. Now, if we were to put add that to one of our sterling silver chains. And we've, let's face it, done sterling silver chains mm. for less than four or five pounds yep. when we do these naughty hat trick deals. Well, we've done some today, haven't we? Oh, yeah. yeah so. Now, if you add that on to a chain, you're only going to need a little bit of sterling silver wire, which yep. we bring to Joy Maker quite often, mm. and our sterling silver chains, the array and, and plethora and variety of our sterling silver chains is, is, I think, second to none. I really do. 
You add one of those pendants, which is striking in itself, just one of those, or add it onto a beautiful pearl necklace. Now, let's just go on its own. With a sterling silver, so sterling silver on the high street, 20, 30 pounds for a standard chain. You know, really, so say 20, let's go conservative, let's say 20 pounds. Plus your ruby of that calibre, are we talking three figures again, surely? Effortlessly. So. Ruby. You have to be careful as well, Simon, when you give ruby to your loved one, and you love them. Well, if I'm giving it to my loved one, I think that's... <laughs> I think that's no, already... but perhaps you haven't told her that you love oh, her yet. Right, That's what I mean, you've got to be so careful. It's my future love mm. for if I give it me. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. It's, quite, it's quite a big thing. It's a big step. <laughs> yeah. It's a big step, yeah. Simon. Slightly risky as well. Yeah. Mm. So She's going to love Ruby, though. So this should be 69.95. And you can see that because yeah. of the quality. Okay, so I'm going to take it to a lowest ever price. This is one of those ones I didn't Will know you? about. So I'm going to We've take only this. got 16 left, you're not too exposed, come on. But to make it more accessible, I'm going to put this £39.50. pence. Blimey! For, and that is a beautiful oh, strand. Oh, Riley. Now that's the kind of thing when I joined the business I didn't even know or think we would be able to do. So then I've just taken, what, £30 off the price then Lowest ever price, left. <gasps> LEP. Oh my word, they are extraordinary. Can I just say, first person from Essex, I won't say names just in case people are trying to um, to treat themselves discreetly the amount of times I get told off at outing people, especially with that colour tone. And isn't it great to get a beautiful, beautiful actual fully fledged drop? Because that in a drop earring, I think particularly, yeah. would look Superb. And the great thing is, you could take the because you've got eight. Well, I've got eight on mine. You could do a pair, a pair, a yeah. pair. You've got four pairs of ruby earrings. You'd make that back in one sale, surely. Yeah, easily. Easily. Now, Sandra, Helen, our lovely Nicole out in beautiful Florida. Um, can I just say, in fact, so far, I don't know about the collector in Yorkshire, but it's all the ladies are coming in for those. So no men are buying them. Well, give. then we don't know who the collector is. Sure. But other than the collector in Yorkshire, every other, and my friend Sally in Nebraska, grab those quick. Um, oh, Be My Valentine 2020. Is this Michael? Yeah. I don't think it is Michael. 2020? Why don't you want him? Yeah, because we've already had Valentine's this year. Uh, okay. Come on, Simon. Can you imagine a Simon and Michael show? I think a we should do it. A fun dozy Liz, yeah. I think me and Michael should do it. I think you should. Mm. I think you should. I think that'd be good. Um, right then, um, Sally, my darling. Uh, lovely Sally. She's amazing. Uh, Candice, uh, Sandra, K Nicole. How many left, sweetie? We have, uh, we had 16. Eight have, sorry, let's strike that. Nine have gone, by my reckoning, Oh, hang on a second. We've created a little bit of the wait on the phone. Now, the thing is, you can ring the phone lines, free phone, 0800 644 655, press option one, boom, you're straight through. But when I say straight through, sometimes if they're busy, you have to wait a little bit. And in that time, so you can swoop in. Yep. On the self service checkout, because you beat the queue, don't you? You go on your self service yep. checkout most of the much time. E much easier. And the app. Got the app as well. Yeah, tap the app. Tap the app. Oh, look at him. He's that trendy young person that goes, tap the app. Hardly younger. <laughs> oh, all right. How old are you? Uh, 33. 33. I'm hardly young. Uh, 33. He's a baby. Well, let's put this way. Becky refers to me as the old man, so... It's 33, girls. Ladies and gentlemen, what do we think? 33, young? Pretty old. Pretty old. Thank you, Dan. Cheers, Dan. Thanks. Don't listen to them, because they're all young. They're oh. all young. Oh. I don't know why I'm here. Anyway, now can I just say, at that price point, for that calibre, my goodness me, that is superb. Don't forget as well, we have a certificate of authenticity as well, and they're only 25p. Yeah, definitely add it, especially yeah. when you're saving so much. Yeah. Definitely yeah. add Yeah, well yeah. done. Have you lot finished? Oh, my, have you, uh, are you on talkback? Unfortunately so, yeah. Oh, this <laughs> I made oh. the wrong decision. Look at the time. Now, yeah. how long are you staying with us till? 
Ten o'clock. <laughs> Ten o'clock. Ten o'clock. Uh, no, no, oh. no, 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 no. I'll be here until just after eight. Half eight. Shake on half eight. Come on, half eight. Just, let's see. Come on, let's shake on it. Let's, let's see how quickly we go through the auction. You might be able to resist. Okay, start by. We're all ganging up on him. <laughs> I wouldn't mind, he's the manager. He's looking at us all as if he's getting, excuse me. <laughs> Um, right then. The customers have got my back. You know what, darling? The customers have got my back. Oh, they are. Oh, yeah, don't worry. Now then, oh my goodness me, you know the river we've just had? You know the river we've just had? I tell you now, we have started bringing in, and we've got to thank you for this actually while you're here, because we keep all raving about it, the microfaceted strands yeah. we've got coming in. Mm -hmm. Spinel, tourmaline, the chrome diopside. Yep. Unbelievable. Well, that's Marie, I mean, oh. the range is fun. Now then, Linda was talking about this the other night. Linda was talking about this the other night, saying when we first started on Jewelry Maker, yeah. microfaceted. Um, let me turn this down. Sorry, microfaceted strands were thirty pounds mm -hmm. and worth every penny. Yeah. Because of the work. Now, if you just managed to get those ruby drops, yeah. We've actually bought in for you. Super. Now look at that pop of colour. Look at the strength of those rubies. Genuine rubies. Uh, I'm just going to mention as well, they are not Fisher filled, they are not heated, they are not dyed, they are the real deal natural rubies with the most decadent depth of colour, full on saturation of red ruby, rich, rich red ruby. And I think, now recently we did a fantastic chrome diopside strand microfaceted and we were all knocked out because the quality was off the scale and it was 34.95 and they sold out yep. now this is a very mm -hmm. very similar similar caliber natural mm -hmm. ruby as well like that ruby. simon yep. that's just just brilliant and two mil micro facet and it's we were, we were saying about this they should cost more because it's not just the it's not the fact that they're small in the two mil and then a hand drill through as well, which is, I don't even understand how they even attempt that. Yep. But then I've, I've actually tried to facet and polish a gemstone out in India and mm -hmm. I failed miserably, obliterated a smoky quartz, 300 million years old in about five minutes. Yep. Absolutely ruined Incredibly it. Incredibly Not intentionally, but yeah. yeah. But then because you've got micro facets, you've got extra facets. Mm -hmm. So it's not just that it's a small gemstone in the sense that it's micro. Those facets are, there are a multitude of extra facets, way more than there would be on a standard gemstone. Yep. So you've got more, even more work. Yep. Now this to me, I'm going to tell you now, we're starting with 94. I would be checking out right now is what I'm going to say to you. I'm going to, I, would, I would honestly urge, you're going to be so happy. And again, remember, there are only two gemstones. There's one gemstone on the planet that is harder than a ruby, and that's diamond. Only a ruby and sapphire at nine on the most hardness scale. So they can easily, easily withstand being stacker bracelets in ruby because of the strength of it because yep. the hardness of it so there it's not like it's a gemstone that's soft and you have to be worried about it you can wear it however it's you really fancy cool. yeah. yeah it's really hard now then do you do you want to go at what we should be me personally i'd go to this to your price i'd go straight in but it's your call it's your call you two i just think that price you're you, you've just i don't know what do you think I don't know. What do you think? What do you think? Well, it's a start by, isn't it? So. What do you think? It's good. so naughty. It's under ten pounds. Did you hear him then? Did you hear what he just said under his breath? Then did he just gave it away? He said we're going under ten. Under ten pounds, that is. I tried to mumble it so. Ah, so ah, ah, ah. Oh my word! You know what? Those of you with two in each baskets, I'd, I'd extend that as much as you can. Nine ninety five for ruby that good. Natural. Natural really ruby that good. I think that's my favourite deal you've done so far. I'm not surprised. That, that is my favourite deal you've done so far. Yeah. I mean, that is extraordinary. Do you want to see it with the yellow sapphire we're doing as well? Yeah, he's only doing the yellow sapphire as well this evening. This one here. Thank you. 
can I just say thank you on behalf of everybody? Look at that. Sapphire and Ruby. Um, because effectively they're twin yeah. sisters. Mm -hmm. Yeah? Now, you know, I said we had 94 of those. We don't any longer. We've already got less than half the availability, and they are absolutely flying out the door. You cannot check those out quick, quickly enough. This is today. I know there's a lot of you on the telephone to our call centre. Might be worth seeing if we can put a call in, actually, Becky, um, and warn them of the kind of deals that Simon's doing, because I think it's creating a little bit of a weight on the phones. I know it's free phones, so you're probably thinking, oh, it'll be all right, but obviously the volume of these items isn't very big, is it? Not at all. And to be fair, when you download the app, I did this with two girlfriends in the pub mm. recently, we were sat there and we were talking about it, and I said to them, download the app. They were done and registered within about less than, less than a couple of minutes, it was it's done. It's really easy, yeah. Super quick. So even if you're not very really confident with sort of technology, basically, yeah. it's still really easy to do and easy to follow. Yeah, absolutely. Really Credit card? Yep. Debit card? Yep. PayPal? Yep. All of those? Perfect. We accept everything. Yep. We're not picky, are we? No. Not fussy. And what I love about it as well, 30-day money-back guarantee. So if you decide it's not for you, for whichever, it is, I, I grant you, it's hard to part with items. I was saying the other day, I was really yeah. embarrassed. Customer my message in and said, how do we send things back? And I said, I don't know. I'll have to look it up because I've never sent anything back in four years. I was like, I don't actually know. I had to go and find out. Annalise said, oh, um, lost for words. Now, that's not like Annalise. No. She's not normally lost for words, are you, that's love? That's good, then. Yeah. Oh, yeah. That, that's Annalise happy. Yeah. That's, that's Annalise very happy indeed. Now then, I'm just going to mention this. Jackie, Lynn, Lynn in it, that's two Lynn's, I'm not repeating myself. Lynn in Ayrshire, Lynn in Devon, Nicole, uh, Samantha, L oh hang on, what name's that? Oh hang on, it keeps moving. Lelanya, oh that's nice. Collector Sandra Shirley, Olive's just coming on the phone, I bought two. Jacqueline's on the phone, Shazza. Sneaky little two checked out there, lovely girl, I do not blame you. How many left then, sweetie? Okay, so we are approaching, are you up at your... I tell you what, you've just made everybody so happy with that. Like I said, when we do this, the more the more opportunities we give, the better. Yeah. So I don't want to come on with oh. ones and twos and be able to please a couple of people and I can try and please hundreds. Oh, that's yeah. a nice way to look at yeah, it. Yeah, exactly. Spread the love, Simon. Yeah, as much as possible. Oh, he's a good lad, isn't he? 9.95. For, I keep saying this. Any gemstone, microfaceted, under 10, is a giveaway. But natural ruby like that that is just phenomenal, truly phenomenal. Now then, after the break, we look at the glisten on that, look at the glitter. It's yeah. like glitter across the surface, isn't it? Yeah. It's like the top of the sea. Yeah, absolutely. Um, now then, after the break, again, it's another brand new treat. Now I know that this has been put into the show today, mm -hmm. hasn't it? Yeah. Do you know about this? I do know. <laughs> It's got so many new things. The chocolate shell pearl textured were brand new. The aquamarine is brand new. The chrysocolla, which is exceptional, and the turquoise are all brand new. So this isn't just items that, as I say, have sat on our shelf and we 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 uh, we can't sell them. <laughs> no, brand new. Don't look. So, don't no. Don't hide. Be all right. Is, this, is is why, Andrew, this is why is I need the, to leave. Is the managing director in tomorrow? He is. I've got to meet him with him first thing in the oh, morning. Oh, awkward. Let's hope he hasn't seen. Did he call it or did you call it? He's called it. Oh, I bet he has. Yeah. <laughs> so, 9.95. Just quickly, there's a whole big, long list of you. We've got less than 20 available now. We started with 94. Less than 20. Obviously a sellout. Quite simply, I knew you would, because if we take a, a strand like that to less than £10 by this lovely man, there is no way that's going to sit around and hang around for long as it's going to be gone. So well done. Good for you. Right then, after the break, the brand new strand of absolutely natural aquamarine. But again, like the ruby, there's only 100. So good luck. Our jewellery maker community is a fantastic platform to share, 
learn, chat and make new friends. So why not like our Facebook page and join over 64,000 like-minded people. If you have a question or a query for Jewelry Maker, then you can contact our call centre on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Or alternatively, you can email help at jewelrymaker.com. Are you new to Jewelry Maker? Shop with us for the first time and you'll receive a free gift. The free gift includes two beautiful gemstone strands in an organza bag, plus a DVD ideal for jewelry making newbies, featuring tutorials essential for getting started and so much more. As long as you qualify as a new customer and haven't shopped with us before, then your free gift will automatically be added to your order when you make your first purchase with us. It's really that simple. Gemstone strands are selected at random, so gemstone size, shape and colour will vary for each new customer. Why stop there? Once you receive your new free gift, we'd love to see what you create. Share your designs with us via our Facebook page and join our creative community of jewellery makers. Start your jewellery making journey with us today. Create. Wear. Share. He's having a lovely time. He's yeah. generally sending the break in the yeah, do you know what he said in the break? He went, Oh, doesn't everybody send in nice messages already? Yeah, well mostly. <laughs> we don't read out the ones that aren't. No, I mean, All the dirty ones. We just giggle at the dirty ones. We have to say, can't put those on. They're much tamer than ones on the birthday. Oh, I know. There were some naughty ones coming really? in then, weren't there? It didn't help that Marie was in the gallery. So yeah. She was Read playing them all yeah. But it's a bit of fun, isn't it? Yeah. Lots of people are nice. Now then. Ooh. Mark Smith's going to be very jealous. I know. I think I originally selected this one for the morning with Mark. Because Mark was on. Well, he can't and have everything. Ended up in the late trip. Sorry, Mark. Sorry, mm. Mark. I did ring him earlier. He didn't answer though. No. He's learned. He's learned. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, no, he does love his aquamarine. He does. He does. Yeah. And I tell you what. Why. Yeah, you can say. But this isn't any aquamarine. You know, sometimes you do the lovely milky aquamarines that look a bit more opaque. Oh no, 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 no. This is full on clarity. And the frustration is sometimes blue doesn't come through very well on the uh, camera. So that actually looks quite light, but it's got a beautiful, perfect aquamarine tone. Now, I know we talk about bridal, but that's something old, something new, something borrowed, something blue, but you want that gentle tone of blue that isn't going to detract from the rest of the selection of the bridal gown or the tiara or the flowers or whatever it might be. That is about as innocent an aquamarine as you could get. 
isn't it? Don't yep. you think? And the bride's supposed to be innocent. She's in white after all, isn't she? Mm -hmm. So the jewellery's got to be innocent yes. as well. Yes. And inclusion free. Inclusion, inclusion free. free. She's Inclu got to be pristine. She's got to be beautiful. She's got to be perfect. I've never heard a bride describe as oh, inclusion yeah. free. Absolutely. Well, she will be in those aquamarines. Um, now, I'm going to ask a question, mm -hmm. which I got asked earlier. Hello, Kerry, by the way. Never had a swap. Um, if I were to show you quality like that, and we are banging on about quality this evening, because if there's one thing that our lovely Marie and Simon, when they go out on these gemstone buying um, expeditions, is you are looking for the best of everything that we can buy. Yeah, absolutely. We want to be best in market. Yeah. And that's going to mean, what kind of things you look for? I think, I think for me, we always go with um, an idea of what we want. Yeah. Um, and it never really transpires that way, because it's no. what's available in the market. Well, Mother Nature's um, going to deliver, isn't she? Exactly, yeah. So it's never really exact. It's not like normal buying, just where you can brief and you know what you're going to see. It's, yeah. it's very different when you get there. Yeah. Uh, from a quality point of view, it, it's all on Marie. Uh, I, I've learned a lot over the past year with Marie in terms mm -hmm. of what the gemstones are, which yep. I know sounds really basic, but when there's so many of them. Oh, it's, we're still learning that. So, yeah. um, you know, I've learned a lot about that, but Marie's expertise, uh, and you can see that now, I think, yeah. compared to where we were. Yeah, yeah. So, you know, and that's what I mean. So, we had some products in last week that any other circumstance we probably put onto her, she went absolutely not because they are not what we asked for. Okay, good for her. So, and all that's happening the behind the scenes that you don't know yeah. about. Yeah. You know, and this here, the sparkle of these, and we have said in there that they're natural because yeah. of the incredible quality. We are very super proud of this strand. And I bet you Mark Smith's actually very happy that we've got it on the late show. And what I mean by that is he will be home by now. And he'll probably be buying it. And yeah, that's the thing. Because the poor thing about Mark mm. is he will not buy when he's on air. He has got a secret purchaser sometimes. He's got a personal yeah, sure shopper. Has, but yeah. if they're not okay. available, you know, he's got a secret signal that he changes every show. Is it? Yeah. Do you not know about this? No. Yeah. Yeah. You'd, like half the time, you'd never know he's doing it. Hmm. Yeah. But he'll be at home this evening. Hopefully, oh, he'll have had his tea by now. He'll be fine. He'll be sat there with a little glass of red, relaxing, treating himself to aquamarine like that. They're faceted, beautiful. Can you see as well? You see in the background there? All that lovely fire coming off those. Yeah. Oh my goodness me. They are so beautiful. I mean, I think those, as I said, added in with some lovely pearls for a bridal piece of jewellery, that's going to look stunning. Yeah. I mean, that's all, though. I would say, you know, when we talk about the phenomena of the, um, the incredible quality of the gem putting of crystals in Swarovski in Austria? That I'd almost, almost say, I don't want to say it's a genuine gemstone, I won't confuse anybody, but it's almost like it's, it's as good as a Swarovski crystal, but yeah. in a genuine gemstone. That's when you know it's good. Yeah. And, at that, and again, if I hold those up there, look, just away from the blackboard, you can see there, try and find, do you, do you damn this, try and find an inclusion. And the facet work. That's one thing I'm most proud of with jewellery maker. Yeah, the gemstones yeah. are fantastic. Yes, the quality is fantastic. But yeah. then when they're brought to life and actually faceted, as good as they are, yeah. that's testament to the, the length of our uh, of our relationship with our lapidarists. It yeah. really is. Yeah. And yeah. how they do it as well, it's just... Isn't it a shame yeah. we can't show it to every single jewellery maker customer? Yeah, I mean, we tried to do it with the Facebook Live. Yeah. Or over the last time, to try yeah, and... Because yeah. you know, I know the customers love to interact and yeah, sort of yeah. see what's going on. It's fascinating. Um, but it is, yeah, it's just... Yeah, that's so traditional still uh, yeah. in how they do it. It's just yeah. amazing. Oh, when you think about it with aquamarine, there are certain coloured gemstones that are incredibly popular. You think aquamarine is an actual colour. It's not one of these colour, it's not one of these colour charts where it's a hint of whatever. It's an actual colour. Aquamarine, turquoise, and that's because of this beautiful, light, yet energetic, beautiful incredible as i said it's like an innocent blue what i mean by that is there are certain blues that are quite you know you think of a salon sapphire you think of a quad a tanzanite you think of a lapis lazuli a kyanite they're in your face blue they're high impact this yep. this is more luxurious more subtle more gentle more if somebody wore that with like a ball gown or something and you saw at oh, a yeah. party you wouldn't question that it was yeah. have you done that personally <laughs> no. literally brings Just out checking. my eyes now <laughs> we've well, been to university haven't you uh, Are you a university boy? No, no, I didn't go to university. I went to either. two lectures and Did realised you? it wasn't for me. Well, at least you signed up. I didn't even sign up. Decided it wasn't for me right. before. I wanted to get to work. Yeah, I said. Yeah, I didn't, I didn't want to go to university. I wasn't that kind of person. Anyway, are you ready? Now, those of you, uh, here's a little heads up. I've got a lot of collectors with it in their baskets. 
If he hasn't proved our lovely Simon what he what he's made of already, then I don't know what you're waiting for. I really don't. Now, you're probably thinking, like me, about a £50 strand, probably, knowing what mood you're in this evening. That's probably what you're thinking, Forty nine ninety five. OK. So that's... Twenty nine ninety five. Yep. Yeah, that's so what... All, so I've already made a £20 saving on what you thought it was going to be. On what I thought it was going to be, but yeah. perhaps I thought wrong. Well, you have thought wrong, because it's definitely not that. OK. Now, but that's not quite good enough You've started today. giving things away now. When you start putting your hand over your mouth like that, I know you're going to need to go again. Has anybody else noticed that? That's my tell. Have you seen that? That's his show and tell, isn't it? Have mm. you noticed when he does that look? When he starts doing that, or he leans back, or he's like that, mm. it's like he doesn't want to say... It's the nerves. Is it the nerves? Yeah, of what I'm about to do. <laughs> so I'm going to take a uh, further £10 off this. Oh, I'm actually going to take it down to £19.95. Off again? For a 20 carat natural aquamarine strand. So we're talking just less than a pound a carat of aquamarine that good? Yep. And the lovely thing is about this, I don't want, it's difficult because when we've got Simon in and he's doing these managerial one-off prices, it's very difficult not to get hung up on the price, isn't it? We're all thinking price, 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 yep. price. We really shouldn't. You think about the ruby, the microfaceted ruby, the that we've just done under £10. You think about the ruby drops that we did earlier. You think that we've got red spinel and beautiful chrysocoda coming your way, yellow sapphire. We've got salon sapphire. I mean, we really haven't even scraped the surface of what we're going to do over the next sort of hour, hour and 20 minutes, as long as we can snaffle onto the lovely Simon. Um, in fact, at half past today, do you want to see this with the Chrysocoda? Which is a br both of these strands are brand new to jewelry makers today. We've never had them on air before. They're both absolutely brand spanking new. So you could use those together, couldn't yep. you, if you wanted Easily, to? Yeah. I mean, they are just extraordinary quality. I know we're talking about the price a lot this evening, and I kind of apologise for that, but you know, it's such exceptional pricing. But to get a strand like that. And one that, that everybody knows. Yep. Aquamarine. It's one of the most popular gemstones, coloured gemstones on the planet. That's what I said. Nothing's safe. No. Really. We've spotted that with you. I'm probably going to do it. Do it properly. That's a fair point. Yeah. If you're going to do it. Do it properly. You know, do half yeah. a job. Mel just said, thank you, Simon. Lovely to see you on screen again. Good. Thank you. Aww. You got him to smile then. And uh, our lovely Angela has just come in and she just said, Hi all, loving the show and the prizes. Wow, building a big stash. Oh, good for you, Angela. Good for you. Now then, listen to the people with it in their baskets. You know what to do, don't you? In fact, would you like to do the basket shout out, Simon? Yep, so we have. Uh, can you just. Uh, would you like me to pop over? it over for you? I just thought. There you go, Flower. Swipe, swipe it over so I can see the location. There you go. So we have Sandra in Leicestershire, mm -hmm. we have a collector in South Yorkshire, Carol in Greater Manchester, Leslie in Kent, Durham, Denise in Nottinghamshire, by Mina, and collector in Yorkshire, Jackie in Kent, Alison from Greater Manchester just jumped in as well. Do you live near Nottinghamshire then? I've just moved to Nottinghamshire. Have you? Well, I've just moved back. When did you move to there? Two weeks ago. Did you? I've got no furniture. It's great. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I went so, to the theatre in Nottingham not long ago. Did you? Yeah. Mm. What did I watch? Oh, something about what was the girl? What was the series with the women in um, in the prison? Bad girls or something was it? Orange is the New Black. No, there was a. Yeah, it was something like Bad, Bad girls, girls the music. My friend was in it. My friend oh, was in it. It was really good actually. Yeah. It's actually mm, really good. Yes. I what, wouldn't have gone to what it normally. What part did she play? She played like the sassy footballer's wife that's str glamorous and strolls in and struts oh, and stuff yeah. at the end. She was brilliant. Hayley. In fact, it's her birthday tomorrow. Anyway, 1995. Well done, everybody. Thank you. Oh, Pamela's up too. Yeah, I'm surprised. Good for you, Pamela. Why not? Why not? You know, when you've got a deal like that, you've said, in fact, you just saved yourself £20, Pamela. Yep. £20 saving? Buy one, get one half price. Show where you want to look at it. Well, if you buy two, you saved yourself £20. Well, I'll have another. Yep. <laughs> well done. Well done, Simon. Oh, my goodness, Mina. Look at this. Oh, my word. Oh, my gosh. That is... How many carrots is that? 470. Four. And look, do you know what? The shapes. Mm. I mean, you. I'm not being rude. You've picked up an obvious. You've picked up an oval. Look. No, but hang on. Look at that one. Look at that. Yeah, I'm going to hold some up. It, it, we've got to look, 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 look. 
He's going the wrong way. He's going the wrong way, isn't he, actually? And you've not seen it. You've not seen a shark going in reverse. What's wrong with you all? He's doing back propeller. <laughs> we've got squares. We've got trapezoids. We've got ovals. We've got cushions. We've got beautiful, gosh, the most random shapes. And if I show you one with a larger um, surface area, look at what happens with, the, uh, with that single beautiful line of light to give you that chatoyancy, that ripples. The camera doesn't do it justice it doesn't... in terms of the effect. Only no, 18. The eight, did you say 18? Oh dear. Isn't Lion King the sort of supposed live action version coming out soon? I think it's already out live available. action, isn't it? It's not out yet, is it? I'm sure the live action's already out. No. no. Dumbo? That's the film, not you. <laughs> Sorry, I just suddenly thought Dumbo. Oh, Dumbo's, <laughs> Dumbo's out and Aladdin's out. Lion King's not out yet. But can you ma I know it's a tiger, but can you imagine going in a really cool design with a tiger's eye to Lion King? What about the film or the live action theatre thing? No, the film, the oh, movie. Oh, I think it meant like the live action theatre thing. No, oh. that's, yeah, that's been at the theatre for a long time, <laughs> Poppy. That's why I thought it was out. Yeah. Did you know what happened about that with the Lion King? No. I went with a friend of mine, mm -hmm. old managing director, many, many years ago. And uh, anyway, he took me all the way down to um, London. It's yep. a big treat. Like my boss, took me out. Yep. Anyway, we walked in, he had this altercation, the man in our seat. It all kicked off. You're in my seat, you're in my seat. Anyway, I'm stood there, really embarrassed. He's my managing director, I'm really embarrassed. Anyway, really excited about seeing Lion King. Anyway, he turns around, he looks really worried. And I went, what? He went, slight problem. I went, what? He said, our tickets were for last night. <laughs> said, and has oh. he managed to get the bloke to move? <laughs> no, the guy oh, was having no, he was like, no. So, uh, yeah, so, um, yeah, but we got in and apparently we got the seats, but they hadn't been checked at the door properly and we got there and apparently we were supposed to be there the night before. So we had to pay all over again. <laughs> Costly. So, uh, yeah, but there you go. So, yeah, um, have you seen it? The, Ty the theater, light, I'm light not a, much of a theatre girl. Oh, well, you know, that's why we wouldn't get on. Anyway, 470 carats of Tiger's Eye. Now this is, I've got to tell you, this is the most extraordinary deal Simon's about to do. So we've got, we can't guarantee you the number, but we can guarantee you a massive array of different shapes and sizes of Tiger's Eye. All genuine, all African, all natural. I happen to have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. I've got 15 there myself. Yep. 15. So... And bear in mind, do you know there's actually two shark fins? Look, 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 look. Two shark fins. Mummy shark and baby shark. Shark's tail. That's in that film. Now, Simon. Yep. Sir. Sir Simon. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. We're having a bit of a conflab. So I'm, I'm going to take this down to... He's smiling. He knows he did. That, based on the amount you have there, yeah. less than a pound a piece. So twelve pounds forty-seven, so half the price of what you can. Half price. Half price. Half price. Yep. Now you would think, how many did I say? Two, 15. four, six, eight, ten, twelve. So really, we should go two, four, six. Really, with That's what free. you've just done, That's we should free. we should give you that. Yep. So basically, we're giving you that, 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 that. Yep. For nothing. And those customers that make jewellery will go, well, I can make money on those, and that's pure profit. Pure profit, absolutely. And again, tigers are never gone no. out of fashion. No, no. You go and watch um, Antiques Rose show, things like that. Mm -hmm. The second one of their jewellers sees a tiger's eye, which is very infrequently actually, they go absolutely bonkers. Mm -hmm. Tiger's eye, mass, and again, in vintage jewellery, huge. Yeah, works really well for both genders as well, because I mean, it's something I would, if I wore jewellery. Well, you know, you had a massive tiger's eye ring, don't you? One of the biggest singers of all time. One of the most handsome singers of all time. Elvis? Yes, yeah. Elvis. Well there you go. Right, See, so, yeah. Elvis Presley had the biggest yeah. signet yeah. ring in Tiger's Eye. Absolutely oh. loved it. I learned so much when I'm on a... You do. We all do. <laughs> most of it useless. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm over in a pub quiz and I get... <laughs> <laughs> oh, I love Elvis, though. Elvis is amazing. He's got the same birthday, isn't he? Well, I've got the same birthday as him. Because he was first. All done. Did you hear that then? That was mean. I Director Dan just that went. He's the other side of the glass. Yeah, <laughs> Dan just went. Was he? <laughs> That's 
fine. It's fine. It's fine. I'll have to be dealt with later. Okay. Oh, I like that. Look at that that's one. That's amazing. It's, See the way it's aligned that... right in the middle. Yeah. Mm, that's natural. Mm. Isn't that incredible? It's unbelievable. Malachite. Mal Malachite is... The... What I love about green gemstones, every single green gemstone has got a uniqueness about it. So if you think like you've got a prionite, it's like a leek green. Mm -hmm. Then you think about a peridot, it's like the brightest party popper lime green you've ever seen. Then you think about chrome dots that are about as rich and dark but glowing as possible. And then you've got malachite, which is like this... The only word I can think to use with this colour of a green, it's like a savoury green, like mm -hmm. a spinach green. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, I get that, yeah. It's just... But what is fascinating is, as you can see there, look, that's a, that's a completely different sample in there. Every single one will be totally unique. Now, in that example, we've got six. In my example here, we've got five, so that will mean nobody's getting shortchanged. It'll just mean the ones in my parcel still add up to 195 carats, but some, a couple of them will be more, will be slightly bigger. Whereas if you get a packet of five or six, then obviously if it's six, you're still getting six, but they're slightly smaller. Yep. So that's how it works, Guaranteed. isn't it? Based yep. on carat weight. Yeah. Yeah. Now then, malachite. If you if you <coughs> have a little look for malachite jewelry, malachite. Te there are certain lines of jewelry that tend to certain gemstones that tend to. Um, Dictate a higher yeah. buy price or yeah. higher sell price in jewellery. Yeah. Okay, just either for location or just because of how rare they are. Like mm -hmm. you think of Grand Didier, right? Yeah. Still can't believe the deal we did on Grand Didier, right? But there you go. Um, and malachite is really highly sought after. So bear all that in mind mm -hmm. when you do what you're doing, Smiler. So. Okay, so we should be thirty-eight ninety-five. So if you think I've got one, two, three, four, five. Yeah. What's that? So I'm going to take it to a. Oh, I'm not getting involved on that one. You can do that one. Uh, so I'm going to take this to nineteen pounds and seventy-five. Say that again. Nineteen pounds and seventy-five pence. You might, you might want to shout that one. Nineteen pound twenty saving. Do you go to the football? Um, not, not that, no. not often, no. Go to the rugby. Um, my good friends play rugby, so I watch them more than anything. Just trying to think what would make you actually shout. Shout? Yeah. Um, nope. Road rage. Oh, do you, oh really? No, I'm, not, I'm not that bad. Oh, I can't it's imagine you having road, so. road rage. No. How is it? Not, how has it been back in Notting Nottingham? If I could say it. Yeah, it's glad to be back. Yeah. yeah. Is it nice? Mm. Feel oh. back at home. You what? Sorry. Feel back at home. Oh, you haven't moved back to your mum and dad's. No, no, no. Oh, I'm no, just checking. I'm just checking. <laughs> <laughs> checking. Not that there's anything yeah. wrong with that, but. Oh, flash new pad, they're nice. Yeah. Mm. You need to get some furniture then, don't you? Yeah, um, hopefully the sofa's been delivered next week. I'm selling a chair. Are you? Yeah. It's got cowhide on it. Maybe mm. not. No, no, maybe not. Okay. <laughs> not, not 19 vibe, pounds <laughs> and 75 pence, which is superb. Absolutely. On Malachite, your code, if you want to check out, is LCNV41. 195 car carats of malachite. Now, am I right in thinking, because I can't see any effect there, are they completely natural? Because we sometimes re yeah. do reconstitute. Now, if that was yeah. reconstituted malachite, yeah. I could kind of get my head around it. Yeah, we tend not to. Um, yeah. At all, really, if we can help it. Uh, but yeah, near everything, Marie Slick says. And the great thing is, if you, the thing is, it's a little bit like, if you think about it, if you, if you buy Baltic Amber that we have, Ideally, we want as many inclusions in the Baltic Amber as we can because that's the fascination. That's the history that's yep. locked into the time capsule. It's the same thing with your malachite. Ideally, where you can, if you can get either, there's one or two ways to look at it, either a specific marking like that beautiful spot there, or if you can't get something as unique as that, it's these layers upon layers upon layers, like you get in a Botswana rag. That's what you're looking for. And if you can get it to that degree... It's like a slice of history, isn't it? It like is. Yeah. Yeah. And you think, as that lies across the landscape, mm. how, with that fineness, just how thin and compacted mm. that must have been on the in the planet. Yep. Amazing, Amazing, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. Just incredible. Absolutely incredible. So, um, well done. I'll tell you what. Here we go. I wonder how long we get the thing before I end up talking. <laughs> well, you know, I just like to keep you busy, flower. That'd be, tw that'd be 24 pounds, please. <laughs> Go on a few window cleaners. <laughs> uh, now, this is something I want to say to you as well. 
Mm. And I've been saying this on air a lot lately, the quality of our emerald coming through. You don't put it on the set. What are you I doing? I couldn't reach. Let's put it on the set. It's on the set. I've been noticed, though. It's a disgrace. Did you see that, then? <sighs> they don't put it away, boys, do they? He's going to say, clear it up yourself next time. No, joking aside, Simon, the quality yeah. of this emerald we've got coming through the door at the minute is superb. Yeah, I mean, um, I think we saw the birthday stone we did for the emerald one. Go on. Uh, the, I mean, Prakash sourced that for us. Yeah. Uh, and the price they managed to get for us, so the quality was. It's, 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 it's real mm. high-end-looking, yeah. knock, you know, knockout mm. emerald. Mm. But it's like somebody's got the pricing wrong. Isn't it? Uh, do you, do you know what I mean, though? Yeah, yeah. I think it's just, the, like I say, the buying power and, and forming well, a really good what, relationship with Prakash yeah. and his team that he's been well, able to... Can you just explain yeah. who Prakash is in case anybody's yeah, thinking, who, so, who on so, earth is that? So Prakash is... Um, describe me, he's, he's like our sourcing hub in India, so mm. he, he's the one who will form relationships for us yeah. with suppliers, he'll go and source things. Um, he's the man to know, isn't he? Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. And he's, he's progressing uh, in certain aspects of other areas, so he's helping improve our supply chain effectively yeah. in our sourcing. He's brilliant. Yeah. He's brilliant. He's absolutely yeah, brilliant. So... Oh, this is... Yeah, the reason Simon's just laughed is he's just been told the price he told Becky to take it down to, and he's actually just laughed at his own price. <laughs> Which says it all, really, doesn't it? Fantastic big size rondelles, beautiful quality, totally natural again, for a shocker of a price point. Six pounds eighty-two pence. Do you know Jan Dwyer, guest designer? Yep. She went out to Jersey the other week on holiday. Mm -hmm. Do you know what she got charged for a naan bread? Where do you guys go? No. Do you know what she got charged for a naan bread a in Jersey? A naan bread by itself. More than that. A, a... Seven pounds. Seven pounds. Seven? What, for She a got charged for a plain naan bread, and it wasn't one of them big table ones. It was a naan bread in Jersey. What? No. Six pound 82 for emerald. Six pounds 92 hmm. for these beautifully polished... For, and again, it's a little bit like we talk about with Amber. Look at the look at the beautiful, and we talk about it. And I know it sounds a bit cheesy, that fingerprint of Mother Nature, but it's mm -hmm. so evident on an emerald. They can actually, if you've got a really good gemologist, they can almost, almost, to the point, pinpoint where that's from location-wise, yep. just by those fascinating fingerprints of inclusion. Wow, it's just incredible. Amazing. And the one thing I would say is always be careful with your pricing of emerald because we've said this all along, it's one of the most complex gemstones to price because you can get the same emerald that looks the same, looks the same quality, looks the same colour and it can differ in the same mine from a dollar a carat to $100,000 a carat. And I couldn't explain to you why, only those in the know, in the industry that are highly experienced will be able to explain that to you. So you could, if, there's, if people say to me, oh yeah, but that emerald was this many carats, I said you can't do that with emeralds, you cannot compare. You really can't, but that, I'll tell you what, try and find that. I never say this because I think it's a really dangerous thing to do, but I'm confident. Try and find some 52 mm. carats of emerald that good, that drilled, good. polished, into rondelles for anywhere near that. I'll, I'll set you that challenge. Please do. In the meantime, we're going to give you a star by. Okay, rare again, mm -hmm. Chrysocola, big favourite, absolutely non-gender specific gemstone. Yep, always a go-to for us on buying chips, it's never one we say no to in that sense. Okay, is that because of the, um, how it sells? Yeah, let's be honest. Yeah. So in terms Not of being rude, let's be honest, because yeah. it's popular yeah. and it sells. Yep. So if it, we, he's going to buy something that sells, because that's his job. Um, this gemstone is prized its main reason for value and its main reason as to why it's priced is its colour. Mm -hmm. yep. So you can get different colours. So there's a different colour of, of, of a much more blue from the Congo, there's a different colour from Tibet, uh, is it Tibet or is it Tibet or Mexican? Tibet um, or Mexican? I'll Tibet. find out in a bit. I think Trust it might be Tibetan. Um, but I have to say, this strand here is absolutely knockout. 
And if you are doing, I'm going to give you a heads up, I'm going to give you a little bit of inside information here because when I came in today, Kerry, the lovely director there, bought it over and we all had a look at it, didn't we girls? And um, our lovely Becca, we all looked at it and we went, oh my word. And we looked at the, we looked at the colour and we were all like, okay, amazing, it's going to be awesome, it's going to be pricey. Because quite a colour should be. The graphics are in. Do yourself a favour. Check out now. Okay, and the price that you can see already that you're all checking out at, that you already think is amazing, is nowhere near what we're finishing up. Honestly, the price they can see now is extraordinary, Simon. Mm -hmm. That's what you can see. Yep. Honestly, Simon, if I, when I got told by Becky early, my producer, that it was going, she said twenty nine ninety five, and I went, oh my goodness me, that is incredible. And then she went, no, 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 that isn't the Simon Pig's price. I went, you're kidding. Because look at that colour. Yep. Look at that extraordinary tone of colour. It's one of the best ones I've seen. I've well. never seen it from this location. Mm -hmm. Can you say it for me? Because that's one location I can't say properly. In Namibia? Thank you, I can't say it. It's one of my words that str I struggle with. Try for me. No. Come on. <laughs> no. No. Um, I can't do it. I literally no. cannot do it. No. I've never seen it from here. No. That's why I don't recognise this colour tone. It's abs Can we get some more, please? It's gorgeous. Yeah. Well, it depends on how well it goes now. Oh, my word. Yeah, if you say where it's from, I, can, I'll buy I can't. I, literally, I can go, no, I can't. I, I, I can never get it out. I can't. I literally, no, I can't do it. <laughs> no, it's the one I can't do. I yeah. can't do it. I, I really can't do it. I'm sorry. I don't know what it is. Um, but as well, it's not just look at that. In fact, let me just show you here, look. Can I show you? You Look at the colour tones in there, look. Is it? Oh, yeah, look, yes. look, look, look. On that one, the blue. Yeah. That is a combination of the colours of the different locations that we've yep. seen from Tibet and I think mm -hmm. it's Mexico and the Congo because that's more like the Congolese there. Yep. That's more as you go towards the Tibetan and Mexican. This location seems to combine all of the colours in one in mm. one mixture. Yeah, it's incredible, isn't it? And so why on earth I'm taking money off? I don't know, don't. But you know what? Yeah, because because you because you've been because he's a brand new strand as well, Simon. I know. <laughs> Simon's like I do know Zena. Um, Lynn, Ross, Michelle, Collector, Samantha, and Karen. You might want to sit down on your crisis card. You, you might just want to think about you, sitting down. You definitely want to check out. Oh yeah. How many do we have? Okay, limited edition. Okay. Limited edition. So as it's. A star buy. I'll go a little bit more off than what I would do. And I'm going to take this down to 14 95 <laughs> which is half price on a brand new strand ah. that you've just said is one of the best colours we've oh, ever seen. Oh my word. Vivid blue, beautiful green cyans. You're practically at half price there. You really are. That is extraordinary. I mean, again, any size Chrysocola strand, let alone a brand new one, let alone huge. I mean, those would be, to me, that's sterling yep. silver wire into an incredible ring design. I mean, my goodness, mate, there are huge sizes. There you go. I did say to check out, ah, Carol, Mary and Jerry and Collector and Lynn and Collector and Lynn and Collector. There's collectors coming in from everywhere. Uh, Sarah, Cat, Mary, people having two each. And who'd have thought you could buy Chrysocola that good and buy two each? That is effectively buy one, get one free, isn't it? Yep. Okay? We're a few pence off half price, but that is effectively buy one, get one free, let's be honest. An extraordinary colour, again. Simon, I've got to say a massive thank you. I did say set your alarms for half seven, didn't I? I did say. But everybody's time is going off. Everybody's Alexas and everything, all their talking devices are the ones are available. Are all going off now. Look at that. Yeah, I've probably turned everybody's <laughs> one off now by saying that. I'm like, sorry about that. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine on there. And they're massive, Simon. They are. One pound sixty-six each wow. on rare Chrysocola. I really should do those kind of maths before I come on here. Yeah, that'd be an idea. Yeah. Highly sought yeah. after, very much. And I will say is if you manage to get a strand of Chrysocola like this, you are a collector overnight. You're a gem collector mm. overnight. It's one of those highly sought after, very much prized gemstones. And again, what's lovely is there are a lot of people, there's a lot of jewellers you'd go in, they'll have, they'll have heard of Chrysocola, and I bet there's a lot of them never seen it. Have you ever been to a jeweller's? A, a high, you know, a high street jeweller? I've never seen it. Then. Or a bespoke jeweller even? Boutique jeweller? Mm. Have you ever seen Chrysocola? No. Nope. And I, I bet you won't do either. Super, super rare. 
And again, if you set it with that lovely malachite that we've just had, it's from the same copper bearing family as a malachite. Okay. So, and uh, Paris tourmaline. Right, okay. So, copper bearing gemstone, sunstone, yep. gems, uh, gemstones like that. And so, it's, if you've got, in fact, shall I show you the, um, should we see if the malachite goes with it? No, there's cabochons we've just done. Yeah. Should we, hang on, let me grab that. Just bear with me a sec. I just want to see if this works. I might be talking absolute rubbish, but I don't know. I think really it's going to go really well. Yeah, it does. Yeah? Look, 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 look. Yeah. Oh, Simon. It goes really well. Oh, my goodness me. Now, that's going to work, because as I said, that is a copper-bearing gemstone. So that's malachite and your parier tourmaline and your turquoise, all copper-bearing gemstones. So if you'd like to do a collection and add your malachite in with those price of colours, that's going to look superb. And you basically, because they were, we managed to get them under 20, so you get yeah. both of those for £35. That is incredible, isn't it? They were thereabouts. These are one-off deals, aren't they, Simon? Yeah, yeah, I mean, like I say, even if there's anything left, it then goes back to its original price, and I basically lock it away for at least a month to make sure that it can't be shown again at that price. So it's today. And is, that, is that to sort of... The reason being for that is obviously today's the day we want to drive the volume, well, I, I have to, Look account, after I have to account for it, so I okay. have to physically say from the numbers point of view, and you know, I've always been honest with how yeah. we do the price, and yeah. we have to make money, otherwise yeah. we stop doing what we do. Well, we can't afford the license and everything else for a start, can So, we? you know, within reason, these are as, as much as I can push that we wouldn't do on a daily basis. Now, if we did this on a daily basis, we would basically go bust and not be able mm. to do it, so yeah. I have to make sure that we can Can you not do that, please? Thank you. Exactly. That's why Thank I lock you. them away to make sure they're yeah. not, you know... Now then, uh, we started with, uh, that. you don't need me, for those of you that watch Jewelry Maker regularly, to tell you that it's a limited edition piece because Chrysokyla, there will never be enough to go around. Mm. Never. It's like chrome dark side, yeah. it's like sarite, it's like, you know, zoltanite, whichever one you want to call it. It's just, and that is the most unusual colour from that location. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. There you go, stop. In fact, we'll see what the turquoise that's coming up in 25 minutes, the today's muster. Another brand new strand, another Simon special. He doesn't even know what he's doing, look. He's like, I don't know why I'm doing this. Because it's most, it's most nice to be fair. Yeah. <laughs> look, look there, Simon, you're going to pull out those actual turquoise colours in there, look, mm -hmm. that are coming through in that Chrysocola. Yeah. Now that is going to look superb, isn't it? That goes really well. It does, isn't it? Mm -hmm. That's coming up in 25 minutes, United States of America turquoise as well. Oh, good. Oh. Now, we've, we've done this before, haven't we? Or, oh, sorry, the same gemstone, and it flew out. I'm just... Aha. Uh -huh. Sorry. This makes me uncomfortable. I'll be, I'll be truthful. You did the last time we did it. I'm pretty sure at that point I said I'll never do it again. And here we are. Salon Sapphire. I would say one of the most famous sapphires in the world. Yeah. Wouldn't you? Mm -hmm. Thanks to Princess Diana, yep. Kate Middleton. That engagement ring. Do you know that Kate engagement ring? First time ever a royal has bought an engagement ring out of a catalogue. Albeit a very posh catalogue. <laughs> no, yeah. no, 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 but I mean, I mean a high end. No, but what I mean is it yeah. wasn't bespoke for her. Mm -hmm. It was, it was, she chose it out of a very, uh, not the kind of catalogue we've seen. <laughs> I'd like to just add. But do you know the lovely thing as well about Salon is everybody automatically thinks of that dark blue. Yep. Which is because of the because of that engagement ring. Mm -hmm. But what I love is, you know, when you have tanzanite and you have that. So for me, quad A tanzanite is too dark for me. Yep. I prefer about a double A grade. Right. Okay. So not even getting to the triple A. I, yep. I, my my preferred. And what I love about the salon sapphire that we bought here is you can get so many different tones of colour of salon sapphire. Mm -hmm. Everybody just assumes it's that really really quite dark yep. blue. And actually, because I like my double A grade tanzanite, that colour of salon sapphire for me is utter perfection. Mm. It's beautiful. And it's nice to surprise mm. people with something different. Yeah. So, it is beautiful. We have Salon Sapphire. Now, as, as Simon said earlier, nothing is safe in this building from these one-off special treats. Twelve and a half carats of extraordinary quality. Salon Sapphire. Yep. So, it should be a premium price. Well, Quite frankly, yes, mm -hmm. because this is what we class as. You know, when you have um, sort of you have an entry level or something, then you have like um, you get different sort of. Then you get luxury, yeah. don't you? And you get all those mm -hmm. kind of things. And then there's like a designer brand, yeah. isn't there? Those kind of shops where you go in and it's like you know, you know, two hundred pounds for a t-shirt. Yeah, this is one of the first ones that I, when I sat in a meeting and obviously I, before working, I knew about the top five in terms of your, your diamond. Yeah. But this is one of those ones that was mentioned specifically. Mm. 
in front of me is saying that's mm. that's one of those that you never take the price down. Well, yeah. Uh, and you don't get it very often. No. Um, it's yeah. And that was one of the first ones. That's why I always recognise when somebody says it in terms of and when I always sort of. Well, I would say extra all, nervous at this point. I would say of all the sapphires we have here, we have Burmese sapphire, which again, yep. sort of really sought after Burmese yep. sapphire. Um, but certainly for us here at Jewelry Maker, yep. the most sought after, the most highly prized, the most elusive, yep. I would say, yep. is the Salon Sapphire. Mm -hmm. And it's all because of that location. But the good thing about this is when you have something as premium, it gives me the opportunity on this day and this day alone, on the month, to make it more accessible. And, so, and this is the yeah. kind of strand yeah. that I go on. I, I, I'll be honest, I'm going to put my hands up. I, I, I don't know whether that's right or wrong, but this is the kind of strand I would go for. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. Because, because I've probably looked at it that many yeah. times where I've gone, do you know what, I just yeah. can't justify it to myself, or I've got this bills coming yeah. out, or whatever. Oh my. And I mean, so. I'm going to give them a hint. Can I give them a hint? No, not yet. I would, I'd put it in your basket, though. Um, yeah, I would. So, in terms of like, you know, we're looking at strands that are cheaper and we look at it and you, you maybe take 50p off that's relevant to that price point yeah i agree with this it's relevant but you also will see a huge huge save and a huge so huge a so massive this, price yeah. saving can we just i'm sorry simon this is this to me is the best deal you've done yet so this is the lowest ever price and i'm going to take it down to and you're not going to believe this this is 44.65 44, You've beaten half price. Yeah. Better than half price on something that's a hundred pounds. But again, so relative uh, in terms again, of the amount you're let's, saving. We've got to try and forget the price. I know no, that's no, difficult no. to do when we're yep. banging on about half price. This is Salon Sapphire. Now I bet with us jewelry makers and this, some of us that have been buying from jewelry maker for years now, myself included, I'd like to think that quite a few of us by now have bought a sapphire of some of some sort. Yep. I would imagine that there are a number of you now, I'll check the, the call screen in a moment, managing to secure for the very first time ever this elusive, hardly ever seen, hardly ever bought to air on Jewelry Maker, Salon Sapphire. And again, the perfect tone of blue. Yeah. And, that, and like I said, I keep on saying, that's part of the reason I do it, is to make certain things at certain points accessible. Yeah. Now, Liz... Um, am I allowed to say well done? She just said, we've had some very high-end gemstones this evening at very low-end prices. Thank you, Simon. You're brilliant. My pleasure. Oh, Liz, well done. Collector, well done. Susan, well done. I've got collectors. Anna Lee, oh, good luck, darling. I don't know whether you're going to get one. Um, there's a collector just come in there as well. Lynn, another collector. That's, that makes sense, doesn't it, that collectors are coming in? Yeah, that's sort of the commercial value to the... Yeah. <clears throat> that's the commercial um, opportunity as well, you know, from a collector's point of view. Yeah. Uh, but also those people that may not ever want to spend £99 on a gemstone. Mm. This thing hopefully gives them the opportunity to be able to do that. OK, do you know what the great news is as well? At this second in time, if you all check out, we can look after every single one of you. Yeah. So again, we'll try and bring as many as possible because I don't want to bring twos and threes and yeah. please a couple of people and they get annoyed that they can't get it. So yeah. we we'll try and bring something that's got plenty of stock. Oh my word, Simon, that is brilliant. That is absolutely brilliant. Thank you, thank yeah. you, thank you. Tell, can you write that code down for me, hon, please? I'll tell you what, I'm going to be having one of those if, I, if there's one of those going. How can well, you say no to that? And I'm getting you the ruby, so there you go. Oh yeah, oh. Yeah, obviously. Can't help yourself, can you? <laughs> He's not. Don't kid yourself. Oh, what? Oh, hello. Oh, you really are. Oh, I love you. Are spoiling us. Matches your top. Yeah. Well, I'm gonna have to have it now. Then I'll do. Look at that. Oh no, that's good kyanite. Look at the. Goodness me, we were raving on about the depth of the saturation of the, that pigeon blood red ruby earlier, weren't we? But oh my word, they're good. I tell you what, Simon, seriously? So you've got a good quantity. Oh, ish, man. Ish quantity. Where's my... Do you know, here we go. Let me show you just how good that is against the rough of the kyanite. Do you mind? Here we go, look. Yeah, let's put it like that. 
There you go. Piece of rough aconite. Now you imagine how much we've wasted getting that depth of colour. Yep. Naturally. Look at that. I mean that is incredible. We're going to have had to have wasted so much of that kind of rough to get that kind of calibre all the way, and then colour matched all the way through the strand as well, hand selected every single one. <sighs> you are brave today. You really are. Well, should be a good one of the team. No, let's go brave. No. We're not going to say stupid while you're here. <laughs> 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 yeah, we wouldn't do that. We're just very grateful to what you're doing because you managed to make some of these really beautiful gemstones. That we, and again, the, the thing is, tanzanite, you get lots of different colour tones. You sell on sapphires. You sapphires, you get lots of different colour tones. What I'm so proud of us here at Jewelry Maker is the quality of our kyanite. It is absolute textbook your nepalese location which is what you're looking for extremely difficult to mine in the in the um obviously in the environment there in the uh well, you see that's where mount everest is don't you yeah. yep. that's high up isn't it it's pretty pretty high right? yeah. as high as they get Oof. is that like the cruising altitude of a 747 like twenty-seven thousand feet or something yep. people climb it <sighs> anyway 99.95. Do you know what I love about this as well, Simon? We stack these strands. Mm -hmm. I mean, that is fully loaded. 80 carats, yeah. Yeah. Now then, what are you going to do? I am please, going, please, 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 please. I am going to, go on, because go it's on, such on. a high price in that sense, such a considered purchase. I'm today and today, I'm going to put £50 back in your pocket. What? And what? put it at 49.95. Fifty pounds saving. Yep. Fifty pounds saving. Do you want to know how many you're getting on there? Uh, a bedroom I'll take it. We've never done this before. No. no One, two, one. three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eight. I can't count. I've lost count. I'm too excited. Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, sixteen, eighteen, twenty, twenty-two, twenty-four, twenty-six, twenty-eight. I've got thirty-two good-sized kyanites on there. Okay, you've just taken kind of that colour to one pound fifty six each, my lovely. One pound fifty six. Yep. So three pound twelve for two in a pair of earrings. So you could actually make those with the shepherd hooks for mm -hmm. less than a fiver. No. <laughs> I can't even say that without laughing. For less than a fiver, you just made those. Oh my word! I've got I've got so many treats to get through. I do not want to sort of hold fire on too many things, but do check out. Oh my! Oh, they're the purple ones, Simon. Two available. Guaranteed purple. That's one of the rarest colours in a lab Labrador, you know that? No, I didn't. Purple. Purple, pink, turquoise, look at that. Ooh. Yeah, you get some of an orange as well. well yeah, it, do you know, Dan on camera, uh, Dan uh, director just said it's got ametrine purples and citrus, mm. he's absolutely right, look. Oh, they're good. Two left. You can understand why there's only two left, can't yeah. you? Now, Simon's stolen one from me. In case you're thinking, yeah, there you go, look. Oh, is that all we get? Is that all we get, a little flash? Oh. Oh, that's all. Do you know the one he stole? He's only got to take the marquee's one, look. Hey. Now, again, it's the carrot white we confirmed, but you, we definitely get purple in every single one of the Labradorites that we're getting there. I mean, we are talking about, again, high-end Labradorite. In fact, can I just draw your attention, when our new guest designer comes on at 8 o'clock, and yes, we do have a guest designer this evening, or when she comes on, whenever, whenever she comes after we finish with our lovely Simon this evening, you wait till you see the Labradorite necklace that she made and she's wearing. Have you seen it? Mm, oh, my word. Unbelievable. I bet she'll be getting these, our lovely Jo. Mm -hmm. Must be quick. Yep. Um, as I said, though, forty nine ninety five, and we only have two available. What can you do, Simon? So for each one, let's take a tenner and let's make it twenty nine ninety five. Nice. Twenty nine ninety five. Uh, we've got two in baskets already, so it is very much a first come first served. You know who you are, ladies. Currently, all the ladies going for the Labradorite. 92 carats and guaranteed rare purple. So we don't see that very often. There are definitely citrines in there. So Dawn, Carol, collectors coming in there as well. I've got somebody on the phone to the call centre as well. 29.95 on those. 92 <laughs> carats. Do you know what? 
$29.95 with the purple like that, someone I'd pay that for that one alone. Beautiful backdrop of colour. Yep. And this is the thing as well, people don't worry, people don't worry too much about Labradorite because actually it's a gemstone, it weighs quite, considerably less than other gemstones, so it's not yeah, it's too really overly heavy. Yeah. yeah. So if you want to make a big statement piece like when Joe yeah. comes in today, she's got. Is she in there, Joe? Joe, how many Labr Labradorite cabochons have you got on, in that necklace on your neck? Seven. 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 You wait till you see it later. She's wearing it. Seven. A magnificent beaded Labradorites in that one piece. Oh, my word. Um, no, now, there's, there's one left. Jackie, you're in within a whisker of getting those. Well done. Well done. Ah, right then. Um, again, it's something that everybody wants in a stash. Yep. Black spinel clear quartz. Yep. And we're going to a LEP. What does LEP stand for, Simon? Lowest ever price. Lowest ever price. Bye-bye. Strand as well, isn't it? I've got the right one there, haven't I? Uh, yeah, it must be. Yeah. That looks really unusual faceted on there. See that look? Mm. They are really unusually faceted. Sorry, I should be showing you some <laughs> So I'm like, oh, look at that. Share, yeah, share, share, and share. Look, there you go. They've got a lovely, um. Oh, it's a Simon special. Oh, you're a monkey. Well, it's been named. So I oh, yeah, you've got your name in so lights I, now. So I have to do it. Yeah, we're kind of putting the pressure on. So a rondelle, really, mm. really popular in, in jewellery, obviously. Um, great thing is if you get, think like a Swarovski crystal, or you get, a, 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 a let's say, a, a silver spacer or a gemstone that's a little bit more cost-effective, they're a great way of... Some of your more expensive gemstones, mm. like your ruby, your red yep. spinel, your kyanite, you can make those go a lot further yeah, by... Part of the metal, actually. Yeah, exactly, yeah. Like your polyfiller for gemstones. But anybody, any time anybody wants any sparkle, any guaranteed sparkle, mm -hmm. everybody goes for clear quartz. Clearer the better. If it's faceted and it glistens like that, happy days. Yeah. Makes everybody happy because you've got that glitter guaranteed as well. That sort of glittering quality. And again, just a beautiful facet work. Three by two mil. Now we've been listening, haven't we, Simon? Because sometimes people want, I've asked you for graduated strands. Yes. But sometimes we're getting a lot more requests now for all same size. Yeah, I, it does vary depending on, I think a lot of it could be steered by, I guess, designers at times yeah, is yeah, what yeah. they're using, yeah. so it is... Um, and jewellery jewelry techniques, so, so like if you do yeah. macrame, yeah. chances are you're going to want the same size. Yeah, absolutely, yeah. And I, mean, I think what we're trying to do is we, we try to bring, you know, whatever gemstone material we're bringing in, as many possible shapes, as many possible sizes and polishes. Funny finishes, you say that. Just, so vast. Do you know what though? Have you noticed? I don't know whether you've been watching some of the morning shows mm. that I've been doing lately, but and I'm sure it's the same for the other presenters. What yeah. I've noticed just on the last two Wall of Fames I did at the weekend, Saturday and Sunday, the amount of comments that were on every single entry coming in saying mm. thank you so much for the new gemstones and more specifically the shapes and sizes. Yeah. And yeah. that was on practically every entry that came in on Saturday and Sunday. Yeah. And you think how I many, meant to tell you how many that. gemstones we have mm. times that by the sizes, yeah. by the shapes, by yeah. the Polishes yeah. and the mm. it's uh, it's difficult it's huge, to isn't track. It? Yeah, I bet. And yeah, that's why when I, we always say like this, it, it's new. We there's a nervousness sometimes. That of course, there is. Yeah. At some point, we may have done it because yeah. we just it's that vast in terms yeah, of how many exactly, yeah. create basically. Yeah. Now again, the way we refer to a, a to a, a beautiful clear quartz is, and you're gonna you're gonna kill me, Simon, but it's like a side order of chips. Just goes with every meal. Right, okay. Goes with every kind of jewellery. Yeah. It's that kind of gemstone that there isn't a single... And you think of some of the colours we've had lately of gemstones. Yeah. There's been some really wacky way out there colours. Yeah. Whereas our, and our, cl our classical and some crimson and some yeah. beautiful pastel tones. This will suit everything. Even the really sort of packed out patterned agates and jaspers and... You know, this just complements everything. It's like the best friend of every gemstone. You can't go wrong. You have to have clear quartz in your in your stash. Now, Simon, yep. every time this lovely clear quartz on the on the few occasions it's been brought to air, we have brought it to air at nine ninety five. So, I'm going to obviously take. It. How do you come to these prices, by the way? You just randomly look at it. <laughs> It's any, it's any day, it's any other day where I don't have to do numbers in the oh, sense okay. of so what I have to work Okay, so you just pluck a number out the air, do you, and wish for the best? There's a reason. 
Okay. Do you want to put Carolyn Lowe on then? Yeah. Let's go 5.57. I can always tell when you're uncomfortable because you start fidgeting, aren't you? He's fidgeting with his, with his earpiece in his lap. He's fidgeting with I the wire. I get nervous because sometimes I don't know whether I've really <laughs> messed up. Overstepped the mark. Yeah. <laughs> £5.57 on that. And it's 30 centimetres of clear corset on a Simon special. Yeah, put my name against it, isn't it? Yeah, that's what you learn with producers. They put your name against it so that it has your mm -hmm. sanction. Yeah. Simon's sanction. Yeah. Five pounds and 57 pence. Now, again, if you get the turquoise that we've got coming up, if you put that with the Chrysler Cola that we've just done, with the beautiful microfaceted, and I take it the microfaceted ruby, under 10 have sold out. I bet they have, and if they haven't, they can't have been more than one. Because that was just the most incredible deal. And those rubies, those pigeon blood ruby mm. drops that you did. The drops have sold out. Yeah. Micro, okay, microfaceted, there are single figures. Now, the rubies that we did in the drops have sold out. The microfaceted, do you want to see them just quickly with those? I could show you them together, couldn't I? Because they'd go great, you know. We took, well, say we. Simon. No blame here. We're Simon. All one team. Simon took natural to microfaceted two mil ruby to under £10 on the show. Today. It's a one off deal and it will sell out this evening. We started with, I think it was 94. Uh, sorry, yet yeah, 94, and we've got less than seven available. Wow, very impressive. Five pounds fifty-seven. Five pounds fifty-seven. Now then, we've even got diamonds on the mm -hmm. show. I thought we might. Yeah, but not any, not the sort of silver and black no, nugget no. diamonds. No. So if we're going to do it, let's do it properly. Blue, blue diamonds. Do you know what as well? Everybody's commented, those people mm. I've talked to about the blue diamonds, just how blue they are. Yeah. I mean, there's no sort of question. They are full on, fabulous, really rich blue diamonds. Look at that. Before I started, I had no idea we'd be able to bring diamonds at all. And they're proper. Yeah. Aren't they? Yeah. Look at that. Faceted, mm. graduated perfectly. Now, I'm thinking, I think it sold out. In fact, it did sell out. If you got a 9.95 Simon Special popcorn sterling silver slider bracelet and you wanted to add a section of that into your slider bracelet, my goodness me, that is mm. going to look superb, isn't it? With the silver, it'd be amazing. And you know what? With that many diamonds, I reckon you get three or four bracelets out of that comfortably in a slider bracelet because the 24 oh, centimetres, yeah. you don't need to, you don't yeah. need a lot of section there because obviously 24 centimetres going underneath. So actually, I reckon you could easily get one, two, three, anything between sort of three to five uh, slider bracelets out of that and still have a good chunk of blue diamonds in there. So let's make sure the price is good then. Well, do you know what amazed me? We actually got this into double figures anyway. So mm -hmm. we actually got this under 100. So well, I, the fact that we're at that price already is... I was going to say, I, 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 genuinely, blue diamonds like that, for, um, two whole carats of blue diamonds like that, at 84 95 that's fab! But we're going to get to a new low price. Do you, know a, do you mean a lowest ever price, and a lowest ever sir? Price, so and a lep. Sir I mean. Simon. A lep. Uh, so we're going to take this to £63.25. £21.77 wow. on blue diamonds. Do you know we've got? We, do you know what? On the show later with Joe, our new guest is on, we've got a kit going under £20. Just saying. Whole kit. Blue his hands are on his head. Twenty-one pounds. His hands are on his head. He's now thinking, I'm going, have I done that right? I do that, you know. What? Everybody knows when I get when I'm really knocked out with something, I put my hands on my head. Apparently. Yeah. Mm. Sixty-three pounds and twenty-five pence. Never before. No. So if you're one of those be oh hang on a second, Michelle's just come in. She said Simon's hour is now called Ha! Thank you, lovely Simon. Uh, to be fair, Michelle, uh, it should include drinking your eyes. <laughs> make it even better. You're making her happy. Good. That's nice, isn't it? That's the aim of the game. Oh, look, you're smiling. Oh, you look so lovely yeah. when you smile. You do? <laughs> Just need to get him. Look at that lovely face. 
Back to the diamonds. <laughs> Not the Christmas really want to see the diamonds. We have taken genuine, stunning, South African, amazing, amazing quality diamonds. It, oh, just look at that when we take it out of focus and you see the actual beautiful adamantine luster yeah. coming through, all that gorgeous fire. We have got Susan, I won't say where you're from in case you're doing a little sneaky, uh, a sneaky treat to yourself. Uh, Joanne, well done. Anna Lee, I'm like, well done. Oh my goodness, what you lucky thing. Pat, Susan, obviously I've got collectors coming in, that, that goes without saying. That has never, ever, 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 ever happened before. I mean, basically, we've, you know, I think originally we started about 90 something on that, so I think we've turned the yeah. nine into a six, haven't we? Yeah. Turned it on its head. That is extraordinary. And again, do your research, please do, on the price of diamonds. They are stunning. Oh, those are the turquoise as well. Stick with mm. all the beautiful blues. Yeah. Okay, then do keep checking out my lovelies again. Obviously, limited, limited availability on that. I mean, gosh, 63 pound diamonds. Oh, my word. Uh, right then, uh, after the break, I know it feels like everything is today's must have, but to, uh, after the break, at eight, uh, just after 8 o'clock, we've got a brand new strand of United States of America. So, again, the location for turquoise. It's been stabilized, so it's going to be super wearable for you. And it's another brand new strand at an all, well, the most ridiculous Simon's pick price point. Yeah. Okay, join us after the break if you can. Our brand new Get Started with Jewellery Maker page has been created to provide help and guidance for jewellery making newbies. If you need design suggestions, hints and tips, or help with perfecting your jewellery designs, we're here to help. Head over to facebook.com slash get started with JM where our talented in-house designers are happy to answer your jewellery making questions, offer inspiration and get you started in your jewellery making journey. Jewellery Maker. Create. Wear. Share. You can now book Jewelry Maker workshops online. Just head over to our Jewelry Maker website and click on the workshop link. We have a wide range of workshops from beginner to intermediate, covering a variety of mediums. Once you've found a workshop you would like to attend, simply click on the book now button, fill in the required fields, and then press continue. This will take you through to the payment page. If you have any questions, you can contact our workshop coordinator at any time by emailing workshop at jewelrymaker.com. We look forward to seeing you. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. Are you new to Jewelry Maker? Shop with us for the first time and you'll receive a free gift. The free gift includes two beautiful gemstone strands in an organza bag, plus a DVD ideal for jewelry making newbies, featuring tutorials essential for getting started and so much more. As long as you qualify as a new customer and haven't shopped with us before, then your free gift will automatically be added to your order when you make your first purchase with us. It's really that simple. Gemstone strands are selected at random, so gemstone size, shape and colour will vary for each new customer. Why stop there? 
Once you receive your new free gift, we'd love to see what you create. Share your designs with us via our Facebook page and join our creative community of jewellery makers. Start your jewellery making journey with us today. Create. Wear. Share. Right, we've got this lovely man for half an hour, haven't we? Yep. You had a long day today. Uh, it's almost approaching 12 hours. Oh, that's not too bad. Plus the two hour journey to get here. Oh, well, here we did. And the fact that I've got to get back. And, and then I'll be back first thing in the morning. Have you finished? No, oh, thank you for joining us. Thank you. Because it's true to have you on the late show. Right, then what we're going to do, we're going to have another half an hour with this lovely man doing these naughty prices. And then we're going to have a lovely, it's only our second show ever, our lovely Joe Turner coming on the show with a kit going under £20. And jewellery and a demo. We've got all sorts going on. And then we've got our last live hour with you. It's gone. Oh, I've had a lovely time tonight. Thank you. No, I really enjoyed it. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Of course you are. Right then, again, again. One of our best selling gemstones, turquoise. Yep, absolutely. Turquoise. And again, known in the industry. In fact, over the last, I think it's something like a minimum of four years, might be edging into five now. It has, we're not allowed to talk about investment and stuff like that, but turquoise in the gemstone industry has just gone up and up and up consecutively, year on year on year on year in the industry. Not surprising. So you are going to be bucking the trend. Yeah. And I have to say that very carefully. So then, we have got, and what we might think about doing is, can I borrow a pair of scissors, Dan? Please, because, oh, we got some here, Dan, we're okay. The ri oh, hello there. Mm. Well, you can do that then, because they look a bit, so, um, a bit scared of big scissors. We might cut the strand, you know, would you mind, Simon? Would if I we cut it in a bit, I'll, I'll show it first and then can we cut it? Because yeah. I think they're so stacked together that when you get the beautiful webbing and matricing of your turquoise, if it's all rammed together like that on, mm. on wheels, you can't, and you can't yeah, appreciate you get, the effect. Just the one. You only get the one the edge of it. Basically. Yeah, and it's bit, we don't, can't really show it you properly. So we'll cut the strand without authority. Because obviously, we're not supposed to cut the strand. Because then it gets sent out in like gemstones. I mean, trouble enough, isn't it? Well, uh, yeah, just keep we must go up. So we have got an amazing United States of America turquoise in these beautiful wheels that we've got here. So again, the lovely thing is, I was saying to Simon earlier, I guess he's on to say, get texture in your designs. Well, we had that with the textured shell pearl earlier. Get movement if you can. The great thing is, when you've got a wheel, I mean, what's the song? The wheels on the, the bus, bus go round and, round and round. I know that one. Yeah, you know that one. Look, so when you've got that on the wrist, or you've got it on the neckline, what it, what's it going to do? Rolling, 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 rolling yeah. Which was a different song. Look at that, though. So it's got lovely movement. I think these are, again, great for, um, again, unisex. Hmm? 100%. Definitely colour away. Oh, yeah, unisex. Really, really cool. And again, because of that colour tone, it doesn't matter what skin tone you put turquoise on, it works. Even pasty like me. Well, I'm and hardly you. bronzed, am I? No. No, not at all. I'm like a correction fluid. Correction. <laughs> I'm that white. <laughs> but I'm it a works. Tip from now. <laughs> yeah, please do. Um, but yeah, it's amazing. Should we? Should we dare cut it? Go on. Go on. Do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. <laughs> well, let's get them off. I won't take them all off, but because again, it's nice to see the drill hole actually, isn't it? Simon, look at your hand. What are you doing? What's wrong with it? You blocked the view. Oh, I'm sorry. It's sorry, all right. You'll sorry. learn camera etiquette. And look, 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 Simon. This is what we wanted to do. First of all, it's you get to see. In the sea. Yeah, you get. Yeah, it's like when you fly over like the. Um, yeah, it's like when you go over the um, atolls in the in Maldives yeah. on the seaplane. I've not been myself, but... Well, have you not been? Oh, dear, Simon. She took, she took, she took the window cleaner. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, so, turquoise. Huge sizes of turquoise with a really good generous drill hole there as well. 
and they go up to, in the middle, nine by two mil of turquoise. Now then, do you, know, I'm sure you know, but would you like me to explain the stabilized aspect to this gemstone? What this ST stands for? Please. Okay, so, certain gemstones are porous. Mm -hmm. So if you can protect that porous nature of, that's why we sometimes, we'll be diagate, because again, it takes the dye and it sucks into those, yeah, yeah porous, porous gemstone. So, if you, what happens then is, it's a bit like fisher filling with ruby to give it a smooth surface. Yeah. So with turquoise, and I will, I, I always say this because it doesn't affect the value, but it affects the wearability. So if you want to use your turquoise in your jewellery and you can get it stabilised, get it, you know when you get your first bike, it stabilises, isn't it? While you're learning to ride, keep it balanced. Technically, that's what's happening to your turquoise. The stabilisation is keeping it balanced. So we suck an epoxy resin into the actual gemstone and it fills all that porous material and makes it much more yep. stable yep. and much more therefore wearable in jewellery, which is um, just, oh, music to our ears as a jewellery maker, isn't it? Any time you can elongate, that's why we use white tip guardians mm -hmm. and, you know, any, any time that gives that longevity to your jewellery, that's what you want, because what do you want to do with jewellery? You want to wear it. Yeah. We had one, it was quite funny because we had one, uh, an opal yeah. uh, the other week. Yeah. And it was, we, we classed it because of where it was sourced from. It was the oldest opal in the world. Oh, yeah. And he came through and he said, stabilised. And me and Marie went, And then we both sort of sat there and went, that's probably a good thing, given no, it's the oldest. Thing. That's a good thing. So, you, you know, you, yeah. you've got less yep. risk of it mm -hmm. damaging, basically. Yeah, absolutely. So, that's, that's a good thing. Yeah. yeah. That's what I mean. Sometimes we think things like that, like seeing ST like that, stabilisation, you think it's negative. Is it anything but? It's yeah. exactly a, a protection. Mm -hmm. yeah. That's the great thing, honestly. And sometimes it's just lack of understanding, isn't it? Sometimes we just don't have that... We just don't have the knowledge or we, we've been told something yes. different yeah. and we've got the wrong idea about mm. something. So it is good to have an open mind and learn about things, mm. especially when it comes to gemstones, because it can, you know, certain things can question you. But, um, but there you go. Beautiful turquoise. Now then, the code is SYNV45. Beautiful turquoise. We've talked... Uh, uh, um, do you know what? It was one of the very first gemstones ever mined, turquoise. Was it? Mm? What do you think of the Tutankhamun death, death mask covered in turquoise? Yeah, yeah if you're the pharaoh, so... imagine you're the mm. pharaoh, I bet that's not very difficult. If you imagine you're the pharaoh, right? Yeah. Loaded, about to be sent to the afterlife, sorry, but you are. Okay. And they're going to they're gonna give you the best of everything they've got to send you off into that afterlife. Mm -hmm. What do they put in there? That very gemstone. That's what they thought of turquoise. That was going to look after their very best pharaoh. Now then, forty nine ninety five. I think we all know this. It's a little bit like pearls. People expect a reasonably high price point when it comes to turquoise, especially United States of America, because you've got one of the best locations. It has been prized as a gemstone for thousands and th he's keeping his head down because he doesn't even want to acknowledge what he's doing for thousands and thousands and thousands and thousands of years. You've got the best tone there. I know we haven't called it Sleeping Beauty, so it's not from the Sleeping Beauty location. That's the, but the colour is right there, isn't it? Look at that colour. It's bright. It's blue. It's the kind of fairy tale blue that we're looking for. It is exceptional. Really, really incredible. One of the most important sources for this gemstone. Now then, Simon so dear. I'm, I've just looked across and there are already people checking out at this price. Yeah, absolutely. So I'm now just giving money away for yeah, no I'm, reason. Okay. Because I don't want to put you under pressure. You know Liz who's messaged you and have been lovely to you yeah, in Kent? Yeah. Liz She's got it in a basket, she hasn't checked out yet. Okay, so this is for Liz then, specifically. So I'm going to take £20 off and make it £29.95. <laughs> If Liz doesn't buy now, I'm very upset though. Liz will, don't, don't, shh, Liz, 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 don't feel pressurised my darling, no, it's I'm your problem. She joking. will though, because I know Liz. No, no. Do you know what, Liz, 29.95, Ali, Charlotte, Collector, Liz, Collector, Joan, Collector, got my lovely Sally Nebraska, got Collectors everywhere, got Annalie, got Lynn, got Sean. oh my word, Amy, Susan, I can't keep up with you all. 50 carats of United States of America, and it's brand new, this strand. We've never had this strand. Uh, Ali, well done, you got it as well. We've never had this strand on air before. 20, yeah, he's panicking now, look, 29, 29.91. Should we have an eye? I'll tell you what, let's go, let's throw caution to the wind. Should we have a count? Shall we? Do you think we can? Why Two, four, six, because we want to really upset you. Eight, ten. 12, 14, 16, we want to see how many you've done, 18, 20, 22, 
24, 26, 28. This graduation is brilliant as well. 30. You're panicking now. 32, 34, 36, 38, 40. 42, 44, 46, 48, 50. 52, 54. 56, 58, 60, 62, 64, 66, 68, 70, 72, 74, 70, there are 78 turquoise on there. 38p. Anybody ever heard yeah, that price? Yeah, okay, cool. Liz has got it. Yeah. Of course she has. Of course she has. And there's people like Lynn and, and having two, Collector and Cornwall having three. I do not blame you. Do you know what I love about this? Look at these. You get you get this lovely little teeny tiny size, three by two mil look. So you've got some really cute sizes there, look, Simon. And then those massive pieces. Now, Susan's just said, bought it at the full price, but the new price is ace. I wear turquoise every day. Thank you, Simon. The centre one is going as a pendant, Sue says. She wears turquoise every day. This is a really phenomenal deal, wow. That's good. I like that. Do you get it? A really phenomenal. Mm. Our jokes are the best on the late show. They are indeed. Oh, yeah. It's worth staying for. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Twenty nine ninety five. I know I'm confused though. Hang on, is the basket working? Hang on. I don't mean to. I don't mean to call you out, but now Anna Lee, Charlotte, Lisa, Collector, Margaret, Collector, Lynn, Collector, Collector, Anne, Marie, Collector, Susan, Jane, Collector. That's just the basket ears. You've not checked out yet. I can't go any lower than that. <laughs> no, no, you can't. Right, you can't. That is. No, no. Everybody knows. I think people. I think you've shocked people. Mm -hmm. I went to a nice Italian place in town the other day. Bottle of wine, thirty-three pounds. Thirty-three pounds for a bottle of wine in the restaurant. <laughs> and, that's about, and, that's, and that's good in a restaurant. Thirty-three pounds for a bottle of wine. <laughs> Think as well. We haven't even mentioned this, right? Mm -hmm. I went into, I went into a shop the other day, and I saw a pair of tassel earrings. Yeah. Okay, just a pair of tassel earrings. Tassel earrings on a stud, mm -hmm. and it wasn't precious metal. In one of these accessory type shops. Mm -hmm. £14.99. £14.99 for the tassel! Do you need any pounds for the price then? For the yeah. turquoise? Right. How many did I count? 78 turquoise, was it? 34p. 38p. 38p per. Mm hmm. Oh no, I'm just saying. Um, so, um, now the baskets are working. We can confirm the baskets are working. Mm -hmm. £29.95 for 78 turquoise, I've counted. I mean, that is extraordinary, isn't it? Absolutely. Amazing. Do you know what, I, do you know what um, Mark Smith made me with turquoise? A, a suite of jewellery? No. With amber. Oh, OK. For a funeral, actually. Which links in well with then. Oh, OK. Doesn't it? Yeah, I walked to a funeral. They wanted colourful. Right, OK. So I thought turquoise and, uh, and amber. That links on quite nice. Well, it does. That's what I thought. Yeah. That's what I told you the story. Amber. It's not just random here, you know, Simon. Amber rounds as well. Oh. Amber rounds. Oh, there's no way you should be popping these in there. You did say nothing, I think was safe. Oh my word. Oh, oh my. They're 10 mil rounds, Simon. What are you doing? Oh my. What? Do you know what? Do it. Do it. Do it. I mean, I don't even want to mess with it. Let's just straight in on this price. Come on, let's do it. There's five left. Five chances. 44.75, 10 mil amber rounds. Oh, I take it. That, is, that, is that a... That's another lowest ever price. When Marish was here recently, he was talking about just how difficult it is to get amber in round. Just how complex it is. Mm-hmm. Now it's we probably our most popular shape as oh, well. Oh, yeah. So. Well, yeah but you hardly ever get it, though. Huh? Hardly ever, hon. So, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. 10 mil rounds. I'm over allocated already. 10 mil rounds of amber. £2.23 each, and as I said, way, way over our allocated is very much now. And you can again, you can see this, you can see there's in incredible inclusions in every single one, which is exactly what you want. That amazing, amazing.
Baltic amber fossilized tree resin. And the great thing is you've got high impact, you've got a big size, you've got practically zero weight because of it being a tree resin. Yep. So that again, uber wearable. ZJGY89. All I can say is, in fact, there are two left. Surprise, that One left. left. Surprise. Go on. Do you know what? For that, you actually get a round of applause. I have to say. Never tire of Amethyst. Never. It's like your favourite song. You know the favourite song that you just, every time it comes on or your favourite movie, you've got to watch it again. That's what you get with Amethyst. Look Heat. at that. What? Heat. Heat. Favourite film. What's that? Never no. heard of it. Never heard of it. No. Okay. Anybody else heard of the film Heat? Anybody of our age heard of the film Heat? What's it about? Bear in mind this was filmed probably late 90s, early 2000s. Heat. It's got De Niro and Pacino in. So it's heat. not like heat, it's just the one word, heat. Mm, no. An amazing film. I'll, I'll set that to watch then. You should, you honestly should. Okay. I like De Niro. Mm -hmm. I like Al Pacino as well. Yeah. Oh, I like Al Pacino. One of the only films where they're both in the same sense. Oh, so, so, so. oh okay. Mm. I shall have a look at that then. Thank you, Simon. Mm. That can add to my list. So, incredible, huge, and what I, will, what I will say is you've got exceptional colour matching there. I mean, that shouldn't be underestimated, the, the, the quality and the time that it takes to colour, to colour match like that. Yeah. It's, paint, it's painstaking at times. Oh, yeah. Terms of. Okay. I'm going to take, because uh, I am running out of time, so I'm going to take this to a lowest ever price. Yes, please. I'm going to take it to £19.95, so basically half the Halving price. the price again. Dan, you are an absolute angel. Thank you, sweet pea. We are just now, look at that in a jeweller's window. Oh, yeah. Now, if you were to open a textbook on gemstones and you looked up amethyst in the index and you went to the page... That, if that greeted you, that would be exactly what you're imagining, isn't yeah. it? Hmm? Michael, that is really loud. Could you stop it, please? I'm oh, sorry. I don't think they, I don't think they realise how loud it is when it gets amplified in your ear. I'm oh. waiting for him to offer me one. Well, he's, he's got a big chocolate biscuit in there, and Simon's looking all hopeful. He feels like he's earned stop. one. A big chocolate biscuit. <laughs> Do you like a wagon wheel? Um, I wouldn't, no. No? <laughs> I mean, I'll eat one if it's in front of me, but I wouldn't... Oh, OK. Oh, the chocolate receipts are available. <laughs> yeah, that looks beautiful, doesn't it? 90, that's half price? Half price. Lowest half ever price. Lowest ever price Lapp at half price. Lapp oh, you bring in chocolate soon. Oh, oh you used to Oh, people don't complain. Oh, right. oh well, I don't Here want Here you go, Dan. <laughs> <laughs> Big, big carrot weight. It's not the price point, no, it's the quality. <laughs> they are extraordinary. Absolutely fantastic. Beautiful amethyst. See, I'd be tempted at that price to use the whole lot in one go. Oh, that price, yeah. Could afford you then, couldn't you? Yeah. £20 for a necklace like that. Yeah. Looks a bit nice, doesn't it? Yeah. Just catch... Is it... Can I ask a man's point of view? <laughs> Sorry. No, but it's not often this that we is, get... This is one of those... This is always the question where I should just run away. No, it's, it a never be, never... it's a genuine okay, question. It's a genuine question. Try me. I am, what does I it make you think when you see a lovely lady in beautiful jewellery like that? So if you were to see a lovely lady like that in a, in a restaurant or at the mm. theatre or wherever it is you go and they're wearing exquisite jewellery, like, what does it make you think? Classy. Classy. Mm. Does it? Mm. Does it capture your attention? Yeah, it draws the eye, doesn't it? That's yeah, the whole that's, point of it, see, that's, that's what I think, yeah. Cash it's just nice to hear, because obviously we adorn ourselves, ladies and gentlemen, and you just, you know, you just wonder what the other person thinks, don't you? The mm. person looking at you, you know, and I just think it's really nice to hear your, you know, boy's point of view. Thank you. Right, should we do another deal? <gasps> oh, yeah, should we do the faceted one? OK, is this... Yeah. Oh, so is this my last deal? Oh... I can I ask? I've, 
I've got to go. <laughs> should we make this the la Should we go out with a bang? Let's do this. Let's should we go do, out with a bang? Yeah, okay, let's do this a big one. Okay, because we're waiting for Joe as well. I guess it's on to come on. Um, so, yeah, should we do it? Yeah, okay. Simon's final extraordinary star bite deal. Christmas Day, Christmas Day just gone. Yep. Mark Smith and I had the and Becky. All right. And me. So needed. To I know. I know. You just tell me. Yeah. We're all needy on the late show. <laughs> <laughs> I, I've noticed. <laughs> <laughs> um, no, joking aside. On Christmas Day, lovely, lovely Mark Smith and I got to launch, and we it was incredible. It was Beryl. I always remember getting excited and him ringing me up, going, we got Beryl, got Beryl, because I went, mm, OK. Thinking, why is he getting so excited? And they went, they're faceted. I went, no. Yeah. And he went, yeah. It's like we just, on the Amber Day, on the birthday week, had yeah. faceted Amber, and it's yeah. like, it's all anybody's talking about. Mm -hmm. You know, it's just... And, the, I mean, gosh, I mean, the pastel tones of your Morganites, your aquamarines, your golden Beryls, your Goshenites, your Helidos, whatever you might get in Beryl, oh, my word, your green Beryls, is extraordinary. But then to get them faceted... Barrel. And again, be one of these. I mean, I said on the the, the, the earlier show with um, Becca. Becca, Becca, and there's an absolutely no need because this is one of our most popular gemstones. Oh, again, yeah. Multi barrel, and like I say, in a faceted on down, which is our most popular shape. Mm -hmm. There is absolutely no reason why I should be doing this at all. Well, before but it you is the last deal. Before so. you do. Shall we put it with that aquamarine from earlier? Yeah, I mean, that'll yeah, be really well. I think that's going to really go well, you know. If you weren't watching earlier, Simon took this brand, oh yeah, this brand new strand of aquamarine, if I recall correctly, to 1995 yep. for that kind of quality. Now, if you managed to get that earlier, and if you didn't manage to get it earlier, I think we might have a few left. And I'll give you the code, it's LXJN for Nelly 43. LXJN 43, we took it down to 1995. And remember, these are one-off deals with Simon this evening, so you've either got until the stock is available or it gets to eight o'clock tomorrow morning and then they're gone. Yep. They're locked away. So if you've got that strand of the aquamarine, it's gonna go exquisitely with those. And again, incredible quality. So it should be, Forty nine ninety five. You can see why. Yeah, absolutely. You I mean, really can. Now, it's I could perfectly do the, reasonable price. I could do the really good price. I tell you what, move those. Two. Sorry, I just want to put up the board here to show you because I want to show you the quality of this facet work again, and I'll hold it out to show you the quality of those, and then I'll show you against the clear back. Look at that! Look at those morganites. Look at the clarity, and on the aquamarines, and on the barrels. Sorry, my voice went there, didn't And then let me show you again, so if you're wearing... Because that's, that's a day to evening wear, you know, that is. Yeah. So if you're going out, you know one of those days you're having a lovely day, where you go to a wedding, mm. and you're there all day, and then it goes into the evening, because you're there for the reception as well. You've got to wear a gemstone that's going to carry you right through. Haven't you? Look at that. What are you going to do? What are you going to... Now, you've got to go... Now, I don't mean to set you up for a fall, but you've got to go out in with a bang. Haven't you? Hasn't he? No pressure. I mean, and like I said, because of all the, the reasons why I shouldn't be doing this at all, I could take a couple of pounds off and it'd still be an amazing deal. I could take a fiver off. And it, was, it would though, wouldn't it? It would! I'm talking comparable to it. Yeah. But I am going to take... Go on, go on, go on, go on. Go on, go on. It down to £28.50. pounds. you taking that off or are you taking it down to that? Taking it down to that. £21.45 saving. Oh, multi-barrel fasted strand. I think you're overtired. I think you're making silly mistakes now. I need a wagon wheel. You need other biscuits <laughs> are available. Um, yeah, um, yeah, well, there you go. And I'll tell you what, if you... So we've taken that down... Ah! Hang on a second. If you were happy to pay the original price point, which was, what, 49 95. 95. Yep. So we just saved you £21? Pounds? 40 pence, yeah. Yeah. So basically... You're getting that for free, because that was 19.95. But yeah, there you go. 
taking it in that aquamarine free. That quality of aquamarine, because we took it down to 19 95 and we've just saved you 21 pounds on those faceted barrels. Oh my goodness me, they're good, Simon. And you've got those lovely multicolour tassels as well, I think they're lovely. Loads and loads and loads of you within your baskets, lots of you checking out as well. Congratulations, massive, massive saving. Knockout quality. Beautiful pastel tones, and yet with that clarity, that sparkle, that selection of one of the most beautiful, and they harmonise so well together yeah. in the same family, don't they? All just complement they? each other, especially yeah. on the strand as well. That is superb, really beautiful. Those barrels on mm. there. I mean, I'd normally rave on about the aquamarine and the morganite, to be yeah. fair, but those beautiful golden and green barrels are stunning. Mm -hmm. I mean, really stunning. Adorable, that is. Look at that. Oh, my word. XNNV, and you will be the envy of people if you don't get those, I tell you. £28.50. You're getting a £50 strand for £28.50. Do you know what, team? Can we say a massive, because we've got the great news is, we've, eased, oh, we've got a, new, a lovely new design. She's only been on one sort of full-time show before. And we've got the lovely Jo Turner on with us this evening. Wait till you see her Labradorite necklace she's wearing. Uh, we've got kits still to come. We've still got lovely... Now, is there any... You've left us with some naughty savings as well? So there are still some lines in there that I've agreed to price in more. So even though I'm not here, I've given Becky the prices so she can take them down. You're here in spirit. Oh, uh, yes. Yes. Just After you off. waltz yeah. off with your wagon wheel. Okay? That can be your, that can be your reward. But can I just oh, say thank you. thank you to Simon. <laughs> Lovely Simon. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. No, so when are you going to be doing this again? It'll be towards the end of next month, I think. Okay. Well, thank, honestly, honestly thank you ever so it. much. And thank you for yeah. making, I'm sure, a lot of people's absolute day with some of those deals you've done tonight. So. so thank you. Sure. Well, you've seen that with the messages yeah. coming in. Thank okay, you. Simon's going to mosey on off, and then we're going to bring the lovely Joe in, and uh, we'll start all over again. See you in a bit. You can watch our Jewellery Maker show every day on our website by clicking the Watch and Buy Online link in the top right-hand corner of our homepage. Are you new to Jewellery Maker? Shop with us for the first time and you'll receive a free gift. The free gift includes two beautiful gemstone strands in an organza bag, plus a DVD ideal for jewellery making newbies, featuring tutorials essential for getting started and so much more. As long as you qualify as a new customer and haven't shopped with us before, then your free gift will automatically be added to your order when you make your first purchase with us. It's really that simple. Gemstone strands are selected at random, so gemstone size, shape and colour will vary for each new customer. Why stop there? Once you receive your new free gift, we'd love to see what you create. Share your designs with us via our Facebook page and join our creative community of jewellery makers. Start your jewellery making journey with us today. Create. Wear. Share. If you have a question or a query for Jewelry Maker, then you can contact our call center on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Or alternatively, you can email help at jewelrymaker.com. The Jewelry Maker Wall of Fame is where you get to showcase your skills as a jewelry designer. Each week, one lucky entrant will win £100 credited to their account, and the runner up receives £50. If you want to enter your design, just send a photo to studio at jewelrymaker.com or you can post your photos to Jewelry Maker Studio, Ivy House, Henley Road, Studley, B80, 7DU and make sure you don't forget your customer number. Get making and good luck. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. Our Jewelry Maker community is a fantastic platform to share, learn, chat and make new friends. So why not like our Facebook page and join over 64,000 like-minded people? Did you know, no matter how many times you purchase with Jewelry Maker in the same day, you'll only be charged one fee of postage and packaging. Select our standard delivery for just $3.95, or if you'd like to receive your goods sooner, upgrade to our premium option for $5.95. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. Two halves tonight. 
Now this lovely lady here is Jo Turner. Yeah. Now then, Jo, hello, welcome. Thank you very much. Second full show. It is. Yes. Now then, can we just, for anybody that doesn't know you, have you got a little bit of who you are, where you're from? Okay, yeah. um, I currently live in Malvern, but I'm from Hampshire originally, so you pick Lovely. up the twang occasionally. Yeah. Um, I've been jewellery making for quite a long time. I started with really basic charm bracelets, which I still oh, love yeah. to make. Do you? And seed beading is another thing that I've got into, yeah. and really love that as well. But the gem gemstones is you know, probably oh. the last four years. Oh, really? Um, I love it. I've got quite a collection. Well, can I do you mind us? Do you mind me drawing attention to your necklace? I met Joe today and I went, that necklace is, is breathtaking. I mean, really breathtaking. It took a few hours to make. I bet it did, but my goodness um, me. And it's, it's Labradorite that I brought through the show. Yeah. Um, and so I probably Incredible. spent a good hour on each mm. one. It's beautiful. So. It really is stunning. What a great piece of jewellery. Good, so this is Joe's colours. second show, full show. Full show. Your first yes. was it a first late show with Lucy? Yes, it was. Oh, Isn't that exciting! And poor Joe, she's you've been here since what time? Been quite a long time. She's it's been quite waiting warm in the gallery. I know she's been here waiting <laughs> hours to come on. So we're and I've said to Joe, thank you for being so understanding and wait, and waiting all those hours to come on. So yeah. honestly, thank you. It's really good of you. Thank you. And she hasn't we're, batted an eyelid. We had lots of good bargains with Simon, <laughs> yeah, didn't we? We did, didn't we? Um, so, so I take it you're a customer of jewellery maker as well I then? Am. Yes, yeah. definitely. Oh, well, um, because you can't help yourself. No, you can't, can you? Yeah. Why should we? Yeah. Uh, right, so uh, this is going to put a spring in your step, hopefully. And uh, we're going to see um, Joe's lovely jewellery in a moment, but we're going to talk you through. So obviously, this is quite a good kit for you then, because you've got seed beads, yep. gemstones, so you're happy. It's, it's a good mix, yes. Yeah, good. Now, spring in your step, very spring-like opal. Very pretty spring-like opal, actually, in a really lovely, bright, beautiful, well, shades of green, green and white opal. Mm. Lovely and fresh, isn't it? And zingy. Most fresh. Yeah. yeah. Definitely spring. Yeah. Beautiful. Then we're also going to give... Now, we talked about this early, didn't we? We said, wouldn't necessarily put these colours together. No. But actually, when I see it together, it's a lovely, sweetie-style set yeah, of colours. It's just light and uplifting. Yeah. But we both said, wouldn't have put those together ourselves. But actually, it's one of those lovely surprises that when you see them together and you see the jewellery that Joe's made, it actually works really well, doesn't it? <laughs> Hopefully you will like it. It, it really <laughs> does. It's really lovely. Joe showed me a jewellery earlier. She would you like to see what I've made? I went, yeah. And they're really, really lovely designs, really beautiful. And I like those colours together. I never thought I'd say that, but I really do. So you've got these beautiful colours of your Mayuki. You've got the pale pink Salon 11 and the silver lime flame red with the AB, LO, uh, 22 and 23 gram tubes respectively. Then we're going to give Joe obviously just a thread. So we thought we'd spoil it with Fireline. Oh, hello, they're alive. We so, do, do like Fireline. Do you? It's really good. It's one of your preferred, yeah, is it? It's good. I can keep the tension better with Fireline. Yeah, because that's the thing, isn't it? I mean, when I was, I was doing a DVD with Linda Bromwell the other evening, and she was really tugging on that Fireline. Yeah. And I was, she said, I've never had one snap. No. Oh, well, there you go. That's good to know as well. So that's the £8 break weight. And we thought, well, as we've got our lovely Jo, uh, new guest designer, we better give her some findings as well so she, she can finish the job <laughs> properly. So there's chain, there's head pins, there's toggles, there's jump rings, there's crimps, and there's shepherd hooks in a gold-plated 21-piece essential findings with um, an organza bag. Yeah. And the organza bag's lovely for when you sell it and... Pop yeah, because it's got a handmade there. gemstone jewellery yeah, tag on lovely. it as well, hasn't it? Yeah, I yeah. like that. So... Would you like to sit, and I think most importantly we look at Joe's jewellery, because obviously we don't know Joe that well, so it'd be nice to see what Joe has accomplished with that kit. Now you see, those green opals with those two colour tones, I think really goes, it's a, it's a, it's a huge contrast, mm. but I do think it's one that works. Yeah, I think just getting the quantities right of each colour to yeah. help pop rather than yeah. overtake. Yeah, so. they are lovely. It was good fun. Yeah. And that's the thing. I mean, what made you get into start making jewellery? What was it? Why? Uh, my very first reason, I uh, was made redundant from a first job and they invited me back for a Christmas special party. Oh, yeah. And I was like, oh, I need something to wear. And I made myself a charm bracelet with polymer clay and oh, really? odd bits of chain and things I had. Oh, wow. And that, that kind of kick-started the jewellery side. Oh, how, see, so, everything happens for a reason, doesn't yeah, it? Yeah. It really does. Even it negative does. things can and turn into a positive. Yeah, and I, I got orders from that as well. So it's been nice. ongoing work 
working normal work and yeah. jewelry making work. So, Good for you. Yes. Good for you. Turn the negative into a positive. Brilliant. So genuine gemstones in your green opal, two full-on tubes of your 11 O's and your fire line and your findings. Now I might have mentioned a price point of the kit earlier today. I said we might take a kit under £20. That's the kit, including opal, two strands of the, uh, two tubes of the seed beads, plus your fire line. So fire line sometimes, we've seen fire line at six, seven ninety five. Two tubes of seed beads, usually that kind of seed bead tube, five ninety five, six ninety five. dollars occasionally under five if you're lucky, but it's those kind of price points. You've got a strand of genuine green opal and your full findings pack as well, 21 piece findings pack. 20 pounds. I spent that more than really that on a box good. of chocolates the other day, Joe. <laughs> I did. Well, yeah, yeah, chocolates are... Uh, chocolates are needed, but sometimes it's 24 expensive. chocolates, though, Joe. <laughs> that, that's a bit much. It's a bit much, isn't it? I bet you nearly fell over back. I did nearly <laughs> fall over in the shop. I couldn't get me bread. Um, my stepdad's thoroughly enjoying them. I said, I hope you do make them, make them last. Oh, did you get any of them? No, oh. no. But it's oh, OK. It's all right. It was his birthday. Um, now, do you sell your jewellery, then? I do uh, a few craft shows and I, yeah. I do sort of open home studio things as well oh, from time you? to time. Oh, great. Yeah. Yeah. So, okay, for example, the far necklace with all that beautiful seed bead work. Yep. What um, price point, roughly? I'm not good at this. Um, I'm probably a bit like Mark. I don't charge enough money. Um, but that would probably be around the 45, 40, 45. But the great thing there is if you think about the whole price of this kit, you've made that necklace, which is very, very much seed bead heavy. Yep. You're talking £45, let's say, or £40, whatever. So you've, you've covered the cost of the kit. You've made as much as the cost of the kit in profit. Mm -hmm. And then every other one of those pieces, you've made two necklaces, a bracelet, a pair of earrings, and a ring, and every single one of those pieces is profit. Yeah. Or a free yeah, gift to somebody, technically, if you know what I mean. It could be a gift to someone. Exactly. Yes. But, uh, obviously, the seed beads, you can spend an awful lot of time making something. Yeah, you do have to work that into your... Cost, so, don't you? Yes, yeah. it can be, and depending how well it goes. Yeah. Do you do you uh, end up giving? Do, do your friends and family get some beautiful handmade pieces from you for gifts well, and things? Mum's got quite a good collection. Yeah, actually, <laughs> there's a few friends, yeah, sporting it, but yeah. it's advertising. Of course, I, it is. I see it that way. Yeah, absolutely. Do you know, what it, it's yeah. lovely to yeah. have someone else wear your jewellery. Okay. Now this is going to be really exciting for us here as a team because obviously it's so exciting to have a new guest design, and I'm sorry we've made you wait so long, but yeah, I take it you're going to show us that necklace. Yeah, well, the, I was going to I might do a bracelet version of that. Oh, right, brilliant, first, yeah. Because obviously you don't want to be seeing a whole length of rope being created. Okay, that's fantastic so then. So shortened it down. Okay. So the, the main part of this is obviously like the flags, the, if we're calling yeah. them flags or pennants, and I've got like a candy floss yeah. bit at the bottom. It'll be a little frilly, little isn't it? little frilly bit. Yeah. So for those you... Everyone out there, we do a lot of high OT at the moment mm -hmm. with our seed beads, so you're stitching in each gap. Yeah, so like I'm, a turret, isn't it? That's it. Yeah. There's like a little castle top. Um, so I've literally done a strand, and it's seven beads. It's six beads across, and then you count it on the diagonal. So my flags, for this sake, are... The long one was 35 rows. Yeah. And the shorter ones were 28 rows. OK, thank you for okay. counting them. It does help. Yeah, and it's a case of just counting. You can either count the beads on the, both the sides to get your number, or you count them because they stack diagonally, so you always okay. count one, two, diagonal. OK. So that's how that works. Is this even or odd peyote? This is even, okay. because it gives you less hassle when you get to the end. Right, OK. You haven't got well, to make it easy for yourself. <laughs> make it easier for yourself. <laughs> The only time I'd use an uh, odd count is if I have a pattern that I want something with a central line okay, and you right. want your... Oh, that's good to know. Okay. Otherwise, it's quicker to use, or I find it quicker to use the even count okay. because you haven't got to turn around at the end and yeah. come back again. Yeah. So I have done this. Uh, forgive me for anyone that hasn't done peyote before, but I think... Patty might have done something. Yeah, I think, earlier. and again, if you go to, if you just, sorry to butt in there, Joe, but if you go to jewelrymaker.com, scroll down to the bottom, you'll see uh, YouTube. Click on there. If you search peyote, there will be numerous examples of how to do odd and even across lots of different guest designers. So please, please, please just go in, because we haven't physically got the time for Joe to do that as well. So I hope that's okay. Okay. 
cutting it all a little short today, so we had lots of good bargains with yeah. Simon, so that's fine. So what I've done at the top of the flags is literally rolled the top over, and you can see that on this, this one here. Mm -hmm. And the top's been rolled over, and then you stitch it into itself. So I've left a count of five beads down the side. Okay. And then you literally, the thread's coming out this last one here. If you can see that. Mm -hmm. You're coming down and then you're stitching back in part way down your beadwork effectively. Okay. And we make sure we don't get all our threads crossed over. So we're stitching that in. Mm -hmm. And then we're going to encourage, a little seed beads rolling around now. That's okay. And then you're literally going to just follow the zigzag of the stitch work across. And this is quite hard to see because it's small beads. They're quite mm -hmm. reflective. Everything that could possibly be anti-camera. Yeah. Don't worry, we're used to it. Yeah. And then we're just going to stitch across. So we're going to pick up the top row, go down through the bottom row. And this is going to roll over. If you can see the beads. Mm-hmm. And getting a knot in a thread, but that's normal with beadwork. Okay, you have to you just have to be watch just the thread where it falls and just keep an eye on it, it, don't you? Watch where you put your needle. Yeah. Watch where the, the thread is going once you've done your stitch, because you don't want to finish off and look back at it and find you can see the thread. Mm. Because it's really annoying, especially if you've tied off and you've got to un undo it again then. Mm. So we just work our way along a diagonal. Pick up the last bit there. And then, obviously, I do this looking at it, usually, not far away from me. Yeah, we were talking about this earlier, isn't it? <laughs> Trying to keep your head from under the un yeah, overhead camera. And yeah. I'm going to do that in there. Now, literally, at this point, I would tie off with a little knot, and that would be the end of that row. Mm -hmm. So, for this evening, we're just going to take that needle off of there. This is where the macrame board's quite useful. You can just yeah. stab it. <laughs> so, on this side... This is where I'm going to add all my um, fluffy... Frilly bits. Know, frilly bits. Your frilly bits. Like candy floss because <laughs> of the colour, I think. Yeah. I've just managed to unfread my needles. Oh, we oh. talked about this one. And this is what Joe was saying earlier. She said, it's not till you come and do a show live that you realise just what guest designs are up against. Even just the threading of a needle. Because it's nerve-wracking. And again, at home, you'd be like this. But because there's this overhead camera, there's that camera, there's another camera. Yep. She's concentrating. Which, there's a lot to think about, uh, isn't there? You know, it's all going to go wrong. So what I've done here... <laughs> And actually, I, at home, I'd be on a bead mat as yes, well, she would, rather yeah. than a macrame board. So it's, it sort of stops the beads rolling around mm. so much on you. And I'm very conscious here, I could quite easily flick them and hopefully not get it's seen. Them. Don't worry. So I've threaded up seven. Okay. And I'm coming out the bead here on the end. You can see mm. the thread coming out. And I'm basically coming to the second row. Yeah. Thread in. So it's like a little back stitch, and that's mm. your first little loop of beads. Okay. So then I'm going to add another seven. Mm -hmm. And obviously you could water this, you could make this frilly bit longer, shorter, yep. just by adjusting the number of beads you're going for. Mm -hmm. And again, it's tricky keeping your beads on your needle. Mm-hmm. Have you got a size 10 needle there, have you, Jen? This is a size 12. Oh, we've got 12, have you? Yeah. Oh. Um, it's... Is that your preference, a 12? Yeah it's, yeah, it's a good solid needle to hold on to. Mm -hmm. uh, I don't bend it quite so easily as some mm -hmm. of the smaller ones that look like boomerangs. After have, you tried the, have you tried the tulip needles? I have. I do have some at home. Mm. Yeah, very nice. You have treated yourself, haven't you? Oh, well, you got to sometimes. Of course you have. Yeah. I totally agree with you, Jo. But try all these things out, mm. see which ones you prefer. Yeah. So again, just pick up a few more, move along one bead and back through there. So this is what you're going to do. You're going to finish that off, literally there's another three goes, and then you're going to tie back into your beadwork, do a knot, and lose your thread. Okay. Cut it off. So that looks lovely. We'll pretend that's all neat and tidy yeah. and finished. I'll just Oh we're good at pretending. Off. And we love these little thread cutters. They yeah. are so good. They're just like cutting through. Yeah, they're butter fabulous, aren't they? Yeah, yeah, pop. yeah. And you could actually waste a whole thread just by chopping through it. <laughs> It's fa yeah, therapy. It is. So, I've already started this one, as you can see. I've yep. got a bit of the 
jewelry maker built beading thread mm -hmm. from the kits that you can get with the, the three the yep, essential yep. pack mm -hmm. and I'm just threading it up and say so I'm trying to match the necklace a bit obviously I'm changing the size because around the wrist yeah. you don't want too much space going on and I'm just picking my beads this is the fun bit isn't it yeah this is where you can play you can yeah. put it together and think mm. oh does it work doesn't it work mm -hmm. and then pull it apart try yeah. different combinations exactly. and some colors work better than others so now I'm just using my little seed beads as spacers at this point mm -hmm. because I felt the opal just needed a little bit of space around it yeah. to breathe and mm -hmm. you could see see the color see all the way around it so I'm picking up a combination one pink one red one pink mm -hmm. pop it back through the other the last little opal there yep and I put one red on just to finish that bit now at the start and the finish as with the necklace there's a a cubic right angle weave or crawl as you should call it okay and I know that's been demonstrated quite a few times but I've just made a small section mm -hmm. and it just kind of finishes it off yeah, I think it, does. it, it yeah. adds a little bit to it with the colors mm. mixing the two colors in that we've just used on lovely. the flag yeah. to tie it together and here I would literally use um, another seed bead a crimp that's trying to run away. <laughs> He's tried to escape a couple yeah, of times here, has, hasn't he? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> set them loose and they're off. And another seed bead. And then I would literally just loop my thread round back through the seed bead in the tube. Mm -hmm. And then I'd take it back down through the beadwork as well. Yep. Sorry, people. Covering it up. It would pop out through your beadwork there. And that gives you something to hold on to and you can just pull this as tight as you want. Mm -hmm. Now I allow probably, because I've got, I might put wire guardians on it yeah. if I was at home or mm -hmm. I might put the, the French wire, French wire mm -hmm. and that would finish it off nicely. Yeah. And then a nice size loop that I know will fit with the jump ring yep, as well. Yeah, exactly. You've got to think and, of all that, haven't you? And your crimp mm -hmm. things. Things that's good. Green pliers. Green pliers. Now, very carefully, because I've got seed beads either side of this, it's very easy to get your crimping pliers over the seed beads, and the next thing you know, you've broken one. You don't want to do that, not when you've got because to that point. Because they're glass, mm. they will break nice and easy. So I've made the horseshoe shape, I've then folded it flat, and that's now Lovely. Yeah, nice and secure. I can fit my jump ring on there. Mm -hmm. I got my cutters and let's just cut off the beading wire. Mm -hmm. And then yeah. obviously we're going to join that in a minute with uh, the jump ring. And that gives you a little bracelet. That is lovely. I love that little frill on the not, bottom. The frill's not quite finished, but it's getting there. Yeah, but we know it's on You know its what way. it's on its yeah. way. And it gives you something, a smaller version of yeah. the necklace. So you could wear them together or just wear them independently. Yeah. So that's lovely, that's isn't it? Shortened demo. That is really lovely. I think that little bubbly fringe on the bottom is beautiful. Yeah, yeah, it's really a bit, lovely. A bit fun. Aww. So uh, the other thing I wanted to quickly show you, if that's alright. We've got time, yeah, yeah, yeah. With the yeah. the cubic right angle weave rope, this one I've started the base or the floor, as mm -hmm. we call it, with the red, and the walls are in pink. Okay. With this part, I'll put it next to it. The floor is pink and the walls are red, so you can see you get quite a different look you do depending actually, don't on you? which yeah. which colour you use mm. first. And so I thought I'd just do a little sample bit so you could see the difference because that might make a difference with the entire necklace. Yeah, of course it might. And that's a little bit. So, this is a great thing that I think about, especially with seed beading. Once you've got these techniques yeah. on these sort of sections here, the, with the amount of different colours and sizes of seed beads. Oh. You can create so many visually yeah. different, and the way you strand it then together. Yeah. So many different looks, but you're still maintaining the same technique. Yep. Yeah. And I've made all these pieces of jewellery, this demo piece, yep. and this, uh, that's the original tubes. So, so again, they, when we say they go a long way, we're not, we're no, not really scraping the surface, really, are no, we there? There's, there's quite a lot there. I mean, you've got yeah. nearly half there left. So, oh, yeah. 
And even when you, you know, the thread's doing well as well. I would mm. allow, it's roughly a metre of thread for 10 centimetres for that wow. particular stitch. Oh, OK. So, you Brilliant. know, your, your reel's going to go quite a long way. What do we think, team, of the demo? Yes! Yeah. I think, yes! Well done, Jo. Thank you very Are much. you happy with your demo? Yep. Were you nervous? I didn't lose too many seed beads. No, I think you didn't she do well. If you want to message in and welcome Jo, we know that's always a nice thing to do, isn't it? Um, text in to 60777 if you would. Start your text with JM Studio because I tell you what, it means a lot when we get messages in, especially if you're new to jewellery maker, because it is nerve wracking. It really is nerve wracking. Um, but you, I tell you what, you kept your hands pretty silly because when I first started and I was presented, I was, I, I just, and there's nothing you can do about the shakes. No, no. You were brilliant then. There you go. Well done. Even managed to thread the needle back up. Yeah, would you, <laughs> that's why I went away and talked. We weren't watching you. I thought, we're going to give her a break. And she threaded it like that as well. Straight it was on. fantastic. We're going to a... Oh, okay, lovely. Brilliant. Um, the, good th the good thing is, we did another demo in a bit. Yeah, that'd be quick, wouldn't yeah. it? Yeah, yeah. Now, this would go really nice with those opals, I think. Seasidey. Yeah. Yeah. It is seasidey. Yeah. It's like the colours of those, um, like, are they classed as Catherine wheels, the ones that, the plastic ones that go around, or is that just the firework? You know, like, the, are they water, you know, um, they're, what are they called? The windmill things that go around. Yeah. Are they yeah, called like windmills, are they? Windmill, spinning wheels. Spinning wheel, yeah. yeah. You all see those the foil the colours yeah. and sparkly. Yeah, that's yeah. the sort of colours you get, don't you? In the, in the, and they're like, see, and you get, like, buckets and, and, um, What's the blow-up balls that you get to throw oh. at each other in the swimming pool? Yeah, yeah I like them. Do you know, at the moment, you can always tell when, my, when the kids are off next door, because I've always got a, a football or a tennis ball or something <laughs> in my garden from next door. Got a every day. <laughs> every day I have to go out and throw them all back. Every single day. Um, sky blue opal. This is the opal that we had in Joe's lovely kit. Excuse me, Dan. Can I just say, I'm, they love me. My neighbour, my neighbour's kids, they come around and make jewellery with me oh. and bring me homemade lemonade. And, and they know that I throw their ball straight back. They what never have to you? come and ask. Not punctual. I'm a nice neighbour. Might not have children or understand them, but I'm very <laughs> good to them next door. They ask to come to the shops with me sometimes and I buy oh. them ice creams and stuff. Oh. I'm a good, friendly child oh. neighbour. I am, I'm good. <laughs> In fact, they're all taking the mickey because I don't have any children. They don't think I'm any good with children. There's a whole cul-de-sac. There's a whole cul-de-sac there. All the children come to my house. But you know what they do at the minute, which is a bit annoying? Yeah. They keep coming up, ringing the doorbell. <laughs> yeah? bringing, no a, bringing the doorbell, and then they run. Mm. And then when I get, by the time I get to the door, they've gone. <laughs> nice. <laughs> I don't get annoyed because I, I think it's quite a fun game. It's quite a fun game. Kids games, yeah, isn't it? It's one of them, isn't it? <laughs> they get bored of it. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, especially when you don't do anything and don't answer yeah. the door. Eight pounds sixty-five for a whole thirty-six centimetre length of nice. opal. Mm-hmm. Oh yeah, Peruvian as well. Best location. Yeah, it's just nice. Summery, isn't it? Mm. It's holiday. Oh, I can't take my eyes off your necklace. Sorry. You're gonna wonder. She think she kept looking at me in a funny way. Is that necklace? When you go to like bead groups and you go around bead shows, everyone just looks at that, they do. that area of everybody because you're all looking yeah. at everyone else's jewellery. It's, 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 it's like, okay. When we used to be part of the Gemporia group years ago, um, I got lent a £38,000 emerald necklace. Oh my word. And my cousin Steve that owns the company has got me to wear it. Well, I was on jewellery maker at the time. So anyway, wore it to this event. Everybody kept coming up to me and I kept thinking I made it. I'm famous. <laughs> And, of course, they just want well, to look at me. But all they recognise me now, they did. Because <laughs> I tell you what, when you're wearing a £38,000 ruby or Everyone's emerald necklace, there. everybody wants to look at it. So, <laughs> there you go. Um, anyway, um, well done, Jo. Thank well you. done. And thank you for your patience this evening. You've been an absolute star. But the good news is, she's not going anywhere. Because after the break, we gave you another kit. You did? You've made more jewellery. I have. And we're going to give you the chance to get that. Are you going to talk you into doing another demo as well? Yeah, oh, I think so. Excellent, yes. Right, so another... And do keep those messages coming in for Jo and we'll read some out for you to welcome her to the JM family. See you after the break.
Finding a strand of genuine gemstones is always exciting, but being able to use it in your handcrafted jewellery, then passing it on to its new owner with proof of its authenticity is even more incredible. Why not add one of our printed authenticity cards to your order and share that same feeling with your customers? You can also access online authenticity certificates through items you have previously ordered by looking at your order history on your account details. The certificate gives you valuable information about your purchase and is your guarantee of quality and peace of mind from Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. Our brand new Get Started with Jewelry Maker page has been created to provide help and guidance for jewelry making newbies. If you need design suggestions, hints and tips, or help with perfecting your jewelry designs, we're here to help. Head over to facebook.com slash get started with JM where our talented in-house designers are happy to answer your jewelry making questions, offer inspiration and get you started in your jewelry making journey. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. I was expecting you to sing to her before the end of her show, Michael. What just said he hasn't sang to me, you know. Yeah. You know, I'm that's the least. I, I, I know, know. Joe. That's the least he could do to a new guest designer. The Serenade to you. Listen. You yeah. come here specially. Exactly. And you tell him, Joe. Oh. You tell that's him, Joe. Yeah. I, I expect some singing. Oh, there you go. Like me. <laughs> <laughs> In case you just joined us for the last hour, this is our wonderful new guest designer, the lovely, lovely Joe Turner, who's just done the most weird jazz hands as well. Mm -hmm. Oh, you're going to fit right in with jazz hands, Joe. That's it. We're up. <laughs> Woo! She's just the most fantastic demo. And the good news is, we haven't finished yet because she's made even more jewellery with another kit, which she's going to do. I said, do you mind? Because she was supposed to be here at six o'clock this time. And I can't just tell you as well, if there's anybody that was tuning in to see Joe earlier, we'd like to apologise, it's our fault. The time she told you was right, it's our fault, well it's Simon's fault, Simon's Simon. Really. Yeah, he was hogging it, wasn't he? He was, he yeah. hogged the limelight, didn't he? he? Did. Well, we don't All those special deals. deals. But yeah, yeah. Yeah. Um, speaking of which, now this is another Simon's pick that is left with us. It is Sapphire, we've already done a Salon Sapphire this evening, but this is, I mean for me personally it will go for the red spinel, it will go with the amazing microfaceted ruby, which I'm guessing has sold out by now. We had a 9.95 microfaceted strand of delicious 
natural ruby it was unbelievable and if you combine the two identical sisters i.e ruby and sapphire they are practically identical other than all the red is ruby every other color is sapphire and that's how you've got to remember it other than that pretty much identical now the i mean my goodness me that that tone it's so complimentary to the t to, to the skin tone isn't it so warming isn't it mm. you, d you don't even need to have a suntan you don't and it's just beautiful yeah you really don't i mean that is and a lot of people don't want a suntan these days because no. obviously it can be dangerous and all that kind of thing some people like to protect and all that kind of thing i'm like that factor 50 sun hat and a wetsuit well, i spend a lot of time indoors beading so i don't see much <laughs> yeah, exactly. you don't get to see much sun <laughs> but it's better for you that's why jewelry makers are always pale skin because <laughs> you're always inside making jewelry um, so again, it is a Simon's pick. We are pop uh, obviously Simon's had to go home because he has been here since sort of seven eight o'clock this morning. And he had got a good couple of hour journey home. So bless him, he did stay and look after us. A um, little bit heat treated. So, but again, a lot of people. Ninety five percent of sapphires are heat treated. Uh, it's just a continuation of Mother Nature's um, natural. What she would have done anyway. Uh, some people in the industry, in the gemstone world, class heat treatment as a treatment some don't but we like to be really um, transparent about our treatments and uh, this is fantastic it's a great deal we're going to show you what the price would have been and it's going to be a lowest ever price courtesy of our lovely manager Simon on his Simon's oh, whoa, hang on a minute you're not on you don't have the talk back yet do you so you have no idea what I've just been told no okay if we were to take a fiver off that would you think that's impressive yep now Joe watch what we do now with these downward arrows i think you're going to be pleasantly surprised okay there are 43 chances only get ready for this stunning <laughs> now what do you do when that happens do you try and guess the price at home yeah we all do yeah, don't we we? Have, we all have a go and sometimes yeah. we're quite close and then other times you get we're way shocked. off yeah, yeah. And when you see a deal like that, even if you were sat there before thinking, no, oh, I don't know if I want any on a sapphire, and then you see a price drop like that, you kind of feel obliged to sometimes, mm. don't you? You're thinking, have I got it in my collection? No, no. that's too good to me. Yeah. So is that, can I justify that to myself? Yeah. yeah. So I tell you what, can I show you with this incredible red spinel we've got coming up as well? Look at that. Yeah. Beautiful. Oof. They do go well, don't they? Those reds and those, all you need is some green peridot and you've got traffic lights. <laughs> But high end. High end. Oh yeah. <laughs> We've got some peridot. We could do that, couldn't yeah. we? I think you should. Oh yeah. Look at that. Look at that. Oh, actually, I really like that. That would be lush on oh, no, a nice Red. free strand. Yeah. You could indulge yourself. Do couldn't it properly. You do? It is an mm. indulge, isn't it? Mm. Okay. And like you say, we should indulge. We should yeah. love ourselves yeah. first, shouldn't we? We work hard. Live we hard. do, don't we, Joe? You do. You got two jobs. Hey. <laughs> got another job as well this one she works hard so then well then i don't blame you jeanette wendy hilda collector mural jackie jack well, there's two jackies there sometimes it sounds like i'm repeating myself doesn't it but i'm not jackie in kent and jackie in north yorkshire just to prove a point and there's another jackie the jackies are taking over yeah. rule the real world yeah jackie in shropshire Sh i can't even say it <laughs> shropshire Thank you. I struggle with Shropshire, do you? No, obviously not. Um, but Jackie in Shropshire, Jackie in North Yorkshire, and Jackie in Kent. That's three Jackies. That's a hat trick of Jackies. Very good. Have you got any of the Anna Sapphire, Jo? Not yet. Oh, I like her. See, not she's yet. a true jewellery maker customer. Not yes, that's right. yet. Looking enviously at it. Mm. Uh, sparkling away. It is amazing, isn't it? And it's a good length strand as well, look. It's lovely. Do you know that's classed as fancy sapphire? No. Well, yes, there's something to okay. another little. Every day is a school day. I like learning. All, yeah, it's good, isn't it? Mm. All uh, only the true blue sapphire is allowed to be called just sapphire. Every other colour, uh, fancy sapphire. Well, so I, can... I always thought sapphire was just blue. Mm -hmm. Well, there you go. Yeah. So. Yeah, but the fancy sapphires. Oh yeah, amazing. So many colours you can get in sapphire. Mm. So many. I love purple. I do. Uh, Purple is my favourite colour. Really, oh, is so. it? Uh, so you, are you an amethyst girl? I do like my amethyst. Ah. Yes. What's your favourite gemstone? Oh, uh, it's actually kyanite. At the <gasps> Did you see that kyanite stone <laughs> earlier? I was, I was drooling over that oh, one. Oh, it's incredible colour tone. Beautiful colours. And yeah. absolute steel. That's one of the ones I'm going to get when I get off. Is any left of the kyanite? Oh my goodness me. I like sherite. 
as well, which because of the purples. Shara white, yeah. Shara. Oh, I think we might have had some Shara white tonight. That's lovely. Mm. Are you, now I know we've just, gosh, I mean, we've just got you to do a demo, but we've got this other kit, so should we do it? Because it's, yeah, let's go for it. Do, do, did they know purple was your favourite when they sent you the kit? Well, they might have done. They might they have might done. done. But they, they might just have done. done rather nicely with the bronze, though. Yeah. So, uh, you've gone and got lovely uh, dog tooth amethyst in Joe's kit for her because purple's her favourite. So that was handy. That was good. It was. Yeah. Aww. That was lovely. Now, I'll tell you what, as well, if you got those amazing, I think they've all sold out. They must have done. Um, I think we only had one left of the 10 mil rounds of uh, the uh, cognac amber. Mm. That would go so well, the amber, with the. Uh, Amethyst. Yeah, that was lovely. They're all sold out, yeah. Now, these are 12 mil rounds. We're also going to throw in these amazing sized bronzite. So, we've got 12 mil in the bronzite and 12 mil in the amethyst. Beautiful big rounds of both gemstones. Mm. That bronzite, it's got a really lovely weight to it. I've, I've just noticed that myself when I picked yeah. it up. It really has got quite a good feel to it, hasn't yeah, it? Yeah, it feels lovely just yeah. to hold and it's. Sometimes, yeah. well, I think all gemstones are very tactile. Yeah. Don't you? Well, you just sit there and stroke them. And yeah. Hold you them do, and don't you? Take them out <laughs> yeah. in the sunshine. Do you ever wonder, worry that when people are walking past the house, if they can see you and you're stroking your gemstones? Luckily, they can't. <laughs> <laughs> That's all right. Because right, you then. look a bit strange stroking well, your gemstones. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> well, now, we've also given um, Joe the reason why you might be thinking, why is it called Round the Roses? Well, we've given you some lovely roses um, charms as well, haven't we? Because I asked Jo earlier, I said, how did you start out with making uh, jewellery? She said, charm bracelets. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. And these would be lovely on little charm bracelets. They you really could go would. for a quite dainty charm bracelets yeah. with those. They really would look lovely. If you were mixing them with like the blue opal earlier. Ooh, yeah. yeah. Do you like opal? Yeah, Ethiopian, I happen to say, is probably really? my favourite. Yeah, I think a lot of people love Ethiopian. It's just magical. It is magical. Then we've got these wonderful, now we've got a findings pack for you coming up as well. Of the silver plated metal rose charms, we've got 15 by, uh, they're 15 by 12 and there's 10 of them. Then these filigree bead caps are 12 mil and there's 10 of those as well. They're gorgeous design. Look, you see all the, the texture as well. So you get 10 of those and, oh my word, you are lucky. Mm. Because, not that you'll need them with a 12 mil, but when do we ever get a findings pack with... They've only gone and got the normal ball head pins and the featherweights. I'll tell you what, that is one seriously big. Um, is that the... Oh, that's the 150-piece mm. findings pack. You've got a, a lot, lot yeah. in there. Metre of chain, featherweight and standard head pins, five big bolt wing clasps, crimps and crimp covers and spacers and jump rings and shepherd hooks. That is one seriously big... 150 piece findings pack, that goes a long way as well. Yep. So, two brick strands of gemstones at 12 mil, that's a big carrot weight, and your bead caps, and your rose charms, and your 150 piece findings pack. And again, two kits on the late show, each under 20 pounds. Oh, bless you. Very good. Under 20 pounds for that deal. Extraordinary value for money, isn't it? Yeah, it's really good. Mm. I'd, I'd love using these. Yeah. So I wouldn't have put purple and the bronzite together, but we said it that earlier. Really, but again, it does actually work well. But the lovely it's... thing is, obviously, as our, as our as our guest designer, you you've chosen to use them together. That's great. Mm. Anybody else buying this, you can get this. It's like we said, you go to the supermarket, you buy loads of ingredients, yeah. you don't necessarily put them all in one meal. No, I mean the, the amethyst and these silver mm -hmm. findings work yeah. beautifully if you just kept them separately. Mm. I've tried deliberately to use them all together. Yeah. No, that's mm. great. That's lovely. That's... Beautiful. So, yeah, whether you use them together or not. Now, again, lovely. I particularly look. Oh, see, that looks great. The way you put the sandwich, the two um, bead caps together. Yeah, th yeah. Literally, just you could have a bead in between yeah. them, but I thought it'd just be a bit different. Oh, that goes great, like use that. The beading thread or a uh, very fine wire just mm. to thread diagonally through to keep the two halves it's together. It's like a barley bead, isn't it? Mm. Yeah. So, it's that. good fun. Tell her that. And the other thing I've done, so close your ears, anyone that's sensitive. I've just spotted you've um I've hammered one flat. Well, I might have done it on more than one occasion. Uh, do you know? Mm. But I, I thought, well, we'll just try it and see. I think and I'll it, it, flat, it hammered. It flattened out lovely and it's it's there's it's not split, it's it's brilliant. I really so, like that. It's a nice way of using yeah. them that way. But it's lovely to see that actually 
caressing your gemstone as how they're designed as to they're do. Designed, yeah, yeah, absolutely. They, they, so they do looks lovely great. Yeah. because obviously you've got the gemstone colour coming through yeah. the apertures of the filigree. Absolutely. Now what are you going to teach us, lovely? Right, so the one in the middle with the chain and oh, yeah. the mixed of beads. Quite simple. Okay, great. It doesn't take too long to do. Brilliant. And again, we're using the the bead thread that comes out of the essential findings pack. Yeah. Findings pack. And obviously, I've started with chain up the top, and then I've started kind of on your the shoulder points. Mm -hmm. I don't know what collarbones. Yeah, yeah, yeah. For the gemstones to come through from that, because okay. if, if you did it all the way round, it'd be absolutely great. And you would have a bit of extra weight bit, with it yeah, because the bronze light's got a decent weight yeah, to it. Yeah, it seems a bit more comfortable when you've got sort of less on the back of the neckline, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah. It, it brings it all forward, and obviously your, your gemstones go that much further then. Exactly. Now, what I've done with the meter of chain that came in. Oh, boy, don't worry. I'll always save them for you. Don't worry. I was worried that was happen. Um, I've cut them up into little lengths of seven, seven links. And the reason I've done that is each gemstone mm -hmm. can be caressed with a piece of chain. Okay. And basically just, because I haven't got a toggle on the end of that one now, it's come straight off. So we're just popping it down one side, popping the gemstone on, mm -hmm. threading your bead through the last link of your little seven links, and it just sits... Oh, that's lovely. I don't know if you really see it, but it just sits underneath. Now, you could leave the chain in one length and mm -hmm. loop it as you go. Yeah. Um, but I felt separating the little links, and you can see I've, I've got them all ready here, mm -hmm. it just lets it have a little bit more movement. Yeah. yeah. So it's a little bit freer to move okay. around. So it's literally, so it's another gem on. I've done a bronze light first, and then I've done the amethyst. Mm -hmm. And again, take the end. The end loop. Of the seven little link, mm -hmm. pop the thread through. So you can see it's really, really easy to do. So I've done the strand like that all the way along. Mm -hmm. What I also use is the little charms. Oh, the roses, yeah. The roses, and I've used links for that. So the middle link, I had a length of chain that is 10 centimetre, um, 10 links, I should yeah. say. So I've got Two on the side that are seven each, mm -hmm. and then I'm going to have a ten. So this could vary. You, if you want your dangles to be a lot danglier, yeah. go, for a, go for a longer yeah, chain. Absolutely. So literally, you just use your little jump rings, which you've got in your uh, findings pack as well. We've got everything in that findings oh, pack, haven't you? There's so much in it. It's brilliant, yeah. and it's nice to have the crimp covers and yeah. crimps exactly as well. Exactly the whole shebang to finish it off properly. And see the jump rings. I'd like. Love jewelry maker jump rings because Do you? They, they close so nicely. Yeah. You know, and when you pick them up, it's like, oh, yeah. where's the where's you the actual find it sometimes, yeah. don't you? Yeah, I always struggle. <laughs> so, little jump ring. Yeah. I know lots of people have demonstrated, but you take your jump ring and you have your two sets of pliers and you open it like a little gate. Yeah. If you do it the other way, you weaken the metal yeah, and it will it will you. break. So. Get your chain, your link, your jump ring, and you're literally popping it on the end of your chain. So we'll go for a really long one here. So there's probably a good 20 links on this one. So if you don't mind your jewellery going down your cleavage, mm -hmm. or you've got a nice long maxi dress on yep. for the summer, you might want the extra length just to give it that bit more movement. Yeah. And you can see it against your dress or your, your top. Close your gate together. And then what you do is back to your beading thread, pop it through that top link, mm -hmm. and fingers and thumb. There we go. So I've still got my little link on there from earlier. <laughs> Thank you. It's okay. So obviously that is really long. Yep. But you could play with this. Yeah, of course. You could carry on adding. 
if you wanted to use the whole pack of charms, mm -hmm. there's no reason why you no. couldn't add those charms all the way around and you'd have a yeah, lovely exactly. sort of feathery It's charm. as much or as little as you want, yeah. as dramatic or as, Yep, yeah, and know. equally so, if you weren't quite so keen on the charm part, just have the one in the yeah, centre. Yeah, exactly, yeah. And then make the most of your beads around the outside. Yeah. So. And it looks lovely the way you've draped that, and I love the way the chain sort of scoops underneath. It's really yeah, pretty. It's, it's just got you know, lots of A little of bit of movement, movement yeah. yeah. That is lovely. And um, this one here, if we can just have a look at this one. Right there. And obviously we've, we've got the two findings that have been attached to each other and the squashed one. And mm. then I've added the charms using this, the squashed finding. I've yep. actually used them as the apertures for attaching the charms into that, with the jump again, rings. Lovely, so again it gives you more yeah. movement so you're catching the light with the silvery yeah. charms. And if you don't mind me saying still still relatively yep. sort of That's easy e easy easy, easy makes go. yeah and the the thread literally because I was trying to stick to the kit exactly yeah. without yeah. adding anything else to it yeah. and I've used the thread that was actually strung the amethyst ah, okay. together. Yeah. And other than that, the other makes use the S long cord okay. for a bit of macrame, yeah, so you can do that. Yep. If you just use the bronzite and the amethyst and a bit of macrame, I think it actually makes yeah. a really nice totally blokey kind of yeah. gentleman's Well, bronzite, charm. if you look at bronzite and tiger's eye, a lot of the, yeah. lot of the uh, jewellery searches that come back are for men anyway. So, yeah. Yeah, and absolutely. obviously I wouldn't then use the bead cups or the charms, yeah. I'd just keep well, exactly it with the beads. But that's the great thing about having so many things, so. you don't have to use everything together. And it's yeah. Father's Day coming up, isn't it? 16th of June. That's very true. What's yeah. that, two weeks on Sunday? Yeah. Not far, yeah, is it? Two weeks on Sunday. Got time to get the kit and make a, a nice little macrame. That's just reminded me, I need mm. to book a table for my dad. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I've just forgotten about that. Anyway, um, yeah, well done, Joe. Again, another great demo. Very speedy, thank you. Yeah, thank you. Thank you, well done. Right then, you get the lovely job now of sitting there, Joe, while I do my bit. Excellent. And you get to just gawp at these beautiful gemstones. <sighs> heaven. It's lovely. Mm, it really is heaven. Mookite. Nice, earthy. Yeah, they are, aren't they? Don't forget, Michael. Joe is waiting to be serenaded by Mr. Wolf. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Is have that you, OK? Have you thought about a song yet? Uh, I thought... I would say Zena could pick one, but Zena makes them up. <laughs> she, they, they, she doesn't know, you know any is? songs no. before 1986. Just, do you know what it is, oh. Joe? Because I'm older than them, and I know all the old classical standards and everything, they think I make them up. Oh, because they've not heard of them They've not heard of them. So I'll sing lovely songs that go, You made that up, I go, I didn't. Yeah. I'd probably recognise them, though. <laughs> <laughs> just, just go with them and just okay. go, I don't, if you just go, you made no, that up, I've got then they'll think what you're on about. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, just so anyway, beautiful Australian moo kite, looks fantastic, looks gorgeous. If you got, oh, should we try it with the uh, sapphire? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I mean, that's a bit decadent, I grant you, but. Mm-hmm. Mm-mm, yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, that works. Yeah, very earthy, and then that's hit the sparkle. Hasn't it, yeah. Yeah, and the tone lovely. What yeah. price would you think for a moo kite like that, honestly? Big chunks, 140 carats, all natural, all genuine, drilled, stranded. It, it's just, you could just restring it, couldn't you, as mm. it is, and yep. it'd be quite... What do you reckon? Quite nice. Uh, I hate to put you on the spot, tricky. but realistically. On jewellery maker prices yeah, on. as well, I'd probably be um, 14 99 That's taking a tenner off that. That'd be good. Sure, yeah, that'd be nice. So there you go, there's a, there's a customer of jewellery maker saying, I'd expect fourteen ninety five happily, and yet we've just wiped £10 off the price point. Cool. I don't think we should be allowed to do prices like that at a fiver, but it's great that we can. But it means you could buy two mm -hmm. and have some really nice stacker bracelet things yeah. going exactly, on. Exactly, yeah. Because they're lovely with those, they're lovely with those um, nuggets, because you get like a higgledy-piggledy look, don't you? Yeah. Yeah. And I'd be happy wearing, you know, a good stacking bracelet with them, um, and wearing it down the beach and not being too precious about it, whereas I wouldn't oh, yeah. do that, obviously, with the sapphires. No. And that is the good thing about holiday jewellery. You do take your sort of... I mean, that looks great, and as you say, all that lovely sort of sandy beach tones on there, but mm. you wouldn't worry too much because, God forbid, you actually lost it. You've lost a fiver. Yeah. And that's not... OK, it's still upsetting. It'd be a bit upset. It's upsetting, but it's not the end of the world. No. You know, but uh, anyway, well done. Um... Got those in six. 
Yeah. I'm sorry, I thought you said eight. Sorry, done. Oh, no, don't worry, don't worry. We've... Ooh. Mm-hmm. They are good adjunct rings, aren't they? They're brilliant. And essentials, I use them with mm. nearly every single jewellery piece. Yeah. Now, do you like working with sterling silver? I do. I don't very often, because it tends to be for special. Okay. Yeah, for special. Yeah. Do you know what I love about jewellery making, though? We do sterling silver at non just yeah. for special prices. I should just use it all the time, really. Yeah, exactly. But you know what? Yeah, but it's, like you say, a lot of jewellery makers, it's everyday wear, it's your copper-based, it's all that kind of jewellery, and and, and, all, and then silver-plated as well. But then, as you say, when we do something extra special, like, you know, the Salon Sapphire, the Sapphire mm. we've just had, your Red Spinel, your Rubies, you'd probably tend to go for a precious metal, wouldn't you, if you could? Yep. Yeah, if you could afford Definitely, it. that's where you'd be looking. If you're doing commissions, you tend mm. to go ask for sterling silver. You do, don't you? Um, have you had many you commissions? don't treat yourself to I it, know, I don't know. silly, isn't it? <laughs> but do you tend to... Have you had many commissions? A few specials, yeah. Oh, like really? Christmas specials and special birthdays. And that must make you um, feel special as well. It's lovely that someone... Yeah. Trust someone you trusts to, you to yeah. come up with something, and they literally will just give me a guide on colour, maybe. Oh, how lovely! And the rest is up to me. Oh, how lovely! Um, now, welcome to the to the uh, JM on screen family, uh, Joe. Fantastic demo, you did great. Your Labradorite necklace is amazing, and that's from Sue. Oh, thank you, oh, Sue. Oh, that's a nice message. Lovely I've written these up for you. So, Rona, mm -hmm. and thank you for messaging in. Rona and Michael, hi Zena and Joe. We were there when you wore that necklace, Zena. Well, oh yes, <laughs> that necklace. <laughs> well done, Joe. I would have been a bag of nerves not that you would get me on TV. Why not, Rona and Michael? Yeah. Why not? But yeah, that was a good ball, wasn't it? Yeah, that necklace. <laughs> uh, I tried to take it home. Steve was having none of it. Janice said, Joe, you are a natural. That's a Thank lovely you. thing to say. Welcome to the JM. Welcome to JM, and I hope to see lots of your demos. Zena, great show. Love to all. That's Janice. Fling it over your shoulder. Oh yeah, she's um yeah. Fling it over. You know the over the shoulder boulder holder. <laughs> yeah. Okay. It was a piece of advice her mom gave her. Sounds good. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah yeah. Over the shoulder boulder holder. That's a bra, Dan. Oh. Over the Dan's like, what's that mean? <laughs> over the shoulder boulder holder. Yeah. Bet Midler beaches film. All right. Mm. He was looking at me going, what are what? you talking about, woman? I love that because he's like that. <laughs> <laughs> what are you talking about? You embarrassed the poor boy. <laughs> oh, he's, no, 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 he doesn't get embarrassed. Have you done? No. no. Yeah, well, he doesn't. Carry on. He doesn't. He's all right. Nine out of five. There's 50 there, by the way. Inner diameter five, outer diameter seven. Mm. Ta da! Well done. That is Lovely. brilliant. Mm. Say again, sweet pea. Did you say. I th yeah, you're going to need to give me the thing is because they're all over, over the place. This is 17. It's okay. It's okay. We'll get there. Well, who knows? Who knows? We'll blame Michael. Nice. Have you bought any of these? Because I can't uh, stop. I have. Have you? I treated myself to a strand. Because we've done them in all different shapes and sizes and everything, yeah. haven't we? I think I went for a rectangular one. Did you? Yeah. But I've not unwrapped it yet. It's oh, still okay. waiting. Because we've done the big, we've done big cabochons in these as well. Yeah. It shows the colours off nicely. It does, doesn't the it? Bigger sizes. Yeah. And the thing is, if you go, let's say, a nice, beautiful red spinel, or even if you go a really bright peri, oh, look at that. Yeah. That logo is great, doesn't it? Or if you went um, pink, we've got these beautiful. I think that's pink tourmaline. Looks rather special. Beautiful pink tourmaline as well. Uh, if you want to go with a lovely, your favourite colour, purple. That's the great thing. When you get something with all this bright colour and all this, mm. like a mosaic of colour, yep. you can add anything. It's, it's gorgeous. Yeah. yeah. And these, I think they're really, really low priced. Mm. They are. It, it gives you lots of options. It does, doesn't it? It covers everyone's colours. Yeah, I think so. And it all in one. It's like a, the greatest mismatch of textiles within a gemstone, isn't it? Yeah, a little patchwork. <laughs> yeah, patchwork. Michael, you've got 30 minutes to serenade Jo before she goes home. You can't... You can't upset her. You know. I don't think it's much to ask, you know, Jo, to be serenaded mm. by Michael on your second ever show. I don't think that's much to ask for at all. <laughs> I think he's running home. 
No, no, no. He'll be fine. We'll look after him. There you go. Look at that, though. I mean, it's just... Fa what I love about these as well is that brightness of that green. It's so neon. Mm. It really pops out. Yeah. And then the little splashes of turquoise yeah. as well. And royal blues and pinks uh, and browns. Orange and, and, oh, and, orange and lovely. Oh. The what? <laughs> It's very nice for your top. Thank you, darling. It does, doesn't it? Mm. Yes, I was thinking that, actually. Jo isn't on talk, but she can't hear you singing. Oh. Ombre. Do you often make anything in ombre? Uh, yeah, I have done a few things. Yeah. Not a lot. It's very popular at the moment, ombre, you know. Yeah. Seems to be very in. Yes. Mm. It's all the hairstyles in an ombre as well. Yeah, I've noticed that. Oh. Yeah. Look <laughs> what you started now. You've got him in singing mode That's now. Right. That's it. it. We've had it now. He's, he's warming up, yep. tuning. He's been to see Hugh, Hugh Jackman this week. Mm -hmm. So um, he's very excited because he went to the Hugh Jackman concert in Birmingham. I said, Did you go as well, Kerry? I said, Kerry, Becky, Tom, Michael. In fact, I think most people here, Tom Neary, most of our crew, Sheila, Sheila went, yeah. Sheila went with my tickets. Brian, <laughs> Brian Emma, no, I didn't go. Oh. Laura went. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. I didn't. Pra practically all of us went, bar me and you, Joe. Yeah, I missed out. Mm. But apparently, it was amazing, our lovely Hugh. Mm. Ombre blue opal for under a £10 note. Now, earlier on, you might not have been watching, but we had some lovely opal in a pear drop. Whole strand of blue opal. Is there any of those left, Becky, love? Yeah? Just a couple. Can you remember what we took them to, hon? Could we pop them on? Can you remember? I, can't, I think we went naughty. I think we went below a price point. I'm sure we did, you know. You all right over there, Dan? Yeah. So they look, he's having to tuck it into his little crackers, isn't he? You don't got any cheese? No. No, aren't they a bit dry? Oh, seen right. dry crackers? Bless him. Can we not get him some cheese or something? Or a spread? <laughs> <laughs> Bless him. Do you mind? Yeah, we'll try and find those opals. Because uh, we did a lovely mm -hmm. drop there. That would be nice. Mm, they look nice from there. A simple there, strand of one of those and pears. Yeah. Mm. I, th I think it's a pink tourmaline myself. Should we do that? Yeah, go on then. Oh my good! I tell you what, haven't we got like one of those Thu lights left? Hmm. Can I show you these two together? <clears throat> Have you got any Thu light yet? No. Oh, look at these, Joe. I'm looking forward to seeing this. Yeah. Oh, 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 oh yeah! Come on. How sexy is that? Lovely. Oh my! Do you like pink? Yeah. Yeah. Not as much as purple, but that that is yeah. pretty nice. It's pretty nice, isn't it? Beautiful pink tourmaline. The kitchen sink gemstone. Why is it the kitchen? What do you mean the kitchen sink gemstone? Everything's in it that makes it, apart from the kitchen sink. Oh, chemical impurities wise. Yes. I d still don't like think calling a pink tourmaline the kitchen sink, no. though, Michael. No. No. It's a beautiful Kitchen stone. Sink. I mean, oh. really, Joe. What's he Terrible. thinking? Look at it. It's so Life. pretty. You know. So PZRU26, a whole strand of sensational ruber light, licious looking pink tourmaline. Again, a little bit like the ruber that we had earlier. Fantastic full on saturation. So it is just a wash with tone of colour. Are they? Oh, natural. Wow. Because normally when we have a multicolour tourmaline, you just get tiny little moments mm. of pink, whereas to get actually the whole strand in pink is a real treat, mm. isn't it? All the different tones, like mm. cherry bottom. Yeah. Under 30. Wow, it's another steal. I would be getting the thu like that. Will we be allowed to play those, Becky? Should we do now? Oh, she said, yeah, let's do them next. Because I do think... 
with those colour tones that you've got in there, you're picking out the different colour tones of the Foo Light, aren't you? I, I love yeah, the shape of these. together. Mm, really does. Beautiful. Do you like Hugh Jackman, Joe? Oh, yes. Do you like going to the theatre and concerts and things? I, when I get the chance, I have been a few times. Mm. We've got Malvern Theatre right on our say, doorstep. My step does play there a lot. I used to do so, Panto there every year. Yeah, yeah mm. it's, it's lovely when you go. It's uphill. Yeah, it is a bit uphill. It's not everywhere in Malvern's uphill. <laughs> it's proper steep. I live on the flat bit, but everything do you? else you've got to walk Everything up else to. is not. <laughs> tell you what. It's not my favourite exercise. Yeah. Good for your legs and your bottom, though. Yeah. They may also. So they say. So <laughs> <laughs> that live on the flat pitch. You're stupid. <laughs> Twenty eight ninety five. Beautiful, fabulous pink tourmaline. Absolutely superb. Great price point again. Yeah. Now I think I might be wrong. I think there's like one or two. I literally think there's one or two left. You having a nice time? It's lovely. <laughs> Does it feel weird being here, this side of the camera? Yeah. Does it? Yeah. In a it, good way? It's good. It's, it's quieter this side of the camera. <laughs> it's quieter this side. There's an awful lot going on behind the scenes. Oh, it's yeah. Just... Yeah, yeah. It's much more calm in yeah. here. Those are superb. I mean, firstly, the quality is, is, is knockout, but also to get them in cushions. Huge. The only other thing I've seen before, I think, it was almost like a, a, a two by one mil, almost micro facet. Oh, I think they're magical. I really do. Striking. Pardon, Michael? <laughs> Smooth cushions, huge pieces, graduated. So you could, if you wanted to work outwards, inwards, get pairs for the size-wise. In fact, you get one pair, two pair, three pair, four pairs, and, a, and one on its own, if you wanted to. But those two, I think, I don't know about you. Joe, but I'd, I'd almost think about. Ring. Would you think about going for rings yeah, with those? Because you you can look at it more. Yeah. When you, it's a necklace, you are either looking in a mirror. Exactly. Or you get someone else yeah. to wear it for you. Yeah, so exactly. You yeah, so you can it. actually. Yeah. The but with a ring, you can mm -hmm. just yeah, you yeah. can keep an eye on it yourself. Mm. Amazing, beautiful through light. Now, what price can you do, Becky? That's why there's only I think two left. One, two, one. I went to a concert last week. The bubble man himself, Michael Bublé. Nice. I spent fifteen pounds on parking. Michael, oh. <laughs> come in here and start saying sorry to me because you're in big fat trouble. You're in big fat trouble. <laughs> I paid fifteen pounds to pay and see Michael Bublé for three hours. Was it good? It was amazing. Well, it was amazing. That was a but treat fifteen to pounds yourself. parking. Yeah, it was. But that, that lasts longer. And it went off. Yeah. And you can get up close and personal. You can, I got up, I touched Are him. You, oh. oh, I touched him. Oh, OK then. And he threw me his sweaty towel. So the oh. woman next to me snatched it off me. Oh, she probably snatched it as well. should have had a proper fight for that. Well, she was in her 80s, so late 70s, 80s, I thought it would, it would have been be a bit rude. Rude. <laughs> really rude. Wrestle her to the I ground. Know, look, you, you can have it. If, you, if you're that bothered about it, you can have it. Fourteen ninety five. I'm way, way, way over allocated. Is there any left or have they gone? Have they gone? There is one left. There is what, Stephanie? Stephanie, one left my flower. Well done. Well done. <laughs> that serves you right, that so does. That's karma. So I, want something. <laughs> I thought you were going to burst into song as you come through the door. <laughs> Michael, you are going to come and sing to Joe. What? No need for that, is there? there? There's no need for that. Put him on the spot now. Showing off because it's because you're here. Showing off. Right then, how about we give you a lovely star bye? Michael, do you want to come and just come on? <laughs> come on. Oh. Come on. Oh, the pressure. Uh, no. Joe has asked, do you want to exit the show with it? So you've got time to prepare. <laughs> Damn, are you sing? No, no, what? She wants Michael. I've asked you twice. <laughs> <laughs> I'm here, but I've got a frog in my throat. Oh. And I'm a wolf. 
Talk about building. He's building. He's building up to it, isn't he, Joe? Yes. I mean, talk about milking it. He's enjoying it, really. Oh. Honestly, nobody has to ask him twice. Oh. You don't know what you've started, Joe. <laughs> you can hear all sorts of squealing going on in there. We have got red spinel. Do you know, everybody th a lot of people always thought for centuries and centuries and centuries that ruby was way rarer. That's why there was that big kerfuffle. Can you imagine having to be the person going to the Queen at the time and saying, uh, you know the great big massive ruby you've got in the Crown Jewels? Well, it's actually not. It's a spinel. And at the time, obviously, the Queen was mortified, thinking she got less than she thought. But the Black Prince's ruby, the red spinel, is um, hugely rarer than the ruby. So she should have been happy. Should have been. But she didn't know. Yeah. She didn't know. The master of disguise, the richest red that you could hope for in a, in a, in a gemstone. And that's natural as well, that colour there you see. Now, if you've got the 995 sterling silver popcorn slider bracelet, yeah, we went to 995, I know, on Simon's Picks earlier. And you've got that as your section within. Because again, spin out, eight on the most hardness scale. So again, ideal for a bracelet. Look at that. Striking, isn't it? It's gorgeous. Mm -hmm. Now, this is another Simon's. He might not be here. Now, somebody's just said, I'm switching off. Mike, Simon's gone. Thanks. We're still here. Yeah, thanks yeah. for that. But don't worry. Simon might not be here in person. But he's in here in spirit because he's left us some naughty prices we're allowed to do for you. Now, if we were here, he would say, right, I'm going to give you £20 off. Seven and a half carats of stunning, natural Burmese red spinel. So, best location for under £30. That's another steal. Brilliant. Mm -hmm. Mm hmm You got any red spinel? Not yet. I love that. Oh, look, you lot, are our kind of jewellery maker. Not I, yet. I've got a lot of black spinel now, and mm. it's stunning, but the red is beautiful colour. Yes. I just find it's one of the most, if you think there's everything from a pale pink, from Lucienne Spinel, every colour of crimson, every colour of pastel tone, then beautiful reds, all those purple as well, if you, gosh, if you ever get to get a purple Spinel, like a purple sapphire, oh, but then black, I mean, it's the most diver, and they're all natural. Yeah. All natural. Brilliant. That is, if, you, if you're like me and you adore red, because if you think there aren't many, what, Mongolian red andesine, red ruby... You got your red spinel. Think of anything else? Bright red? No, not bright red. Naturally? No. If you're lucky, no, a red diamond, but we're talking the rarest gemstone on the planet. So chances that. are, yeah. Yeah. Nah, yeah. Yeah, as the Forbes listing, the number one and, um, most rare gemstone. That's rarer than diamond. So that's oh, definitely gosh, what you yeah. want. Oh, yeah. Mm. Oh, yeah. Amazing. 29 95 Red spinel. 20, I know, no, we can quite get over the fact that it's gone under. So that's the £50 gemstone and we've taken £20 off it. Definitely one for the collection. Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm mm -hmm. Now, you just mentioned black spinel. I did. Oh, nice. Oh, oh. Yeah. Oh. Why do you like it? It's the sparkle it gives. Yes. It's amazing. Yeah, it is, isn't it? And even when you use it in the t tiny little faceted, it still yeah. pops and sparkle. Yeah. Always performs, doesn't it? Yeah. Black spinel does really, really glisten, doesn't it? Do you know what I've noticed as well is when you're out and about, this is one of those gemstones that always gets commented on and people ask what it is because it grabs people's attention, doesn't it? It catches mm. their eye. Do you find that? Yep. Yeah. I do. Yeah, well, the, the Labradorite yep. catches people's eye oh, and the black yeah. sparkle from, yeah. from there. And again, I just think when you've got a black spinel, especially even if you just make yourself one black spinel either... Uh, bracelet or stretch or whatever you want that now my friend wore hers out the other day that I'd made for her and It just kept catching my eye and I thought and I'm used to it I'm used to black spinel but I could, every time I looked at her and her wrist was flashing in the sunlight We went out for a we went out for we actually had a raspberry mojito and a lovely lunch very nice in the shop. I'm joining you next time for lunch. Oh, yeah, yeah. Uh -huh. As long as we're not buying chocolates. No, how's the Fraser we went for lunch? Oh. How's the Fraser? Nice. How's the Fraser for lunch? It's really nice. It's lovely. And, um, yes, and I couldn't tell my eyes off it. 
black spinel, faceted black spinel, big size. And again, look at that. No, no I keep, I, te I tell this story every time. My friend's my 40th. Mm -hmm. I was waiting for you to. No, I am 40, Joe. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> um, they put together anywhere near. I love you, Joe. Uh, they put they put together for my 40th for a charm bracelet from Thomas Sabo, and it wasn't a genuine gemstone. Other bracelets are available. Other manufacturers are available. And it was 90 pounds then, and that was eight years ago. 90 pounds, Joe. That's a tenner. Yeah, yeah, just have that, and that's better performing. Yep. I've never told them. Oh, I know. Can you imagine telling them that. No. Oh, gosh, no. Mm. So, rose quartz, rounds. Oh, they'd go nice with the um, spinel, wouldn't they? Which I would show you had Michael not snaffled them. But I can show you with the uh, amethyst. Pink and purple. That goes. It just works, doesn't it? Yep. Oh, yeah. And in fact, they'd go lovely with your kit with the um, seed beads. Yeah, I was just thinking and with that. The, and with your, yeah. um, both kits, actually. Both seed beads them. from the first kit with, and the green opal. And then with your amethyst dog tooth and the... Yep. Yeah? Yeah, lovely. lovely. So, rose quartz, in fact, I've also got them with peridot, which looks lovely. So, rose quartz and peridot. Another lovely fresh spring look, isn't it? Very nice. It's really spring, isn't it? It is, isn't it? Mm. Now then, that is brilliant. 5 95 10mm rounds of a genuine gemstone. Consistent 10mm beautiful rounds. Again, brilliantly uh, colour matched. Yeah, so it's a lovely size to use. Yeah. Yeah. It's just a simple necklace. Put a few, uh, even the little pink seed beads in between. Yeah, that would look really just pretty, nice wouldn't it? nice and simple. Mm. Lovely, you'd wear it a lot. Yeah. Really, really lovely. I'll say that on the neckline, actually. But yeah, like mm. you said, just in, just interspersing. Even if you, people say, oh, I don't really, I don't work with seed beads. Yeah, just that, use them as spaces. Exactly. It, it makes it... your beads go a little bit further. Mm. Kind of like, almost from a distance, like a pearl knot as well, can't it? Yeah. Mm. We go for a contrasting colour. And both of those colours in Joe's first kit that was under £20 and it got two size 11 O's would be perfect with those. Yeah, even the little bright red ones mm. in between. Yeah, really would look lovely. So, 5 95 for those rose quartz. There you go. Right then. Ooh, in fact, I'd put those with the rose quartz. In fact, I'm going to show you that. There you go, look. Nice. Yeah? Yeah. I love garnet. I was going to say, it looks like garnet to me. Mm -hmm. What's your yeah. birthday? Good question. Ah, what month are you then? September. You're, you're a sapphire. Right, I didn't want to get it wrong. <laughs> so you might want to go for those sapphires then that we had earlier, those yeah. yellow sapphires. That's it. It's your birthday. It's your birthday. So uh, lovely, rich, really rich purple, red garnets. Um, six mil round, so again, that wonderful size that we love. January's birthstone, what a great way to kickstart the year. Yeah, it's Kerry's birthstone, it's my birthstone, Linda's birthstone, Claire McDonald's birthstone, Elvis's birthstone, David Bowie's birthstone, Shirley Bassey's birthstone. That's all I can think of. That's all I can think of. That, that was good going. Yeah, no, thank you. Oh, oh, thank good. you. So, seven ninety-five on the garnets. Good price. I like those. They're lovely. Mm. Seven ninety-five. Seven ninety-five. Impressive, isn't it? You, do you do macrame? I do, yes. So it's, we like matching sizes in macrame, don't we? We do. Mm. And for um, just general seed bead work as well, it's easier mm. if your beads are the same size. Same size, yeah. It does make it easy. 7 pounds Brilliant, well done. Oh, the time. Doesn't it go quickly? <laughs> Doesn't Flying it go quickly? Gosh. It really does. Uh, let, ooh. Oh, I'd put those in the mood kite, you know. Yeah. I'd put, ooh. Yeah, lovely. Oh, and you had your bronze light in your kit. Yeah. Oh, they're yeah. cold. <laughs> Oof. 
Yeah, mix them up with the brown, yeah. uh, the rounds mm. I had earlier as well. Do you do that sometimes in joy? You go for a round and then a nugget. Yeah. Does, oh, you do? That no, doesn't worry you? I, I love mixing them all up. Do you? And the smoothing of facets together, obviously. Oh, no, that I do Because you like. want colours and textures mm. and yeah. the differences make the, each other, each gemstone stand yeah. out in their own right. Now, if you weren't watching earlier, can I just draw your attention to something that we did earlier? We had two brand new strands of textured shell pearls in like a milk chocolate colour. It's a new colour I've not seen before. Four mil, six mil, two brand new strands, 5.95 we went to for both of them. Now you can go back to jewelrymaker.com and have a look. Just click on today's products, scroll down a little bit. You can have a look at the Jewelry Maker app or you can just go to the bottom of the screen. The code is VQ. XC15 and just to reiterate two brand new color two brand new strands in this beautiful new chocolate tone textured as well there they are thank you Kerry love textured four and six mil and we went to 5.95 thanks to Simon yeah you mix those in with that with mm -hmm. the nuggets and you've mm -hmm. got the nice round and the texture exactly you've got the smoothness of the tumbles yep. it'd be a lovely combination yeah. do you know if you got that's what if you got those two strands of the textured shell pearl earlier, you got all of it for a tenner. £9.90. Bronzite nuggets, I mean they're big sizes, aren't they? Gorgeous. NYP017. If you got the two strands of your new chocolate textured shell pearl, four and six mil, brand new on the show today. VQXC15. Okay. VQXC15. Brilliant deal. So that was five ninety five for the two strands of the textured shell pearl, and that was three ninety five for the bronzite. That's like a that's like a fantastic three strand kit bundle stroke under ten, yeah. isn't it? Yeah, you get oh, a few bracelets yeah. out of it, wouldn't or you? A just decent necklace. Mm. Fantastic. That's lovely. Now, as amethyst is, um, you like your purples, I do. don't you? How about? that to go with your kit mm-mm mm -mm. yeah mm -hmm. nice bit of seed beading around it yes well like you've done with your design on yeah, your neckline like that. yeah it's very popular that's become hasn't it bezel setting with seed beads yeah yeah dog tooth again now in joe's kit we had dog tooth amethyst if i remember correctly in 12 mil rounds mm. yeah that would make a lovely it would wouldn't it i'll tell you what that with those. yeah here you go. That as the necklace yep. with that as your pendant. That's going to be perfect, isn't it? And maybe some seed beading to the mm. bezel. But again, those colours would be nice out the kit. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. Very beautifully together. Now, every single dog tooth amethyst, because of those white calcite chevrons that you get within the gemstone, will be unique. 40 mil by 30 mil, so it's a good size. Do you want to see it on the neckline? Should we do that? We'll try the balance, Oof. Joe. Well, hey. Hey. Well done. Thank you. Practised. Hannah Osborne outdid me with about 74 capuchons on her neckline. <laughs> Proper put me to shame, she did. <laughs> she did. This has been my party trick since day Aww. one, and Hannah Osborne obliterated my talent. I was wounded. Oh, I was wounded. You're going to have to do better now, then. Well, you know, I can give it, I'll give it that. I don't mind. PQGP82, dog tooth, amethyst, absolutely natural. And what the dog tooth gives, gives the amethyst personality, doesn't it? It does, and mm. they're all going to be unique with their different patternations yeah. and shapes. Yeah, and, and that's yeah. the beauty of making your own jewellery. It means that it's bespoke jewellery to you, isn't it? Yeah. And I think that's what... I don't think you can beat that feeling, do you? No, it's lovely. Yeah. Pick, pick and mix what you want yeah. to use. And that sense of achievement when you've made your own jewellery and you're proud of it, I just think mm. that's priceless. I really do. No, it's lovely. And yeah. when someone else comes along and uses their hard-earned money... Yeah. To buy something that you've, you've made. made, it makes yeah, you feel extra you special. Yeah, it you can't beat yeah. it, can you? No. It's a lovely feeling. Nobody pays for the jewellery I make. My friends just steal it off me. <laughs> That's still a compliment. They want your, what you've got. You've got I know, but they just go, taste. oh, I like that, and then it's gone. I'll never see it again. Oh, thanks. I've had it taken off my neck. Actually, off my wrist. <laughs> <laughs> you know, in the middle of a pub. Oh, I like that. Yeah. They've been known to take the whole suite, the earrings, the necklace, the bracelet. I'm like, really? I've had one person want to buy a pair of earrings that I was wearing. That you were actually wearing? I was actually wearing. I'm going, oh, I can't do that because I've worn them. <laughs> but, yeah, I've had that. They don't care, do they? No. 
They're just desperate for that particular pair of yeah, earrings. Yeah, yeah, it's a compliment. Why do you wouldn't bother me, somebody, somebody else's earrings? I wouldn't bother me. It probably wouldn't me, but when you sell... When you're you selling, don't, you don't want to do you that. You can't be doing yeah, that. No, I agree. Well... Ooh, cube tap. Oh, then. Oh, I like them. Oh, look at them. Ooh, Amazonite. Amazonite. Go nice with your top. Yeah. It's great colour, isn't it? It is. It's such a. I think it's quite a feisty colour. Fresh and. Tropical. Yes, tropical. Tropical feist. Yeah. yeah. Oh, you want to stick one of them umbrellas in you like you're having a cocktail, don't you? Like Del Boy used to have in Only Fools and Horses. He always wanted a brolly in it, didn't he? With about five different alcohols in. And... <laughs> And again, lovely and sparkly. Again, I'm going to say it with those seed beads in the in the kit earlier, just in between. It looked lovely. All that lovely chain design you did. You could still do that yeah. with a with cubes, couldn't you? Yeah. You'd, you'd have the drop of the chain with mm. you know semicircular, but yeah. with the cubes, so it was yeah. emphasised the cube. Yeah. The cube. Cube. We like to do cubes on a Tuesday. Cubes day. Cubes day. Mm. <laughs> cubes day. Um, so. Amazonite, six to nine mil. You <laughs> could up. I don't want to say it wrong, do you? Cube stay. No, probably so. not. Yeah, got it. Thank you. Twelve ninety five. Sparkly, lovely Amazonite. I do. Do you like the cube shapes? Yeah. Yeah, yeah I mean. it's good. It's, a, it's, it's mixing up the different mm. textures again and yeah. shapes. Now, Michael. Michael. Yeah. <laughs> There are minutes of the show left. You cannot leave our new guest designer wanting, surely. Oh, yeah. Mm. Come on. Come on. Stop oh. pretending you're busy. Come on. No, I'm busy. Come on. Okay. I'm not, I'm come, on. Come, on. come on. Come on, though. Why? Because. Oh, oh, you can see my hand. Here we go. Someday, when I'm awfully low, when the world is cold, I will feel a glow just thinking of you and the way you look tonight. Hey, that was for you, Joe. Thank you. Serenaded. Oh. We had to have him serenaded, didn't you? You're happy now. I'm happy now. That's it. Thank you, Michael. Thank you, Michael. Proper looked after you then, Joe. You now then, do you happen to know the birthstone month for this? I should do. No, you don't have to. It's gone do. straight out my head. Goes with your new black spinel, the red mm. spinel, because spinel got added August. That's right. Mhm. Mm so if you got that red spinel earlier, or you got the black spinel earlier, and you make those into a piece of jewellery with your peridot, it's still your August birthstone. Now, that only got added a couple of years ago by the Gemological Institute of America. So, um, yeah, you can keep all the designs. And I'm going to show you, actually, with, it, with the black spinel. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Let me show you black spinel with... Because that's... Both of those are August first, though. Look at that. It looks great, doesn't it? Black and green. That's that. striking. It is striking, isn't it? Oh, yeah. Now, would you fancy seven ninety five for the black spinel, uh, for the peridot, Michael? <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, <laughs> you can't get the stuff, can you, Joe? Hey, it's very professional. Oh. Yeah, oh, it's very professional. Very professional. Seven ninety five. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> He's trying to get rid of me quick so he doesn't have to sing again. Yeah, that's what it is. It is. It really is. Anyway, congratulations. Well done, my lovelies. Um, can I just say a massive thank you to you, Joe? Congratulations on your second thank show. You. Thank you very much. And thank you for being so patient because you, she's been lovely this evening. Um, when are you back on with us? 11th of June. Ooh, a late show again. Lovely. 11th of June. That's yes. not too long then. No, I've got my kits and I'm working away. Oh, well that, what day is that, the 11th of June? Can it's we think? It's a Tuesday. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Michael! Uh, 
Sorry. So our lovely Joe will be back with us on the Late Show on the 11th of June. So that's not too long to wait, is yeah. it? Oh my gosh, it's June on Saturday. I, I don't know where May went. I who knows where the rest of the year went. <laughs> Massive big thank you to my lovely Late Show crew as well. Thank you, team. Absolutely brilliant. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you to you most of all for watching. Take care, and I'll see you tomorrow night on the Late Show. Bye-bye.